yo, 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 yo. Iggity, biggity, Balsalini. You know what it is. Saturday Night Live. Tap in. <laughs> yo, yo, yo. Oh, shit. We getting it started off with a $20 super chat. What? What? Man, can I get going first, man? Shout out to Kings and Dreams. What Kings and Dreams say? Big up, big boss. Big up to the moderators and big up to the chat. Monday, we got some cooking for y'all on my channel. That's what's up. That's what's up. Yes, we do. Come this Monday, I'm going to be on Kings and Dreams channel. He's going to have a super panel with Flyboy Way and some other YouTubers. It's going to be about four or five of us, and we're really going to cook. That's what's up. Shout out to Kings and Dreams. Man, shout out to the room, man. What? OG Bobby Johnson. Welcome back, big boss. You know what to do. Salute to you. Man, thank you, thank you. Where you been, OG? You know what I'm saying? I've been back for a minute. I did a couple of lives. We were like, where's OG at? So, yeah, yeah, yeah. Much later on when I drop the link, I'm going to have to have my co-pilot come mess with me. But that's what it is, man. Felicia Jordan. Hello, everyone. Please wipe your feet as you enter the chat. Felicia Jordan. Thank you. Always on it, man. Always on it. HG chilling with the beaming eyes. What's up? What's up, man? What's going on? Jay Mees, what up, big boss? Oh, shit. Global paper, models and bottles, Brazil and die, investments and die. You, with your, uh, your shoe game is crazy, right? Shout out to Global Paper. That's what it is. Models and bottles for life. Man, so you guys got Big Boss back up in here, man. Shit, dude, it's it's a trip trying to get back, uh, trying to get back in the mix after taking um some time off, um, to Mexico to Lone Player to Carmen. Man, I didn't got back, man. Shit, man, I just kind of got into a, a little funk, but shit, I got I gotta I gotta break out of it. Gotta break out of it. Um, shit, because at the end of the day, boss is still a YouTuber, right? So content has to be made. Oh, yeah, y'all see it. Y'all see it. Content has to be made. But, yeah, man, shit. Uh, <laughs> I see, right? Had to get it in early, man. Hey, man, I'm, I'm going long enough. But, yeah, right on. Thank you for that, man. Yeah, you, you set the tone. Thank you for that. Yeah, man, Boss of Boss is back, man. Saturday night. Saturday night live. As you see, uh, don't really have a featured guest, but I do have somebody pulling up. Um, and they end up could have been my guest, but you know, they friend of the channel, they've been on here hella time, so that kind of wouldn't have been the same. Uh, he'll be pulling up in a minute, but uh, yeah, man, I just had to get back to it. You see, you notice it right now. Um, there's no uh Friday night tap in for the last couple Fridays, and it's probably going to be like that for a minute. Um, explanation transparency on that on my job uh which i still do my night job uh i normally have five nights off and i'm off friday saturday you know the player schedule i'm normally off friday saturday they got me working on friday so uh while i could kind of push the line and kind of sneak alive while, while on the job right but being the type of job i have sometimes it's uh it's chicken or feathers we can go by and not have no calls and i'm basically staring out the walls or whatnot you know just doing reports uh the patrol and other times we might get called call to service so uh it's kind of best if for right now while i'm on a friday schedule uh i'm just putting a friday night tap in so on the back on the back burner and i'm keeping a saturday night live so that's why i kind of call this live uh, this this one saturday night live slash tap in <laughs> yeah and also, I didn't really uh, secure a featured guest for this week. So, you know, guess who the guest is? Boss. <laughs> That's what it is, man. Shit. Oh, yeah. Um, yeah, so how, how everybody been? Hold on one sec. 
it's another thing when um uh, you take a while off i have to get back into the mix man i have to get back into the flow of things yeah I'm putting out some more content but i'm like damn it i got 115 116 videos there's other channels guys got thousands and thousands of subs and got 50 videos what the hell <laughs> i got 116 videos negro y'all can go back and well the new people can go back and watch watch my content man but yeah it's all about growth i gotta just keep putting out stuff keep putting out uh, content that's what it is oh we got kpr1 in the building what's good kenny king ken as y'all most y'all know he was uh he was my featured guest last week last saturday kpr1 kenny king can uh shout out to kpr1 yes sir so um shit. he's going to get it um man like i said man i just went live tonight because i haven't i hadn't put out really nothing this whole week i looked on my channel and i should have been surprised right because <laughs> i'm the one doing it i look on my channel the last thing i had was last saturday night live uh with kpr1 shout out to kpr1 that's the last thing was last saturday night and then tonight i like damn a whole week no content I said shit so I'm, I'm gonna hit it i'm gonna hit it hard this coming week um like i said though monday uh this coming monday i'm gonna be on kings for dreams channel i'm gonna be he's gonna have a super panel going on but uh outside of that um i'm gonna start putting content on the channel man a lot happening okay uh jay Mees, whatever happened to snug the brother was funny yeah well i pretty much know what happened man um i guess he probably felt the way i pressed him over the um situation uh with him and um clifton Clifton, the Egyptian Clifton, going places. Uh, he probably didn't like the way that I pressed him over that. But uh, hell, Clifton, he, you know, he made it public on the platform, so you know, I spoke on it. But you know, it is what it is. Snug, a good brother. If Snug ever watching or listening, just know it's all good. Um, Snug is always welcome back. Never had a problem with Snug. Um, yeah, he was funny though, man. He was too funny. Um, I think a good fun test would be. Guess would be yoga yoga <laughs> yeah shout out shout out to yoga yoga man yeah believe me I, I got i got some um some guests lined up and i got some big youtubers too lined up but one shit got to be spaced out and um mm -hmm. and then like I say the bigger the youtuber normally um the schedule is kind of funny and a lot, a lot of times the bigger youtubers it's kind of hard for me to get the big youtubers on on saturday night you know if i have a bigger youtuber much bigger than myself I normally got to bow down and um, just have them on like the weekend, like on a Tuesday or on Wednesday or some shit like that. You know, so it's kind of hard trying to nab the big YouTubers for the Saturday night. Um, but no, um, just know I got some heat. I, I got people lined up. It's uh, it's people in the queue, so they say, but trying to line everybody up for every single Saturday is just kind of hard. You know, it's kind of hard. So there's going to be some Saturdays where you're just only going to have the boss. You're going to have the bossy boss himself. And of course, I'll drop the link, and I'm, I'm gonna drop the link even here um, later later tonight. I'll probably do it earlier than I normally would since I'm rolling solo. But I do have somebody that's supposed to pull up though, um, so I do have somebody supposed to pull up. Mike S from Ohio, what up, boss? We like it live, and your WhatsApp group is off the chain. <laughs> hey man, and Snug was funny as hell, wasn't he? Snug was he was something else, man yeah uh shout out to you you made it into my whatsapp group um real talk big boss big boss real talk what what the hell is my i, I didn't had that i had that group for years uh, you know what the crazy part i should have started my youtube channel the same time i started my group and if i did that if i did that my channel probably had ten thousand people by now um yeah whatever you know, uh, my my whatsapp um channel is but yeah, I should I should have started I should have started my uh, YouTube my YouTube channel when I started my WhatsApp page. I started that back in 20, uh, 2019. But uh yeah, so this YouTube is like an expression of that. So that's what's up, man. Uh, KPR1. 
So, 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 um, without further ado, I have somebody that you guys probably never heard of before. He's brand new, he's brand new on YouTube. He's brand new. He's making his debut. You know what I'm saying? He's trying to get his subscribers up. Uh, he's almost at 2,000 subscribers. Put your hands together to ding, ding, ding. In this corner, Razor Ray in the building. Big Boss takes no loss. How the hell are you doing tonight? Woo! I'm doing fine, so I'm doing fine. Mm, uh, mm. Is it just me? Is this me or your arms get bigger and bigger? Every time I see your arms are getting bigger. My arms get bigger and bigger by the day. Inch yeah. by inch. Inch by inch. Yes, yes. That's what's up. Yes. Oh That's man, I got the I got the super genetics, big boss. But you know, I'm a genetic freak. <laughs> That's what's up. Uh, is this me? Yo, it seemed like, or maybe because I had my um, value down, it seemed like your volume was a little low. My volume was low. Let me see. Let me turn my my uh, Apple, my Apple, uh, what do you call it? Apple iPad up a bit. Let's see if that if that helps. See, like I oh, turn it down. Huh? What's going on? Let's see. Can you hear me now? Can you hear me? Yeah, now? yeah, I hear you. I hear you. <laughs> yes, sir. How you been, man? Not too good, big boys. Not too good. In this what? hood. In Not this too good. Hood. I can't, Not too can't good. be that great, big boss. Out here in the Matrix, aka USA, big boss. Uh man. You know, you know where I need to get back to, big boss. ASAP for me to be happy. Cartagena. Yeah. I'm, I'm gonna sip to that. I'm gonna sip to that because that just made me feel a little better. Yeah. So I'll drink to that, huh? <laughs> <laughs> I yeah. heard that. I heard oh, that. Oh, man. So how, how, how you doing, though, Big Boss? I said, let me pop on with Big Boss. It's been a while. So I right? said, you know what? I got to chop it up with the boss man. The you got to chop it up. You got to chop it up. Yeah. How, how y'all doing in the chat, guys? How y'all doing? It's good to be back on Real Talk. Man, you helped you help build up my channel, man. You you came on my channel when I had like two, three hundred subs. You helped build up my channel. Hey, Big Boss, it's your personality. You built up your own channel. You know, you got that Big Boss personality. If people wouldn't come to your channel if they didn't care what Big Boss had to say, you know? So you are the anchor of your own channel, man. Mm -hmm. But I'm glad that I helped you out a little bit. But, yeah, uh, you, you helped you help me out, man. You know, all the help in the background. Uh, you give me all the advice. So uh, shout out to you, man. Um, that's what, like I say, it inspired me to help other smaller channels, uh, smaller than me, you know, mm -hmm. to help get their weight up. Right, right. We all, can, we all can help each other. Oh, speaking of the devil, Clifton is going places. I just booked a flight to Bogota and Cartagena Friday morning. Woo! Okay. Woo! Okay. Why? Right. So oh. when, are, when are you going? You just booked it, but booked it for when? When are you going? When are you going to be out there? Wait for him. Global Paper, what's up, Razor? Good luck on the channel. Ha. What up, what up, Global? How the hell are you doing? I seen you up there on, in my chat the other day, Global. So salute to you for joining us. You know what I mean? Big boss in Oakland right now. I'm in this crazy Brooklyn right now. So no, we are just Oakland. counting down the days until our next trips. You know, you know, how was your last trip uh, in Mexico, Big Boss? Oh man! <laughs> oh man! We gonna get to it. Clifton uh, is going places. Gonna get my free yellow fever shot while I'm there. Yeah, they, they give you the yellow fever shot for free oh. in Colombia. So that's what's up. If you have, if you have to pay for it out here with no um insurance, the thing like three hundred some dollars. Then I won't be getting that shot. <laughs> you know. No, you know, no, I got I got some insurance, but make sure y'all insurance don't expire, guys. Because right. who wants to pay that? I'll fly to Bogota like like Clifton to get that shot for free. Right, right, right. That's the case. And, I, and I'll enjoy Santa Fe for a couple of days. Yeah, yeah. You, you would. You would. You well, well, you enjoy the prices. <laughs> I don't know what, I don't know how about myself, but you will enjoy the prices. No, no inflation yet, there, right? Not yet. 
Um, now I think they I think they were uh, resist uh, inflation resistant. Inflation resistant. Um, All right. I, I believe so. <laughs> yeah. Uh, Philippines is open. Uh, D Regalo. Philippines is open and they are waiting on you, brothers. Well, were they were they open for the vax? They you remember I'm I'm not vax man, so um, I'm of the unvax community, so I gotta wait. There's only so many places I can go. But there's enough there's enough places for you. That's that's good. I mean DR. Mm -hmm. and, I mean that's the main place, DR, you know, the Caribbean. Yeah. You gotta make that trip back out to Sasua, big boss. You gotta back, gotta go back to Sasua. Yeah, you you kinda right. But um <laughs> damn, I'm getting reports the boots on the ground. The boots on the ground that's in Sasua right now that said, man, it's not it's not sweet like that. The prices are crazy, just like I thought. Uh, well, you knew the prices were crazy the last time you was out there. When was the last time you was out there in the suit? Uh, mm -hmm. A year and a half ago now, time fly. Mm -hmm. 20, Halloween 2020. Damn, for real? It was Halloween, uh -huh. and it wasn't 21. It was Halloween 21, I was in Brazil. So Halloween 2020. Okay, so inflation was uh, up there when you went. Hell so yeah, thought, what? yeah, that was a whole year and a half ago. Imagine right, that. a whole year and a half ago. Yeah, so imagine now where we're, 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 uh, the prices are. Well, as far I, as everything, you know. Yeah, as far as everything. Shout yeah, out to J shout out to JJ with the quality. Woo! What up? What up, that, JJ? That, 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 that's your uh, that's your road dog. That's your other travel buddy. You and him be doing Cartagena, man. Yeah, uh, we had a great time in Cartagena that trip too. JJ, he was out there longer than me. He was out there for like. Three and a half weeks. For three weeks. Two. Yeah. Yeah. Exactly. Yeah. yeah. JJ, a real one. JJ will pull up on you, man. He pulled up on me in um in um Bogota. Um, he just he 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 literally just pulled up. All right, what the hell? Yeah. He said, Boss, where you at? I'm out here in Bogota, like for real. So shout out to JJ. JJ, a real one. Five dollars. <laughs> What up, Big Boss and Razor Rays? I see Big Boss on Sasua Beach in the near future. Yeah. <laughs> 2018 record? Oh, no. Yeah, you, you got jokes, JJ. That 2018 record will never be broken in no country. But not in that time span. But maybe Thailand. Hmm. Yeah, that, 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 20, that 23 and 10 days? No. No. I'm not Will Chamberlain no more. That was a one-time thing. <laughs> My first trip, I went crazy. Hey, let's ask you this, though. Since you, your, your choices are limited, where would you rather go back to? Mexico or Dominican Republic? Sasua? Which one? Out of those two? You know, you, you limited, big boss. Man, yeah, that's a rock in the hard place. Hey, where the vax again? Hey, where the vax at? <laughs> 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 Shit, Mexico had, me, <laughs> Mexico had me thinking about getting the vax. Damn, that's bad. <laughs> Mexico had boss thinking about getting the vax, reconsidering the vax. I said, What? Hey. Hell no. <laughs> Shit. Jay Mees, big boss. So you travel every two months, bro? Uh, used to be. I'm gonna have to, I'm gonna have to slow it down, put a drain. I ain't gonna lie, you know, I'm not rich, you know, I, it put a drain on the nigga pockets. I, I, I looked at my past like two years of travel. <laughs> it put a drain on my pocket, so I'm, I'm, I'm gonna have to put some more space in between it. But yeah, about about uh, that's I was going like every two months, two and a half months, about every two and a half months. I was going somewhere. I'm gonna have to slow that down until the YouTube money kick in. Yeah, until you get up to checking effect numbers. You know what I mean? You get that that, that hundred thousand subs. I can't wait that long, but uh, yeah, but at least so I get uh, some more. But yeah, um, I was going about every about every two or three months, man. But when you do that back to back to back, it put a dent in your pocket, man. It will put a dent in your pocket. So oh yeah, also have to back up off of that. And that's why I'm tripping. Say like, damn, in that last trip I took. But you know, if it wasn't for the collab with Flyboy, that trip would have been a bust. Mm -hmm. Well, yeah, the Flyboy Wade. Shout out to Flyboy Wade. He be hitting me up on Instagram. He trying to give me some uh, advice in this YouTube travel game. So that's what's uh, shout out to him. You know, uh, he's real cool, man. Cool guy. He's real cool. Yeah, yeah. So that was cool. Yeah, I saw, I saw y'all. I saw y'all live out there in Mexico. Yeah. 
you know, but, uh, you know, you going out with, with him was worth it as far as, you know, YouTube business. So, uh, but you're saying as far as a, 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 a traveler, just a regular traveler, without the YouTube in mind, it's a no-no for you. Yeah, yeah, yeah. How, yeah. Like, Hold on. Yeah. Yeah. Oh, uh, I'm almost up to four dollars on my channel. What do you, What do you mean? You You're not monetized, are you? Mm. Are you is going places. You got You got a channel. Clifton is going. That, so all right, he has a channel. Let me see. Yeah, yeah. Clifton, he has two. So this right here is his channel. Okay, Clifton let me see. Places. Let me when bring he's on the other one. The Clifton is his regular. Subscribe. Let me subscribe yeah. to you, Clifton. I know. I know you, Clifton. Yeah, uh, Clifton is cool. Yeah, he told me um, this is just going to be his channel. He said he's up to four dollars. Yeah, um, my little money. They were talking about I was only uh, like had like six hundred dollars. I said, man, I get I had more than that in super chats. What the hell? Let's see. Uh, Nick Dog four hundred. Get the shot, boss. <laughs> we need you in the streets regulating. Damn. Dad, you trying to get me to get the shot. Get the shotty shot. That's what's up. 33 in the building. 33 in the chat. Right. I got you, Clifton. I just I just saw Cliff. Clifton is going places. He got the 110 Library Art Museum in Botanical Garden. Oh, uh, that's where? What's that? You in New York? <laughs> oh, 110 Library. 110 New York. 110 Li he got a, He got some Matrix stuff up here. But all right. I'll check you out. I'll check you out, Clifton. Clifton is going places, huh? Um, you might as well put some of those Matrix uh, chicks up there, Clifton, since you're going to be in the Matrix, a.k.a. USA. <laughs> put some of them, the Matrix beauties. Just don't let them talk. Yeah. Just don't let them talk. We don't, don't let them talk. That's going to kill, you kill your views and retention. Oh, Barber World is live right now? Barber World always got cuties, man. He always <laughs> got... Hey, we about to shut down. We about to go over to Barber World. <laughs> I know Barbara right. was live earlier today. So he's back on live? Yeah, I guess. Yeah, he always got the cuties, man. Hola, Felicia. Hola. Thanks for coming oh, on my channel, Felicia. Oh, shit. Clifton, man, you got, you got 5,000 subscribers already? When did you start your channel? Mm. Okay, he started it a while ago. 20, uh, 20. Wow, that's what's up. Let me subscribe. Let me subscribe yeah. right here. That's <laughs> what's up. Wow. Mm -hmm. how, many, how many videos you got? So he got 5,000 subscribers with about 20, 20 videos. Mm -hmm. One, two, three, four, five, six, 18, 18. Okay, with 22 videos. That's what's up, man. Shout out to you. Man, look at Clifton, man. Mm -hmm. He got more than me. He got more than me and you put together. That's what's up. That's because he got more friends than us. Yeah. <laughs> he, he got not. more friends. He got more Facebook friends. You know what? I gotta start getting my Facebook friends to subscribe to my channel. I'm gonna right. start. I'm gonna start putting my YouTube videos on my Facebook and tell all my Facebook friends. I don't know how I have so many Facebook friends. Did you got like but, a thousand? Yeah, 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 you know, I've been on Facebook for like since like 2008. Right. So, they piled up. I'm gonna tell all of them to subscribe to the channel. <laughs> right. Okay, here we go. Long story. I explain one day, boss. All right. All right. Clifton. Is it isn't Clifton in the group? Didn't I add him to the group not too long ago? I just, I just remember that name, Clifton. I remember the name from this channel. He always up here. He might be in the group. He might be in the group. Because guys got different names. You know, they can hit me up under different names or like. You know, they be like, hey, I would just show your video. Or this right, right, What's right. your name on YouTube? You know what I mean? I know I added Mike S. I added Mike S. Mm -hmm. I added Kings and Dreams. I think I added Clifton a while back. Clifton, are you in my WhatsApp group? But uh, Milano, the travel vlog. Big Boss and Razor Rays. What up? What up? Milano, the travel vlogger. <laughs> Milano, the travel vlogger. Yeah, but you got to bring that fire, Milano, when you, when you abroad. When you over there in uh, we gonna be in what you said Ecuador? Yeah, he's going right? soon, right? I believe he said Ecuador. It was like Honduras or Ecuador. I think it was Ecuador. Hmm. You got green on beauties, Mulano. Don't let us down. That's what's up. If you like to support the channel, hit up Big Boss Cash 
at Velsarm777 or Super Chat. Yeah. Uh, uh, that's right. Rob Brazil. Shout out to Rob Brazil. He got the got the uh the vaccine needle and he has the E D three. Oh, so that's Rob Brazil. Okay. That's Rob, that's, that's See, Rob I would have never known. If he had popped on my channel, I would have never known. You would have never known that's Rob Brazil. Yeah, that's a trip. Yeah, people be having different um screen names. It's Jay Clyde. Shout out to Jay Clyde, man. Man, I've been um following Jay Clyde on Instagram. Jay Clyde be going everywhere, man. This man, he he he's very uh photogenic. You know, is you a model, man? Jay Clyde, Jay Clyde is a model, man. Yo, <laughs> he's I, very I photogenic and he be taking photos yeah. uh, all next to uh you know monuments and stuff like that. Shout out to Jay Clyde, man. He got Jay a nice Clyde. channel. He got a nice channel. He got some Medellin content up there. He got some uh I think Brazil content. Yeah, mm -hmm. some uh some drone footage or helicopter footage that right. I seen. I was like, wow, this is this is nice, you know. I didn't know, I didn't even know he had a channel. Oh, a channel, mean? channel? I'm talking about I'm talking about Instagram. Oh, it's Instagram. So he, he even That's what I was talking Instagram. about. He got a he YouTube. Got, he got a YouTube. Yeah, he got a YouTube. Jay Clyde, you got a YouTube, Jay Clyde. What's the name? Type the name in. I'm gonna go it's, to it. It's Jay Clyde. That's the name. That's the name. I just happened to see it yesterday. Me and Jay. Right. Yeah. Here we, we go. We, we was looking at we was looking for beauties and we was looking for uh, uh Brazil content and he, and he popped up and like wait a minute that's Jay Clyde from the group oh, uh, okay. it's Jay is it all together Jay Clyde uh yeah you can uh separate oh well it might come up you might have put Brazil after it yeah maybe I put it put it together it's it all one word I mean what no uh, what. I just put Jay Clyde. He was on Barber World's. He was he was being interviewed by Barber World, I believe, the other day. Too. Okay, man. Or one of these. What's going on here? Or Philly Dome. It was Barber World, Philly Dome. I don't know. I'm getting I'm getting the YouTubers mixed up. I don't know what's going on. Okay, you got Jay Clyde. You, hey, did he got a channel? You got a channel, Jay Clyde, or what, man? Yeah, it's called It's Jay Clyde. Hold on. Matter of fact, I think, I think it was Barber World. I think it was Barber. I think he was getting interviewed by Barber World. So okay. J. Clyde 81. It's J. Clyde 81. Right on. Thank you, uh, T. Love. What up? What up? What up, love? What up, love? Entertainment? I'm going to start handing out some riches soon for my channel. And yeah. You, 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 have, you, have, you have no moderators, huh? Nah, I'll be just going, I'll be just going raw dog. Big boss, <laughs> I'm a raw dog. Big boss, you know, I'm like, come on, bring it, troll. Let's go. Let's 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 box. Yo. This is it, man. Okay, well, hey, this is gonna be the last time, man. All right, there you go. Right. Yeah, Brazil. Yeah, he got some quality videos. So, eight fifty one. Okay, you're gonna have eight fifty two. Woo. I'm not gonna hit the you bell. Promote, Jay Clyde. You gotta promote. You gotta, you gotta get promote. Like, I'm impressed by you. You see, you see. Hey, I'm number 852. Always remember that. Big Boss 852. That's what's up. Oh, wow. Look at this guy. Yeah, look at that. I was like, what? Okay. The hell? okay. National Star Trek. He got some stuff. Okay. He got nice scenes, nice, nice views of the of the uh of the cities, you know, from the helicopter or the drone, you know. So basically the whole page is like re like Brazil. It's like Brazil. Brazil and I believe he got Medellin also. Oh eight. Okay. That's what's up, man. Look at you, man. Look at you guys, man. You gotta promote, bro. That's what's up. Make sure y'all go. I know it's is hell it was kind of a hell for me to type it. It's J Clyde. <laughs> I put 81 and it came up. I don't know, but that's what it is. You gotta make it friendly. Like technically, I should probably make my name like easier, you know. No, find. big boss is what's, what's wrong with big boss? Big boss is good. Big boss is good. You know, and hey, I'm gonna tell you, somebody said the same thing about uh what's that Kings of Dreams? He needs uh, TMI Santiago. He was like, shout out to you, TMI Santiago. He was like Kings of Dreams should make his names a little e easier because he can't search it and find it when he was trying to use it on my live. Mm -hmm. And I was like, wait a minute. I had a hard time spelling check in effect for a long time. I'm like, and that check in right. effect, I'm like, and this <laughs> when he had like 7,000 subs. I'm like, hey, check. You got it. 
I'm thinking check got to change his name because I'm like, it's I mean, I, I can people figure out how to spell the check part. People See, finding it now. It, he got 100,000 subs. Man. So I'm like, when, hey, when he came on my that, channel, he had 68, 68.5. Yeah. When he came on my channel, he had 68. Mm -hmm. And I was saying, you about to hit 70K. And um, yeah, and that was like a little over a month ago now, like what, five or six weeks. Dang. Woo! You hit that algorithm, it's over, big boss. Hit that algorithm, it's over. Yeah, when, once you hit it, once you kind of hit it and take off, like fish grease. <laughs> Shout yeah. out to Check in Effect. Yeah, so you say like some of these names, man, people need to streamline it with shit. I mean, once, once, once you get it, you get it. Big boss, your name is the easiest name on YouTube. <laughs> People can spell big and boss. I hope. I hope. <laughs> but, then, but yeah, but then it has to be big boss real talk. You know, uh, you know like, hey, as you're going up in the algorithm, they're going to just start putting you up there. You know? Exactly. And that's what it is with the algorithm. You you probably, the algorithm I think you probably need the real too. talk. You need the real talk part because... There's probably some other big boss people on. Well, there is, we know. So the, Barry, the shout out, the shout out to boss. Barry. Yeah, Even though I don't think he do. He call himself, yeah, he do call himself Big Boss, huh? Yeah, I know he calls himself Boss, yeah. huh? Club Fillers, right? He's about back. Club Fillers, yeah, Club Fillers. Fillers. Yeah, he called himself Big Boss, right? Yeah, yeah, that's his nickname. Yeah, but he don't really use it much. But they call him that in the in the, in the chat and stuff. Right, and I know he he has a hat, and it says. uh I'm yeah, the boss yeah, on it. Yeah. Right. He's good. He's good at what he do, though. He's good. He's yeah, good. yeah. He's good. He's good. He's good. He's good too. Yeah, I've been following him for a while. You see, I got this shirt, man. I'm tripping on this shirt. Uh, it's good oh. quality, but it keeps like kind of crinkling up. You Yo, know, look at that. Cool. I didn't see that before. Big oh, boss. you didn't? You didn't? You got that on Teespring? Yeah, I got an yeah. old one from Teespring. <laughs> yeah, I got I got a hoodie too. Yeah, big boss. Hold on. Where oh, my hoodie oh, yeah. at? Big Boss got that merchandise. He's merchandising. Yeah, I'm not. I don't have it like open to the public. I don't have it open to the public yet. I should, but yeah, it's, this is the hoodie. The hoodie. Yeah. For the hood. Yeah. It's All thick right. too. It's good quality. This thing is thick like a blanket. Hella thick. Okay. Okay. Good quality. Yeah, man. yeah. All right. Yeah, that's what's up, Big Boss. Yeah. So about to become a merchandising uh, king out here uh, on his YouTube streets. So, so in all transparency, uh, I did it like early, like weeks and weeks, uh, way before the Mexico trip, and mm -hmm. I wanted, to, I wanted to have it in time for the uh, Mexico trip with Flyboy, and they said it was going to arrive like, a few days after I left, and sure oh. enough, it did. When I got back from the trip, the package was here. I was like, man. Oh, after the trip, yeah, yeah, after the trip. But that's what it is. Man. No, well, you gonna wear that in Sasua when you go. Uh, well, I don't know. probably not the hoodie. <laughs> well, yeah, I might wear the hoodie on a flight. But this thing, this thing, I'm just tripping. This thing is real thick, so it's not cheap at all. Mm -hmm. They use some good quality. Mm. And on my shirt, my shirt is cool, but it is crinkle. I see it is kind of crinkles on camera. I don't like that, but it is what it is. That's okay. Nah, that's all right. Nobody paying no attention to that, big boss. Yeah. Now they are because you said it. Well, yeah. yeah. Now they all gonna be painting. Now they are because I said it, huh? <laughs> I gotta keep kind of straightening it out. My bald head. Uh, uh, all right, that's legit, man. That's legit. Yeah. That right is on. legit. Yeah. Right on, right you on. Above, you got that. Okay. All right. Uh Felicia said, I need a hoodie. It's supposed to... man. Okay, you know what? I'm gonna send Felicia. I'm gonna send you a hoodie. Yeah, hey, send her, send her. She's a she's a great supporter of yeah, she's, yeah, a lot she, of YouTubers. Yeah. Yes, yeah, she she moderates for free. So my moderator is gonna get a hoodie. Oh shit, I should have said I'm about to break myself now. <laughs> hey Felicia Jordan, send me um you you know my um my Instagram, Big Boss Go 777. Send me your side. This is a 2X. And for me, like if I put this on, <laughs> like, hold on. Is it yeah? I know the shirt is 2X. What is this? Uh, this is probably awesome. Is it two or three? I wanted it bigger, so. No, it's two. It's two, it's two X. And for me, six, six, two, 260 pounds. <laughs> wow, burn up in this thing, boy. 
this would be perfect for, if I'm on a flight. This is the first yeah. time I put this, put this on. I haven't put this on yet. Oh, look, I can it. It look like, like I'm ready to fight. Like I'm coming out on the road. All right. Yeah. There you go. Big boys. Promote. Promote. Promote, huh? Next week on Teespring. Yeah, next week on Teespring. <laughs> Yes, and Felicia Jordan, Felicia Jordan, salute to you, Felicia. And uh, in advance, Felicia, I apologize for my Matrix female hating. Because, you know, I see you on my lives. And, and <laughs> don't take it personal. You she know, know what it is. Me and my, me, you, and, you and my mama, you know, don't take it personal. I'm just, you know, you know, just having some fun. So salute to you, Felicia. <laughs> Shout out to Felicia, man. She know what it is. She know it's all love. Oh. We, we, when we talk about Matrix females, we're not talking about the ones like, yeah. uh, like Felicia. We're not talking, yeah. We're not no. talking about Felicia, John. No, yeah. we're not. The Matrix females, they all, they all need to, uh, to take notes from Felicia Jordan. Yes, yes. Learn, watch and learn. Watch and learn. I'm gonna burn up in this damn thing under these lights. <laughs> this thing is thick. I probably not. I think about it. it's not tight, but I probably could have went with a three X. Oh, let me. See. What 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 size is that? Two. That's a two X. So you say you wanted a little little more baggy, a little more. Yeah, I'm I'm thinking. Let me see. Uh, well, show your muscle. Huh? Yeah. You start doing some start, start doing some curls and making a muscle shirt, a muscle type shirt. Yeah. I know, huh? Yeah. Don't get it too baggy. Then you get you be getting stopped by the cops out there. You like, hey, <laughs> get off! What are you doing? Right. What are you doing, suspect? I need a hoodie <laughs> on this. I'll pay. Send me the link to the panel. Uh, Who's look that? You. All right. You you think you think one uh, Kings of Dreams, man? Oh, Kings of Dreams. That's come right. on. Uh, no, oh, shout God. out to you, Kings of Dreams. But uh, he come on, man. You think you up, think right? one X Kings of Dreams? Then you need two X, right? At least. <laughs> 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 shout out to Kings of Dreams, man. <laughs> <laughs> this is. This is 2X, and you see how it is on me. It's not tight. It's cool. You know what I'm saying? I feel like a boxer. I'm a little child. Oh, that's a good one. That's a good one. That's a good one. Don't be offended. Uh, Kimbo Splice. Remember him? <laughs> <laughs> hey, I ain't mad at you. And you ain't the first one to say that either. <laughs> Kimbo Slice. Shout out to Kimbo Slice, man. Yeah, I was... Uh, yeah, well, you know we ain't talking about you, Felicia. It's all love, man. It's all love with Felicia Jordan, first lady of the Manosphere Chats, man. Uh, yeah, I'm lit. I got Razor Ray. Razor Ray came in to help Bossy Boss. I was by myself tonight. Yeah, I said, what's going on? I said, Saturday night. I said, where's your feature guest, Big Boss? That's not like Big Boss not to have a feature guest on Saturday night. Saturday? I know, right? Like y'all gave me a pass. Y'all gave me a pass when I was on um uh, in Mexico when I did that five hour that five hour rant in Mexico because I was by myself. <laughs> but I'm back in Oakland in the studio and no guests. No guests. Hey man, you slipping, big boss. You slipping. Don't hey. let it happen to your big boss. Where, hey. Where, like, where's Dream C V or Big Boss Saturday Night Live? Where's hey, play, players where's fuck up, man. Wait, wait, wait. What is this? What is this? Hey. This can't be happening. So I said, hey. I got and, with no Friday, and with no Friday night tap in, no Friday night tap in. I said, no. come in on a Saturday with no guests. After nah. a whole week of no content. Damn. I said, no, 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 happening, no. Big boss, real talk. That can't, that can't be. I said, I, that can't be. I must step in. I must holler. And I will be big bosses. Champion. Yes, will be my champion. <laughs> okay. So King of Dreams said I'm wearing a one X right now. Okay. One yeah, X? This, this is a two X, and it's it's kind of baggy. I'm six two <laughs> two sixty. So, uh, Ray, how much do you weigh? Are you about right, 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 no, no. Right now, about two eleven. Right now, that is crazy. I lost, I lost you, some weight because you ain't got no fat on you. I, mean, I lost some weight. Yeah, I lost some weight over the over the past year. But uh, yeah, because I'm not really supplementing and taking in the hardcore like uh weight gainers and stuff. Crazy. I'm not doing all that. So so I I can get up to like two twenty five, two thirty. Yeah. But uh, yeah. So but it's I, I, you know it's okay. It's all good. Because I want to get I want to get down to two and a quarter. Because I'm two sixty mm. now. I want to get down to a okay. quarter, two twenty, 
minimal. I, I can't I can't do no two eleven no one ninety five. That boss ain't that type of nigga. I got like two twenty two and a quarter. Yeah, you might have took that. They're still thinking you think you would be getting higher side. Like, hey, yeah, yeah. And boss can oh, crack. Boss. He is out there in Oakland. Need some help. He is out there in Oakland. He on. Crack. <laughs> That's why he ain't got no guests. That's why he ain't put no videos out. <laughs> yeah, you're right. I do. I do. I need to hit the gym. I mean, you're right, 100%, man. Hey, that gym, you know. You ain't, you ain't said nothing but a word. I ain't offended because you right. You 100% right. I do. I need to. Shit. 100, jump, 100 jumping jacks when you wake up, big boss. 100, 100 jumping jacks? 100, yeah, before you go to work. Before you have to shower. Yeah, yeah, yeah. 100 jumping jacks. Start out. And how many push-ups? Push push how many push-ups? Push huh? I don't know. You know, I don't know how many you do, but five, <laughs> five, five to ten. Just start. I don't want to put pressure on you. Five to ten push-ups. Five, five, five to ten? What do you think? I'm a girl? <laughs> <laughs> hey, hey, five hey, hey, push hey, damn the disrespect on Boston. No, I, mean, I, I don't I don't want you to overdo it. That's what I'm saying. I, you know, oh, sometimes shit. I think they can do more than they can. They go down and get up to three and they're like, oh I, they can't get back up, you know. Mm. I'm not saying I mean I, I don't I don't want to put pressure on you. you know wow. Uh, uh, Apex traveling. I'm 5'11, 295. Yeah, you you a big one, buddy. You at two ninety five? Yeah, you're a big one, bro. Oh, five, up oh, five, two ninety four. Oh, yeah, yeah, you're a big one. And we got to hit the gym together. Hey, the higher uh, pay raise, raise to be your uh, your uh, personal trainer. A virtual yeah, I, might, I might have to start trainer. with some virtual training. How about that? Virtual training. I might yeah, that's 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 no, for real. Like, like for real though. Yeah, virtual. I pay, I pay you a couple bucks a month. You know, to help virtual you train, right? Virtual. I say, see how say, that give up. me five more. Give me five more, big boss. Five more. <laughs> yeah, I'm turning the phone off. <laughs> <laughs> oh shit. That's what's up, man. Get your money, black man. 225. That's like standing sharp size. Yeah, exactly. That 225. Two and a quarter. Two and a quarter. Maybe like like 215, the minimal. Minimal 215. But yeah, yeah, yeah. Because you gotta start. If you drop too low, you start looking different to people that know you, and then they're gonna be start saying, "Oh, you sick and this and that," and they make you uh, feel bad. You know what I mean? Yeah. Then they make you feel bad. They mess up your whole day. No nah, <laughs> man. Hey, you, you okay, big boss? Are you okay? Hey yes, man. Yes, I lost all this weight. Yeah, we oh, know what you okay? been doing. Do you need to go into NA? <laughs> yeah, man. <laughs> Shout out to JJ. I I'm gonna see a chica leave boss early in the morning with boss sweater on. <laughs> what are you talking about, man? She don't get a boss sweater. Only person gonna get a boss sweater right now is Felicia Jordan on on me. <laughs> and um, uh, I'm gonna send uh, I'm gonna send a link to uh you kings and dreams. Then this big boss not gonna see her leave. That's the thing. She's gonna sneak out the room. Oh, <laughs> with my sweater. Oh, oh man. man. Yeah. Wait, wait, man. Tell you this thing is thick, boy. Matter of fact, I'm gonna take it off. It's, I'm getting hot. But well, you got the T-shirt right underneath, so yeah. yeah. I didn't, I didn't, I didn't think uh, the uh, hoodie was going to be this good of quality. So they did a good, they did a good job. This thing is thick like a blanket. You can kind of see, it's hella thick. Uh huh. Yeah. So that'd be good for like you on a flight, you on a um, long old flights, and it'd be kind of cold. You know, they had yeah. little thin little blanket, the little blue blanket, the little blue thin little blankets on the yeah, overnight. I never got one of those blankets, but yeah, yeah I know you never got me. Yeah. You don't feel you don't be flying that far. That's why your ass only go to DR for two, three hours. <laughs> you never been to the southeast Asia. Yeah, no, like when they're going there, I guess when I be going to the Brazil shits, they be uh giving you the little blue, little they always blue. They oh, same in Brazil. Like, okay. Hot okay. Blanket, they blue and they're kind of small, and they give it to you in the little I, I think they get a little pillow. How they give no damn pillow? No pillow though. You got Oh, shout out to OW. Woo! I see. Oh, Dub, yeah, I'm a, man. Somebody uh, was almost going to be my guest for tonight. If they learn how to call somebody back, we ain't going to say who they are. <laughs> oh, W with the $5 shout out. Salute, salute, salute to the panel. Start slow and watch them grow. You talking about the arms? You talking about the arms? Or are you talking about my subscribers? Probably both. Hey, that, that goes for both the arms and the subs. The arms and the subs, huh? Start slow and watch them grow. Yeah, salute, salute, OW. Right, so yeah, me, me and Kings of Dream, we about the same. I'm 6'2", 
I'm too. I, if I weigh myself, I, I'm probably creeped up. I might be two sixty five ish. Um, okay. Okay. Yeah, I might be two sixty five ish, but yeah, I'm in the two sixties. Let's just say that. Ooh, I don't think I, I don't think I creeped over the two seventy yet. I don't think. Uh, six, oh, I used to be though. Okay. My, my highest I ever was was like two nine. I was like two eighty. I used to be two eighty nine. Okay. Yeah. All right. Well, you know what? And for your health reasons, as you get older, you're gonna have to lose that weight. Yeah, because it's more pressure on the heart. Yeah. Yeah. You're gonna have to lose that weight. Yeah. Uh, Apex Traveler, I'll be in Sasua April 9th. I'll be there for 45 days. Damn, you guys. Trips. Apex. Apex. Yeah, you stay there, you stay there long enough, you get good prices. <laughs> <laughs> the longer you stay, the longer you stay, the price comes down. They come down, Apex. What up? What mm -hmm. up? We, all right. You gonna be, where you going to be at? Europa? What you got? Airbnb? You don't got, you don't got to say where exactly you're going to be at. But, uh. All right, salute, salute in the soup. In the soup. Ooh. Yeah, boss. Like you say, I ain't got too many options, right? Got no beggars can't be choosers, baby. You gonna have to join Apex in the soup. Damn, in the soup. Say it ain't so, man. Say it ain't so. You gonna have to chill in the Omni. You gonna have to be in the Omni. Oh the Matrix, no, so. with the KOD. The KOD chicks. Boss gotta be with the boss. KOD. The, the Matrix booty shakers. Oh no. Yeah. You gonna have to be with peaches and, and mo. Monisha, diamond, and diamond, uh, yeah, diamond. Pizza, <laughs> sapphire. What it? What? Why they all? Uh, and brandy? Uh, or no? Uh, Hennessy. <laughs> Hennessy. <laughs> they named after drinks and named after. Uh, oh, uh, man, stone. Yeah. <laughs> wow, Clifton going places. To Egypt, they gave me a pillow, blanket, socks, toothbrush, gloves. Not. They gave you socks and gloves. They socks, so? They give you socks. <laughs> a Hold toothbrush? On. See, this is why. Wow. So you know boss boss ain't been, been um in the mix. <laughs> you know what I'm looking for. You know what I'm looking for too. Oh, the infinity stone? Well, no, I ain't looking for the infinity stone right here. I ain't looking for the infinity stone. I'm looking for the capstone. What you, you lucky I don't know. I, dang, you lucky I don't know where the capstone is. They gave you socks. What, what airline was this, Clifton, going places? Where airline gave you socks? Come on, man. Come on, man. Buck travel. I feel a giant when I travel to these countries. Right? Don't you? Man. He said, I feel like a giant when I travel to some of these countries. Yeah, a lot of these countries, the people ain't big. Depends I don't know if they country. Huh? <laughs> You go to South America, yeah. You feel yeah. you feel tall. You go to Germany, you go over there, to Germany, and big old white boys. Hey, now you feel ah. short. <laughs> <laughs> dog comrade. <laughs> <laughs> two hundred five, best way for cardio. <laughs> okay, two hundred five. Oh, what? Probably you said that's a, it depends on cardio. your height. Oh, it depends on your height. So oh, for, yeah, yeah. for a six foot man, they say not six two, six three, five ten. For a right. six foot man, what is the ideal weight for a six foot man? Strength, cardio, speed. Probably lower. Still probably lower. You know, a lot of times we as men, really black men, we want to err on the side. You know, a bulk. Yeah. For like armor, it's like armor and protection because right. we be thinking about physical safety and stuff like that. So sometimes we do go a little overboard. I can admit. And sometimes it don't take all that. Nah. QB Passport Flexing. What's what up? up? Yo, yo, yo. Hey, man, QB Passport Flexing. I just want you to know it's all about game, man. You got to have your game. Your game got to be on point, man. Game, game, game. <laughs> oh, shit. What's goody? Yes, sir. Uh, Apex, I stay for five months for this trip. I'm not smashing every day, though, right? Yeah, Something no, you like can't. That. You're right, do it like that. It's ways to do it. It's ways to do it. If you do that, you, you'll be you'll be calling us. <laughs> you'll be calling us through uh the, the, the cash app. Hey, raise your raise. You got cash app? Uh, <laughs> <laughs> can, can you see some 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 dollars? You know, you know, you know. But uh, yeah, you can't you can't do it every day, Apex. So you know you got the format. You know what's going on, right? You know you know what's going on. 
Shit, them cheap, them cheap good prices gonna make they gonna make you just enjoy the country and the culture and the food. <laughs> yeah, yeah, <laughs> yeah, yeah. I, I be on that beach all day. Like yeah, it's, it's slow you down. Day. Say, man, let me let me stop to smell the roses and just <laughs> contemplate on life. Yeah, I just sit on that beach all day, just looking up in the sky. Just, right. You know. <laughs> I'm saying that's why that 2018, the 2018 numbers went with the the 2018 numbers. Went with the 2018 prices. Things so, are not the way they were before, guys. Exactly. So with them prices, it hit in the hell. No, I couldn't hit them. But no. big boy, I'll tell you. What's up? 2012, 13, Ooh. 14, even 15. Ooh, so you would have loved it. You would have said, This is the, this is heaven and earth. This place I want to live here forever. because of the prices. Trust me. Point. Trust me. I believe you. You think it, it wasn't. All right, it wasn't Bogota level pricing, but it was fair. It was fair. One thousand. I know it's one thousand. You know, you know one thousand yeah, was, yeah. was average. Yeah, because so when I got into the travel groups, I got into the travel groups like a whole full year, like a year and some change mm -hmm. before my first trip. And I said this before, and I say it again: the phenomenon I witnessed in the travel group, right? Because God, you know, in the groups, as you know, guys are always going. And it's almost like you're there, right? Somebody there, somebody leaving, whatever. So while I was there, I mean, while I'm in a group watching other people's trips, I'm watching the prices. The prices are going higher, like month by month. It's, it's, right. it, was, it was the weirdest shit. The weirdest month by month. month. Yeah, not yeah, yeah. Month I'm in a group. I'm in a groups, and I'm watching. I'm following yeah. other people's trips, and and you know they reporting back. It's, and it's going up, 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 up. And so then, like a year later, I finally make my debut. I go. Now, the price, I got there right when the price was still decent. But even then, it was already higher from when I first was following it. All right. right. Wow. Yo, I'm telling you, man, since so 2014, I'm telling you, I, I swear, if you would have went back then, you would be you'd be mad now. You would be mad. You're like, it's different. I'd be uh, mad. So, and, and everybody knows this people that went, but people yep. that didn't go back then, they don't know they exactly don't know the beauties. They, they hear stories, they just hear stories. The beauties were just, I'm not capping on that. It was, uh -huh. it was epic, pure epic. A lot of places, more places was open, it was more lively. Pa uh, passions, yes. Flower. Oh. Funny, see, I know about that. And when I went, all that shit was closed. Closed. That was, that, that, was from yeah. me being in a that was for me being in travel groups. And uh, clothes, you know, spiders everywhere. You can't get in there. You know, it's all you don't want to go in there. It's a ghost. It was ghost buildings. You know what I'm saying? Yeah. Haunted buildings. Now you can't get in there. It was. It was so frustrating. It's like it's like you uh like a rookie on the bench, right? Mm -hmm. And all the stars playing. You're like, put me in, coach. Like you seeing everything, but you stuck on the bench. Say, put me in, coach. Yeah, yeah. So I'm on. I'm on the sidelines for a whole year watching everybody else's stuff. You know, cause you know how it is in the groups, right? They sharing videos from the beach. They sharing other kind of videos. Uh -huh. You know, and they sharing the prices and everything. And I'm like, ooh, I can't wait till I go. I can't wait. And I finally get off the bench. I finally go, and the prices are higher. But it's still manageable, though. Mm -hmm. and I go crazy, man. I'm like a bull in a china shop. <laughs> and um, shortly after, so that was Halloween. So oh, months later, you know, for February for Super Bowl, I went for Super Bowl the following year. Already prices to jump. I'm like, I was just here. Okay, I was just here in November. You know, Halloween, November. Yeah. When I, left. I was just here in November, February. It already jumped. Then I went back in the summer. It jumped again. Then I went back for the other Halloween. It jumped again. I'm like, oh my goodness. Yeah. Yeah, 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 big boss, you know. Uh, oh my goodness, goodness gracious, it, you know, it's crazy, you know. And 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 guys, you turn to Haitian females to hang out with because they were, hey, they, they they treat you better, they cool, they nice, and they they really still. And but now, even them, that's what I heard. So that's what I heard. You know, it's that's like I heard. Like, oh, it just my man on the ground. My man on the ground. I remember. Mm-hmm. Your spiders? Oh, spiders yeah, spiders is there in the in those old building club, Passion, CMP, you know, uh uh D Latins, the old spiders, yeah. Don't go in there, Felicia Joy. Don't go in don't there. Go in. Spiders and lizard and lizards, huh? 
Maybe, maybe a lizard out there in here, you know what I'm saying? You know, don't don't go in. Don't <laughs> Superior truck in 30. Who just uh Ron Ron 30 Ron 29? I think this is Ron 29. What's Shout the out. prices now, boss? Oh, superior trucking. Yeah, I never seen it. So what's up? What's up? Superior trucking? Yeah, superior trucking. I think this is Ron 29. Um, if it's so, we uh we hung out. Well, I think I did see superior. Yeah, trucking. yeah, this I, I thought so. Yeah, okay. I saw superior Ron. Trucking. This is Ron. Yeah, so I guess it's 30 now. A couple years ago it was 29, Ron 29. Shout out to Ron Twenty Nine, man. We uh we hung out in um Medellin. We hung out at Medellin. Medellin. Yeah. Uh, you avoid it. You avoided the sticker boys out there. Big yeah. Boss. And we went. We went to. We went to a casa. And um, all I'm gonna say for YouTube purposes, <laughs> Ron, you know what it was. Uh, we got down. Uh, and, I got down. Uh, and say, too much, too say too much for YouTube. Pause. Pause, 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 but hey, two chicks, me and a brother, nope, same dancing. room, same room, the pause, but it was wild, it was crazy, man. Yeah, <laughs> the ballroom, yeah. guys, the ballroom, we the yeah, ballroom. the dancing. barroom, it same barroom, all four of us, all but four of us, yes. Hanson, big boss, shout out, and, 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 and superior track trucking, they were dancing with the two chicas in the ballroom, you know, we get down to that, uh, uh. Anthony yeah, Santos. that was crazy. <laughs> um, shout out to the Cam. Um, yeah, that, that it was crazy, man. <laughs> shout out to Ron Twenty Nine, man. It goes down. So he says, "What's the prices now?" Um, so my man, matter of fact, my man said that. Oh, matter of fact, he, I'm in King. He's in Rumbas right now. Uh, hold on, hold on, hold on. Yo, come on, hit the link. Yeah, Rumbus. It's about in uh, DR. So mm -hmm. Yo, hit the link. Hit the link. Um, Ooh. I sent you the link. Hit the link and come on. That'd be perfect. Hit the link. I remember the old Rumbus. The old Rumbus was epic. Yeah, I mean, yeah. I, I like the owner. I like the owner though. He's a he's a brother of the of the new Rumbus. If it's still the same guy. Uh, <sighs> but they had to change their model because that old that that mayor, that new mayor they Great. had. Yeah, that female, that female mayor, she came in hating. Yeah. Right. So, um, so he says, um, my man says, uh, he said, I, I can't, he said, man, Sasua is overpriced. I can't believe how shit has changed. You there now? Yes. And then he sent me a photo of at the casino at night. Outside the casino currently, mm -hmm. I say, "What's the lowest price you was able to get?" And he says, three thousand to thirty-five hundred. The dimes were four thousand minimal, even the undesirable. And I'm like, "Wow!" And he said, "That's uh, with, he said that's with negotiation." In uh, the casino, in the casino, one hundred dollars U.S. for an hour. 150 all night. I'm like, wow. He said that's with negotiation. So then I said, uh, you know what I mean? Ooh. I said, I said, gotcha. I said, uh, he said, I I smashed that bad uh Haitian for 2500 And then I said, uh, I asked, I asked, I know somewhere I asked about Haitians, and I remember he said they they taxing too. Okay, um, so I said, wow. I said, wow, $80, $80 an hour for a Haitian? And uh, he said, he said, yep. Yeah. Something like that. Yeah. Well, basically, yeah, they, they push, they push it. So they push it down there. They quote, they quote, they asking, they asking a hundred, they asking a hundred USD. We'll take 80 USD. Uh, he said, with, with heavy negotiation, you can get it down to 60. So um, I'm trying to this this particular brother who's down there right now. I'm trying to I send him the link. Uh, I want him to click it. He said he's in King's Rumbus right now. King's Rumbus. Yeah, hopefully he'll click the link and we can really get some first first hand. Hopefully he'll turn the camera on and swing the camera around real fast. Yeah, we really don't know what to hear from him. We want we want to see the beauties out there. Uh, exactly. You don't put him on mute. It, it, yeah, put him on mute. Let us see the beauties. Yeah, man. Yeah, man. I don't know if he's gonna do it. Yeah, 
Let me see one more message. Oh, he listened to it though. <clears throat> yeah, man. Hey, come on. And it's put it put it on mute. Put it on mute and swing the camera around, man. <laughs> We gonna see, see what it is if he pull up. I'm not gonna, gonna see say some this. eight, nine, to tens out there. We're gonna be the people that chat gonna judge. You know, they're gonna rank the people y'all get ready. Rank. If, he pull, if he pull up guys in the chat, get ready to judge the beauty out right. there. He pull up five, six, seven, eight, nine to tens. Oh, <laughs> he, <and Roombas. laughs> he got the link. He got the link. I mean, it's, it's, it's double blue. Let's see if he pull up. <laughs> Let's see if he pull up. He said, Yeah, man. Yeah, the 100, 150 for the overnight. Um, so this this crazy stuff, man. So um, a lot lesser. So in Bogota, so I, I should hate. Damn, my hands hella ashy. So I should hate because I don't I don't want I don't want niggas uh fucking up my Bogota prices, man. Um, so I should hate. I should say it's a hundred is a hundred dollars for ten minutes. <laughs> Yo, big boys, don't worry. You, you you're not getting the money thrown in Bogota like you are in Costa. Ain't not so nah. don't gotta worry about that. Nah, okay. and, then, and then when people go and Bogota is a trip. When people go, I think when people go and they really see what it is, I really think people will self-regulate. They, they were like, their best behavior. <laughs> yeah, they were like, ooh, we we ain't in Kansas no more. Yeah, <laughs> right? Yeah, they, they, I think they I think people that. will self self-regulate. Yes, yes. See, see. <laughs> yeah, you, you you won't even get the vibe that that's cool to do that. Yeah, yeah, nah. yeah. But uh, to ask your question, to ask your question, Apex, you're talking about uh thirty ish. You talking about thirty ish? Uh, I, I would just say that really lesser. But I'm just for the, for this, I'm just gonna say thirty ish is average. Average is thirty ish USD. So very reasonable, very reasonable. Uh, OG Bobby Johnson. Yeah, the prices is crazy, man. The prices is crazy. It breaks my heart. It breaks what my they heart. don't know, do? in heart. a way, they run business away. But I have to say this, and I, and I hate to say it, because but it's still true. There's always going to be simps. Always. Mm-hmm. If all of us, if all of us seasoned travelers who know us up, if we stay away, guess what? There's plain loads of simps ready to go. Big boss, you said it, you know, and I was just having a discussion with JJ, frankly, about okay. this thing in Sasua, the phenomenon was going on in Sasua. How in the world do prices go up during the pandemic? How does that happen when you have a 12 noon curfew, eight on a weekend, 6 p.m. curfew on the weekdays? How does inflation occur? How does that happen? How do the guys from the Matrix, aka USA, allow that? To be, how do you let the Sasua woman win? They have won, and they are continuing to win. Yeah. Oh man. Cats out the back. Uh, the genies, the genies out the bottle. Pandora's box has been open. Oh. The cats out the back. Whatever other you, euphemism you want to use. Uh, yeah, you're not, you're not, oh. putting, the, you're not putting the milk back in the bottle. The yeah. spilt milk. So. Uh, I remember they, they tell us don't cry over spilt milk. Uh, they say don't cry over spilt don't milk. Cry. It is. I remember Sasua back in 2012, 13, 14. I remember. I remember. I must cry. I have to cry. You can't, <laughs> I can't help my emotions. Come on, big boss. <laughs> oh man. I remember um 2020, um, right before DR opened up again in, in July 1st. So I guess it was like uh May is or June. Shout out to uh Taylor May, General Taylor May put out an emergency message from down there. He says, Brother, they're set to open shortly in a month or two, and they open on July 1st. Mm-hmm. He said, I am down here right now. You know, I live down here, I've been living down here for years. I'm down here right now, boots on the ground. Uh, with tourism has been closed for a while. These chicas are hurting. When you guys come down here, we have them on the ropes. Hold the line. If we hold the line, we can reset the market. Yes, I remember that. You remember that? So he I'm not said, crazy. He said, it almost seemed like it almost seemed like a dream now. 
I gotta go back. I gotta go back on this channel and find that video for uh, still Yeah, up. that was an epic, one of my favorite videos ever from Television Dreams. He said, I he said, Hey guys, this is the general. This is the general with this pandemic going on. It is time to bring prices down to where they need to be. So act accordingly. I am the general and I am out. <laughs> oh man. Oh, that was that's when the general tell me he earned my he yeah. earned my respect. Yeah, he, he wrote earned yeah. my respect with that video. I, I I was I would say that was his finest hour. That yeah, was his the, finest his hour. Finest hour. That the was his finest hour. Finest hour. He tried. That, he tried. That's really like a general, a general <laughs> giving giving um orders to the troops before they get sent out. Yeah. 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 I remember that. His finest hour, like you say. Oh man. Shout out to the general. But guess what? It fell on deaf ears. Oh. Because soon <laughs> as the first plane flew in the POP. <laughs> what did King and Dream say? King and uh, Dream. Man. Beta male simp on the first plane. Oh my goodness. They couldn't hold the line. Hold they the couldn't line. hold the line. That shit collapsed. <laughs> it got worse. It got, it got worse. worse. It got worse. Tell me, it got worse. Tell me, it got worse. <laughs> After you said that, it got worse. You know who who held the, held the line? The who? Suachikas. They held the line. Uh, <laughs> right? <laughs> Damn. They, really, they, they held, held the, the line. <laughs> shit. Damn. Yeah. Oh man, the Sasua Chicas rallied the troops. After they, heard that, uh, <laughs> they had they general. They had they general. They listened to they general. Whoever they, they, whoever they general is. They heard that they, they said, "No, oh, Poppy, this is no. not gonna go down like that." <laughs> Fucking a. <laughs> oh man, we are our own worst enemy, man. And you know, it was a perfect storm combination because guys have been locked down for a while. And now you finally can go, man. I know that thirst. That thirst was overpowering. I can't help myself. I can't help. I can't help myself. I can't help myself. Mm -hmm. myself. I can't help. I can't. I can't. I can't. I can't. Take it. Take it off. Take it off. Wallet back. Wow. Oh man. Oh, Damn. <laughs> Damn man. <laughs> they, they, the chickens are gonna be mad at me if I try to offer them only fifteen hundred. They're gonna be mad at me. They're not gonna wanna hang out with me if I just say fifteen hundred pesos. They're gonna be right. mad. Right. They're gonna make the chickens mad. No. Oh, man. Crazy. Uh, oh, yeah. for real? Are you serious? So, um, the general, um, his baby finally came, the baby girl. Oh, okay. On a row. Okay. I oh. did not even know that. Okay, hey, oh, so my, uh oh, so my guy general. trying to come in. He said, trying to get the Wi-Fi signal stronger. It's not pulling up stream yard. It's buffering. Oh. Mm. Yeah, you probably, probably got some horrible Wi-Fi over there. You know how it goes. Yeah. All right, so he's trying to come on. He's trying to come on. My, my inside guy trying to come on. He might to try to use the data. Well, he probably don't got limited data. You know, who knows? You know. And and I know the link worked because it's actually the same link I sent you, Ray. I just copied and pasted. So it's, okay. it's, it's literally the exact same link I sent you. I copied and pasted. So I know the link works. Yeah, yeah. And, and big boss, when we abroad now, me too. I, I we gotta get uh, we gotta get them plans, the local plans, so we can like have sh better sh streams because the streams, the Wi-Fi be weak. So we be getting cut off and be fuzzy. So we're gonna have to invest in a uh, monthly plan for uh for each, a local plan phone. Plan. Yeah, we're gonna have to. Yeah, yeah. Us YouTubers, really us YouTubers, right? Yeah, yeah, YouTube. yeah, yeah. 
Damn. Now, I ain't talking regular. We talking about YouTubers. <laughs> Because right. the, the streams be like kind of choppy and just cutting off. I, I be cooking, I be flowing. All of a sudden, okay. Cut off. I'm like, God. No, not to. Oh, okay, so okay, so I'm I'm, I'm about to message I'm Taylor right the uh, general right now, and I see he got a profile picture. Is that his? Is that his little girl? Uh, is this his girl? Okay. Okay. Yeah, good. So that's telling me. Okay, that's telling me. Okay, all right. Congratulations, oh, telling wow. me. Congratulations, son of me, to you and your uh, new your, 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 your uh, baby, and uh, you try you try the best to keep the prices down. It's a sewer. Hold on, say say it, say it now. I see you can hear you. Say it. You can hear you. Congratulations, tell me. Uh, congratulations on your on your newborn, and uh, from Big Boss and Raising Rays, we salute you. And uh, you try you try the best to keep the inflation down in uh, Sasua over the over the past year. Well, so we salute you. We salute you. You you hear that, General? That's uh that's raise the raise on the um on my panel. He might be watching. I sent him the I sent him the link, but yeah, shout out to you. Uh I didn't even know. Felicia Jordan um told us all that you became a father yesterday. You have a, a beautiful bouncing baby girl, man. Congratulations and God bless you and your family, man. God bless you. Uh yes. thank you for all Thank you for all the good work uh, you've been doing for the brothers for these last few years, putting us up on game. And God bless you and your family, man. Shout out, Big Boss Real Talk, Razor Rays, the General Taylor Maid. Mm -hmm. Yes, this drink is to you, Taylor Maid. This drink is to you. Boom. Mm -hmm. Right on, right on. Yeah. Shout out to the General and his baby. That's what's up. That is what's up. Yeah, man. That's what it's all about. She said yes. Okay. Mm -hmm. All right. So um, take it off. Make it a soft. Take it off. Make it a soft breaker off. <laughs> that's from a, that's, that's lyrics from a rap song. I, I recognize that. Um, Felicia, DM me his number. When you have a moment, please, I'll reach out to him. Schedule that collapse. Oh. oh. Okay. That's what's up. What, uh. Okay, whatever y'all got going on, right on. Congrats, wrestling you on a little one, right? Man, mm -hmm. man, yeah. that's dope. Yeah, that's dope. You know, that's dope. Yeah, but uh, he tried to uh, he tried he tried to uh, stand up for us, man. He tried to put us on game. He tried. That shit did not work, man. I remember that. That was his finest hour. You know, that was his finest hour. That was epic. That was an epic. I, you know what? I need to pull that video up and put it inside my my gym workout playlist. Because that'll give me some motivation. That was some motivation right there. That yeah. speech, that little one minute speech he did. Yeah, I remember. I didn't even find that video. Yeah, man, he he. I was I was ready to go. I said okay. I was ready to go. I, I... <laughs> man, but you hey, them, them chicas, man, they held the line. They held the line. So he said, and the brothers I collapsed. Guy, this is the general. Yeah, I'm like, oh yeah. You see, now I get behind that. I get behind that, man. Woo! <laughs> oh, man. So, uh, Mr. Doctor Navigate, see, that's why I travel farther and I keep my hot spots a secret. That's why I don't have to worry about inflation. Oh. <laughs> Mr. Doctor yeah. the Navigator, what up? What up? You, you, yeah. You, 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 you in Alaska, Mr. Dawkins? <laughs> the eagle bodies out there. <laughs> Damn. No money throwing out there. <laughs> no money throwing out there. Yeah, that's the thing, man. You know, you want to talk Damn. about it on YouTube and put brothers on game, but then brothers go out there and mess it up. They go out there and mess it up. Yeah, it's a shame. It's a shame. You know, it's you know, we, we talk about it big boss and they've been blaming me, raising raise for, for stuff and going on and calling it, you know, but it's like the thing is, you know, you know, I, I put it I, I put it out there. I do, I know. And I understand, but when the guys go out there, they don't have to throw the money. They don't have to act the way they act. They right. just go out there, have fun, be civil, like be civilized. Like you do. You know, like me. Like you. I, I can't control how they act. And I, I do admit, I do put stuff out there on YouTube. You know, I do. And I know a lot of guys can see what up. I can't control if they throw money and cause an effect. I can't control that. You know what I'm saying? It, you know, I. They see my other videos and say, don't do it, don't do it. If they do it, that's on them, you know? What am I going to do? You know? I, I, you know, big boss, you know, 
you you gonna start getting that heat too, you know, one day. You know, they, they start blaming you for, for stuff going on in certain countries, in certain cities, you know. Yeah. Especially if you uh always talk about a certain city, certain yeah. country, like they're gonna be oh, they're gonna start blaming you. But I, you know, you gotta start talking about a bunch of places though. Blame blame them if they go there. Don't blame me. I, I'm just blame me. out there, they went and they did what they did. I don't, you know. I told him not to. It's not like I'm saying go out there and do right. Yeah. Right. Uh BA said it's because of OnlyFans. Dude paid money for feet vids, so the price of cooch went up. Yeah, man, dudes are dudes are some real simps. They pay they pay <laughs> money for female for any little thing. For uh feet pictures and, and all. Yeah, oh what, what is that, big boss? Feet pictures. Uh, that's a waste of money. Dang. Well, well, for me, but for to them, to some people, is like the best thing since ice cream, like you say. <laughs> ice cream, man. Uh, he said, "Yeah, it's just buffering." Damn, man, that would have been great. That would have been great. Yeah, it's buffering, yeah, 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 it's not gonna work. It's not gonna work out. Yeah, damn, that would have been great. Oh well. <laughs> um, yeah, kings of dreams say they smile and flirt, and then the betas just lose their mind. Yeah, of course they're gonna put the charms on you. But it's like a snake, man. It's like all of that is for a reason. Mm-hmm. You know what I'm saying? You got to just be like, no, this is what it is. This is what I got for you. Take it or leave it. Walk away. But no. Yeah, yeah, they sneaky, you know. Man. They sneaky. They know what they're doing. They, they rinse, wash, and repeat all day, every day. For hours all day, every day. Yes. Bro. Olympus has fallen. Olympus has fallen. Yeah, yeah. Uh, Olympus. Well, you talk about uh, Olympus with well, as far as Sasua. Yeah. And it's a shame. Sasua looks so nice. Well, I say the beach looks nice. The vibe, yeah, nice. doesn't it? Doesn't it? The brothers, like back in the day, camaraderie was nice. Was oh, cool. I love that. Nice. No that, beach, nothing. That, that's yeah. the second. That was the second best thing. Uh, Sasua is. It's the brotherhood camaraderie. Oh, so you know, you know about that. Yeah, yeah. Mm-hmm. It's peaceful. Not nah, you had to worry about the stick up boys coming on with oh, c- those with motor conchos and jacking you with the guns, you know. What no, man? all you gotta do is just uh, the beggars on the beach. Oh the yeah, come, the beggars. Yeah, yeah just oh, yeah. always trying to get you to buy their little trinkets and stuff. And then when you walk and when you walk into the beach, when you walk in trying to get to wherever, you pass all the shops, mm-hmm. all the shops where they sell paintings and trinkets, or whatever. Hey, my man, come into my shop. Come in, come in. Just look, just look. I said, no, later. And you even can't say later. You say later, boy, they hold you to it. Yeah, they say, you, you say, say later, Bobby. You said later. <laughs> oh, it got so bad, I used to have to walk near the water. Damn. Instead of walking near the shops, I'm like, yeah. you know what? I'm not walking that route. I'm going into the sand, you know, with next to the water. Damn. And I'm going to walk that way. I'm going to walk in the sand. Now, you know, it's tough for walking the sand because it's... Yeah. Your feet is in the sand. It's harder, but yeah. hey, it was worth it. Yeah, you know, it was worth yeah. it because all those vendors are gonna be trying to get you to the vendor. Ice the, yeah, so I had to walk in the yeah, yeah. So I know what you mean. I know what you mean. Man, <laughs> wow. That okay. That's the next level of the game. I'm gonna have to remember that. Walk on the walk on the sand, right? You got it Felicia, works, it works in you got cracking up. Damn, uh, you gotta walk on the sand <laughs> away from the vendors. Don't want to walk down that that yeah, road. Yeah, yeah, you might. You gotta do that in Hollywood Beach also. We call that here. For real? Yeah. Or you gonna walk across the street from the beach? <laughs> across the street from the beach? Yeah. You go. That's a shame. Of course. <laughs> you across gotta, the street. Why you gotta do all that extra ass shit? Yeah, That's a shame, yeah, they, man. They, 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 they be on thing. you too. I'm like, God damn. Now, if Jeez. I buy from you, and then the next time, how many people gonna buy from? Like. And I'm telling you, I bought a hat already. How the hell am I going to buy another hat from you? No, you that don't I already matter. bought a hat. They don't care about none of that, I mean, man. This is different. No, it's not different. It's the same thing. I'm not stupid. No, <laughs> come in. Come in my store. Come in. Just look. Just look. Just see. No. Just look. They didn't be trying to give me free. They be like, hey, take it for free. They been wanting to give me free oysters and free. Yeah, no, exactly. No, no, that no, one. You keep that. No, you're not taking nothing for free. Hey, nothing. But well, nothing is free. Get the hell out of here. Man. Don't make me have to back slap you. You know what I'm saying? Hey, I always say, don't do not hit the beggars, guys. <laughs> you know, but big boss, the more you go, the more you get used to it. You, you still mm-hmm. develop a callus. Yeah. You just get used to it. And it doesn't bother you as much as your first time, yeah, it bothered you. You know, like, I'm right. not coming back to the 
But uh, after a while, you start to get used to it. You start to know how to handle it more. And they, and once they see you more and more, they stop really. They're like, "This guy is cheap. He ain't giving us nothing." You know what I'm saying? <laughs> You're right. And they really stop kind of like messing with you. You know. Very good. Like, they say he cheapy cheapy. He yeah, he's not, cheapy. He's not gonna give us nothing. That's right. Boss is cheapy cheapy. Man. Yeah. I have a select few people that I give, and that's it. You know what I mean? Yeah, I got a select few people because you know you want to get to select few since you're gonna be out there. You kind of want some people to have your back. Exactly. So you're pretty much buying. You pretty much buying stuff so they can have your back. Yes. Basically. You know what I'm saying? But other than yeah. that, you know, you can't get to everybody. You playing? You playing? You playing uh, chess at that point? Mm -hmm. Chess, not checkers. See. It's very really smart. Very smart. I know you. I know you said you couldn't rock with me for a long time. You, mm -hmm. you gotta, you gotta make your runs. Um, yeah. What time is it now? Oh, no, let me hold on, hold on, hold on, big boy. Let me, let me, let me see what's going on. You know, so now I gotta put my glasses on, big boys, because I'm losing my vision. Let me see what time is it? It's eleven thirty. Okay, yeah. So I got, I got like another ten minutes. I gotta, I, I'm finish up this eraser. Right on. And then I'm gonna right break on. out of here. You know, try to survive this these New York Brooklyn streets. You know, they hopefully I don't have to back slap nobody out here. Is, is, is this is this snowing out there still? It was snowing early. It was cold. It was mucho frío out there. And I said to me head back, and I told y'all coming on. So yeah. I had I, I came back to my mama's basement so I could be in front of my poster and my flash things. I said yeah, I <laughs> so, but uh, it was freezing out there. It stopped snowing, but it's still cold. Yeah, obviously, it's right? Still cold, big boys. Yeah. I need to be back out there. Caught the hand up. If it's Andy cold enough to snow, I know it's, it's it's freezing. Shit. Yo, big boy. I'm California, man. We ain't we don't we ain't used to that you shit. Worry about that. I guess that's why we pay that we pay our rent through the ass. But shit. That's why I get mad when people tell me caught the hand is too hot. Dog, you're gonna be out here for months in Brooklyn with this cold weather, ice, ice, sleet. Ding, 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 ding. It's be 85 degrees. I don't care. Even if it's 90, I'll find some shade. Find some shade. Yeah. It's easier to cool down. Yeah. It's easier to cool down than to heat up. At nighttime, right? it's perfect. Because at nighttime, remember the, those nights? It's like, like perfect. It's like even, yeah. yeah. It's cool and warm, still warm, still hot, warm. Yeah, big boss. I be loving that. I be oh, loving yeah. that. Come on. When it's warm, when it's warm at night. It was warm at night where you can wear what you're wearing, a tank top, a cutoff. Exactly, big boss. And I, people don't realize that. Because the average temperature around 70, 70 degrees in a certain place, like a Medellin, it gets chilly at night then. That means it's going to be kind of, you're going to need a jacket or a sweater at night time. Yeah, you know it's, I mean? yeah if it's already like so-so yes. in the daytime, you know it's going to uh, it's even, go, Yeah. And, right. Oh, man. I, yeah. But hey, I, you know. King of Dreams said, I can't wait till Wednesday. Yeah, King of Dreams, he's going to be at Medellin on Wednesday. I believe he leaves two, He leaves Tuesday. Oh, yeah, he, he is. leaves Tuesday, and he arrives on Wednesday. He's going to be live on my show uh, on Wednesday. King is coming, coming live from Medellin. Okay, that's what's gonna, up. Yeah. And it's, going to be, it's going to be on your channel or his channel? Uh, I'm going to pick up my channel, and uh, we're okay. going to discuss... Uh, see what's going on out there, the sights and sounds. I'm gonna, I'm gonna see some beauties, kings of dreams, you know, That's out there. The, the, the snow bunnies, kings of dreams, you know what I'm saying? <laughs> you guys and y'all damn snow bunnies. That's what's up, <laughs> you know. Was... You know, we got we got we, we got to bring the fire, King of Dream, because uh, that's gonna be a big show, and um, you know, I guess. I guess we're gonna see. Of course, we're gonna have the Medellin robbery of the day, King of Dream. Don't don't be offended, but the people gotta know what's going on out there. It, but you know. It should be a good day. It's going to be a good live. Hopefully, you bring the snow bunny. I want to see the fire. Even if it's, even, even if it's just fo uh, photos, you don't have to have a live snow bunny. But, right. uh, you know, photos, some photos. You know, YouTube. YouTube safe, though, King of Dreams. YouTube, YouTube safe. safe. <laughs> That's what's up. So, man, so King of Dreams going to be busy. So, King of Dreams on, on this coming Monday, mm. on Monday, on his channel, he's mm. going to have a super panel himself, me, Flyboy, two others. Uh, Doughboy, whoever Doughboy is, and, and Lenny, somebody that's going to be on his channel this Monday. Uh -huh. and then two days later on Wednesday, on your channel, Razor Rays, he's mm -hmm. going to be live from Medellin. On from your Medellin. channel, yeah, from Medellin. That's what's <laughs> up. That's what's up. That's what's up. Shout out to King and Dreams on Razor's channel on Wednesday. That's what's up. 
Um, Love Entertainment, shout out to Love Entertainment. If you're enjoying the conversation, hit the like button, subscribe, hit the notification bell, share Big Boss Real Talk, and follow Big Boss Go 777 on IG and Super Chat. Loving the emojis, man. Loving the emojis. Shout out to Love Entertainment. Yeah, man, you got to get to us some moderators, man. Oh, yeah, big you know, shout out, shout out to Love Entertainment. He's gonna be the first mod, uh, Tim Howard, also. Okay, uh, I'm gonna hit up JJ, let him give him a wrench. Yeah, I might, yeah. Give, I might, I might even give you a wrench, big boys. Hey, you, you do can that. Arrange. Hey, do that. A wrench. You can arrange, you can right, arrange. right. Hey, but you know, you know, I don't the thing is, it's what so many people have it have come in the comments anyway. So it's like, you know what, and YouTube does a good job. I, I get a lot of different comments i'm sure you do if you go watch your live and, yeah you uh, go back you see you see the ones that was uh yeah that was blocked by youtube youtube blocks a lot of comments I'm like, oh i'm glad they blocked that oh man right <laughs> i'm glad they blocked that one so youtube does a great job already so that's why i didn't hang out the wrench because uh a lot of the the stuff that'll get your channel like i guess suspended and this and that don't doesn't make the it doesn't right. make it anyway the, yeah. uh, some trolls I can handle them. It's like, well, you know what? I kind of I like them when the troll come up and then I can like debate them, whatever. You know, you I'm like, not trying yeah. to. Even if they negative, I'm not trying to like uh, let's just say cancel them or delete them. Per, you know, if they got if they got a problem with me, I'll let them on in the in the comment. Let let the comment go. You know, as long as they're not saying something that's going to get the channel suspended. You know what I'm saying? If I if I bring it up on the screen, whatever. So right. that's why it's like, you know what? But as you get bigger and bigger, yeah, definitely gonna have. I'm definitely gonna hit up Love Entertainment and Tim Howard, definitely. Yes, yes, for as far as because yeah, he does. Felicia too. Hit up, you know. And I, Felicia I'll Jordan. Loan, I'll oh, loan sorry. out Felicia, Felicia Felicia Jordan. Of course, and Felicia Jordan. Felicia She's Jordan. Everywhere. She own it. She is. A lot everywhere. of times. A lot of times. Um, <laughs> between 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 Love Entertainment, between Love Entertainment, but a lot of times when I go live. Like mm -hmm. right, right before I go live, you know, I check it. I didn't. I haven't hit broadcast yet. She's already in the chat. Mm -hmm. like, look at Felicia, boy. Felicia, yeah. on it. Yes, yes, Felicia. I'm sorry that I don't. Don't think I'm sexist, Felicia. <laughs> she know so that. Man. Know, Felicia, you are everywhere. You, I think she be she be on uh, Fit Travels channel also. She's a model. Yep. She is everybody. Popular. She knows what she's what she's doing. Mm -hmm. Yes. So uh, Felicia, Jordan, you will get a rich. Awesome. Yes. That's I have up. no moderators, but y'all will be the, the first three moderators for sure. That's what's up. You can't go wrong. You can't go wrong. Felicia Jordan, T Love, and Tim Howard Five. Yes. Oh, yes. you're gonna be ready. You're gonna be I'm ready. Straight. I'm protected. That's protected yep. right there. <laughs> but travel, guys, when you travel, make sure your health is top notch. Lots of guys passing out and dying abroad for bad health. Yeah, especially with the heart, too. Mm -hmm. Uh because you know, a lot of guys be uh Taking popping extra help, popping pills to help <laughs> that messes with the heart. Performance and then, enhancers. Yeah, and then with the uh, pills and with the drinking, like some people like to drink. And then with the climates, with the hot climates, and with the activities that we be doing. Mm -hmm. You know, so sometimes that can make for a lethal mix. That you be doing, big boss. Just <laughs> Yeah, I'll be doing. This what do you boys. What do you be doing there? What do you be doing? I'll be at the at the uh, the mud castle. You know what I mean? I'll be watching. I'll be doing sightseeing. You know what I mean? I'll be on a horse carriage. Big boys, don't put me in your category. You know what I mean? <laughs> oh, yeah, oh, big boys, I'll be at the museum. Oh, <laughs> the oh, museum. Listen to this. Oh, I'll be, I, you know, I'll be oh, at the museum, man. taking it, get my tan, relaxing. Big boss. Don't put me in your category, big boss. You know? Yeah, big boss. Hey, big boss, I'll be at the movie theater. I see Spider-Man out there called a hater. <laughs> you know, big boss, I take my nice long walks. I go to the gym. I work out daily. And then when I get back to the hotel, I'm not thinking about no cheat guys. I, I pop on Netflix, big boss. I'm not in your category. Oh, uh, man. Hey, mama. Hola, mama. <laughs> <laughs> oh, you is lucky. <laughs> what? What, big boss? Hey, hey, I'm not. Hey, big boss, I'm not. Hey, 
I go to these places to enjoy the sun, get some YouTube comment, well, content, and I come back home to the Matrix, a.k.a. USA. That's all I do. You know, I have no interest in that, in that extra curricular activity that you dabble, that you dabble with, big boss. <laughs> you were saying... <laughs> you were saying Razor Ray. <laughs> huh? I'm enjoying the sights and the sound. The, the, the wall. You see that wall in Cartagena? You got to visit that wall, big boss. You got to know the history of the wall. That big wall. The wall city. Ray, Why you think you call it the wall city, big Ray's boss? Razor Ray. You got to take you a tour. You ain't worrying about no damn wall. You, gotta go you to worry the, about that, them that. sugar walls. That's what you want. You want to go balls deep in the sugar walls. You ain't worried about no damn walls. What the hell? You got to go to that castle, big boss. The you castle. don't put That's me in your category. Going. What the category castle. is that? You be busting it up too? Raise and raise, bust yeah, it in up. The gym. In the gym, yeah. yeah. I bust the muscles. In the, the room. In the room. Oh, yeah. You be doing a hor the horizontal hula. What did The Rock used to say? <laughs> what did the, the Rock? Shout out to The Rock. The horizontal hula. Oh, the rock, <laughs> the horizontal hula, yeah. Something like that used to say. Oh, uh, shit, we got Zoom in the house. See? Whoa. Thanks to the uh, the moderator, let me know. Okay, right here, boom. Zoom to Thailand. Shout out to Razor and the boss. What up? Oh. He so gave you a shout out. Whoa. Zoom, he jumping. Zoom. Do, <laughs> do, 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 do. Instead of you, go Zoom. <laughs> To the oh, oh, hey, Richie Mack, you hear you hear this blasphemy? Do you hear this nonsense? He made boss find the hat, the cap. He said, "Don't put me in your category, big boss." That you be doing? I'm looking at the wall, the wall, the wall the city, castle. boss, the wall, and the castle, castle, and the beach. Man, I be working, I be busting it up in the gym, man. Yeah. And I'm there for the food. And, the, you know, it's the culture. But maybe if I go to Thailand, maybe I'll be like you, big boss. If I zoom to Thailand, if I do that. H.D. <laughs> chilling. H.D. chilling. Do you hear this? What up? Oh. <laughs> See, he, could, he can come on my channel and say this foolishness. He would never dare say that in his own channel. Hey, 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 H.D. It's not. I'm pretty poor. I don't have the funds. That's all the inflation. That's all the money throwers throwing that money in the air, causing it. Man, you got all the muscles. You show all the muscles. You ain't got to pay all that money anyway. You show all the muscles. You ain't got to pay all that money. <laughs> oh wow! So look, so look to you, HD. Razor Ray. Razor Ray made boss bust out the Capellini. <laughs> I had to get the Capellini, man. Messing with Razor oh, Ray. Man. Day. Kings and wow. Dreams, Zoom to Thailand, tap in this upcoming week. Big panel with Big Boss, Flyboy, and more. Also, I would be in Medellin. It's going to be good. Yeah, dick. Hey, shout out to Kings and Dreams making a play at Zoom to Thailand. That's what's up. Man, come on, say that, OG. Say that, OG. <laughs> he was talking that mess. OG, what up, OG? <laughs> he was talking mess, man. He made me get the cap. Hey. What? What did Fifty Cent say? Get the strap, big boss. <laughs> get the cap. Damn, man. Damn it. Okay, okay. Uh oh. Uh oh. Mm -hmm. It looked like your wish may be granted. Ooh, it looked like your wish may be granted. Oh, Christmas came early. Boy. Christmas came early. Richie Mack zoomed to Thailand, replied to Kings and Dream, and say, Kings, Ooh. let's get it. Let's get it. That's Dreams what's come up. true. Big That's boys what's up. We building up in here. We building up in here. Like I said, I had a, a shout out to Check and Effect. Had 68K. Came on my channel. Soon as I hit 1K. Soon as I hit 1K. He came with his 68K. And what <laughs> and what did good karma do? And weeks later, he went from 68 
to like 90 something. Courtesy of Big Boss. Well, <laughs> yeah, right. No, nah, but it's, it's, it's good karma. It's good karma. He paid it forward. Yeah. He came down to my little tiny channel. He yeah. didn't have to do it. He came down to my little tiny channel. And right after he came to my tiny channel, his 68 just kept going, 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 going. So yeah. sometimes when you do good, good you receive good. good. You know what I'm saying? Right. He didn't have to come over here. He didn't have to come on this channel. Nah, not at all. 68, yeah, no. almost 70, almost 70K. Right. 68, 68K and I had 1K. Uh-huh. So he didn't have to come on. So, but now, now anybody under that, if anybody under that act funny with me, I look at him funny. I'm like, okay, <laughs> you might got you might got 50K. You might have 40K. This guy had almost 70K and he came on. Mm -hmm. You ain't even got 70K and you acting funny. But you know, yeah. everybody different. So that's why shout out to check in effect. And now the man is pushing a hundred. But give hey me, man, I'm gonna give, give you the last word. I know you gotta go. Yeah, hold on. Uh, give me one minute, then I'll come back and get the last word. I okay, okay. Okay. Out. Oh, okay. You gotta put that cerveza out. Your ass always drinking. Uh building, building in the building. Good looks at big boss, real talk. Hey man, you know what I'm saying? Bossy boss the plug. I'm the plug. I'm the plug. Show me love. That's what it is, man. Uh, oh, I already read that. That's what's up. Good stuff. Good stuff. Good stuff. Yes, sir. Yeah, if y'all enjoying this with Bossy Boss and Razor Ray. Razor Ray came in and helped out the boss because I didn't have a, a feature this week. It's just going to be me. Me just talking my shit. But Razor Ray pulled up on the Bossy Boss to help me out. Shit, why? I get my YouTube, I grow my YouTube wings back, man. I gotta, I gotta get back into the mix, man. Gotta get back into the September, October, twenty twenty one when I was grinding hard, man. I was grinding hard to get that thousand, man. And the, the four thousand watch hours and a thousand subs, boss was on a grind. I gotta get back. I gotta get back to that mind frame, man. I gotta grind it up. But I, I, at the same time, I said, nigga, I got a hundred and fifteen video. And a lot of them are long ass live streams. I got content for people in the meantime. So, yeah. But I know you got to keep putting out new, fresh content. You know what I'm saying? Uh, for, for your new people and for the algorithm. So, we got you back, man. We got you back for your dip out. Yeah. Well, I just heard you say that. And Mulano, the travel vlogger, once said, when I was, I, I, got, a, I got a memory like an elephant. When mm -hmm. I was on Roll the Tapes Live, right? Okay. And he was helping me get to a thousand. Yeah. Uh, Mulano Travel Vlogger said, guys get to a thousand subscribers and then they slow down mm -hmm. and then they stop. And, and I, my theory is, you know how much YouTube put you through to get to that thousand subs? They put you through a lot just to get to a thousand subs. A lot of mental, you know how many times I wanted to tear this poster down and I'm like, man, I'm not doing this no more. I'm only getting like, 15 views on a video in the beginning. It was embarrassing. Right. You know, they put you through a lot. Like a crazy boot camp. <laughs> they, they make you earn it. They make you earn it. And uh, so it's a lot of burnout. You, you say you did like 100 videos, right, big boy? Yeah, 115. 100, that's a lot. People don't know the editing and the work that go into it, the planning. And you got to entertain the people. So uh, I understand, you know, you're like, you slow down because it's like it's tiring. It's not easy. It's not the easiest thing in the world to do, guys. So, um, Big Boss, you know, he said he wanted to take a little break, a little a week off. But Big Boss, don't take too long. Off I know. That YouTube algorithm will screw you over if you take too long off, Big Boss. Right, right. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah, yeah man. Well, thank you, man. Thank you for having me on. Uh, thank you for coming on, man. Shout out to Zoom to Thailand. I, you know, thanks for... Coming in the chat, Zoom, you know, right? King to Dreams, don't worry. We're gonna we're gonna be on Wednesday. You know, I'm gonna have that Medellin robbery today, King to Dreams. So do not be offended, Kings. Do not be <laughs> offended. I don't I don't make the news out there. <laughs> you know, I, I'm not doing you know. But man, your big boss, you are great, man. You're great. You're 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 great. Continue to grow. Continue to grow, and every every guest you bring on, I, I'm sure they feel comfortable on your on your platform. 
which is which is important too. Make your guests feel welcome and, and important on your platform. It's just you know, it's amazing. It's amazing. We growing in this, in twenty twenty two. It was YouTube travel game, guys. Salute to everybody in the chat. You know, it's amazing. Well, it's amazing. It's amazing. It's amazing. It's in twenty twenty two. What? Game, guys. Got that echo though. He got an echo. It doesn't. Oh. Oh, shit. <laughs> Look at that. We, Yo, what up? What up? Zoom. Oh, we got God. Zoom in. The, we got Zoom in the raw, what? in the wild. <laughs> what up? What up? Oh wow. shit. This is amazing. Wipe the sleep out your eyes, man. I'm just waking up. <laughs> oh shit. The hey. other side of, you on the other side of the world, man. Yeah, man. I saw I saw I saw uh Method Man and Chub Rock. I said I gotta get in on this. <laughs> <laughs> oh, I got <laughs> Chub Rock. Oh man. Wow. No, it's Method Man and Red Man, man. I'm Chub Rock. Huh? He said Chub Rock. <laughs> <laughs> oh, <laughs> man got jokes. <laughs> <laughs> wow. Damn. Shout out to y'all, man. I can barely hear y'all. I don't know why I can't hear y'all. Let me see what's going on. For real? Yeah, it, it's probably on me. I can't really. Y'all can hear me? Oh, shit. We got check in effect. Oh, hey, my check. Pull up. Hey, check I'm dropping in this. I'm dropping this for check. Oh, my God. I'm Yo, dropping this for check. We're going to have. <laughs> That's what's up. Tell check in effect. I need him, too. I need checks in effect. Big Boss okay. is the plug. Hey, raise the raise. Big I'm Boss the is the plug. Yeah, Trust me. I, I see. <laughs> I see. He get, he get everybody. <laughs> he is the plug. YouTube. Zoom to Thailand. Hey, <laughs> hey, this link right here is only for check. Hey, check, oh hit it. Oh, my goodness. This is a <laughs> well, I could send it. I could send it in the back. But, this hey, is, you're right there. So, Zoom, how are you doing, Zoom? This is I'm good, brother. How you doing, man? I'm just waking up. So, I, I, I'm... Uh, you know, boss always sent me the link. He always let me know. That's my dude, man. So, hey, hey, raise and raise. You part of the family. If boss, if boss the plug say you part of the family, that's what that should be his name. Boss the plug. Boss the plug, <laughs> man. Yeah, man. Hey, 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 hey. Uh, raise and raise. I'm trying to get. I'm trying to get. I can't get them, them guns like you. I, I, I got to work I know, on that. Right. <laughs> I, I, I got the hooks hey, up. Hey, we're gonna have to jump them. Hey, we're gonna have to jump them. Right, right. <laughs> I, I think I think four of us could take them. So, right, 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 so right. Me, you, Kings and Dreams. Right. Girl, we need and, and Michael John White. And Michael John White. Then we got him. Then we got him. So they got they got gyms out there in Thailand. They got some good gyms out there in Thailand. They got. Oh. I can barely hear. I wonder why I can't hear y'all. What am I doing wrong? You see what said he, say, he said he's huh? setting up that trip to Thailand. Oh yeah 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 yeah. When oh, we come man. out to Thailand, yeah, we, we good. I just wish I could hear. What, what the hell am I doing? Y'all can hear me clear, though. I hear you we very clear. Yeah, we can hear you clear. What the fuck is going on, man? Let me turn it. Yeah, I see my big ass head. You can tell I just woke up. I got the kid and play and shit. Uh, 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 <laughs> 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 Do the kick there. <laughs> oh, that kick that you should do. With the, with the, with yeah. The kid. yeah. Hey, hey, what you know about that, youngster racer? Huh? House party, I love house party. What? Yeah, I was. I can't hear. Boss, sh should I tap back in? Because I can't. I don't know what 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 it is. Why I can't hear? If I you think you need bit. to, I hear huh? you. I hear you perfectly. But if you can't hear, if you need to, I'm doing it from my phone. I got the volume turned all the way up on my phone. I feel like I want to hit the speaker button or something, but it ain't. Uh. Let me see what the fuck is going on. Audio. Let's say the audio's on. Check don't want to check don't want to pull up with us, man. What's up? But thank was thanks for a couple, pulling up in the chat. You know, it's all good. It, ain't no telling what check is. Check be all over the place. Check is in effect. Check is in effect. Ain't, yes, no, telling where, ain't no telling where he is right now. Check right, check, right. In the, check in the airport. He about to fly out somewhere. Right. He's checking a move. Man, yeah. he's in full effect. Shout he's out to check, thing. check, check, man. Check is a real yeah. one, man. Like I said, yeah. I ain't never gonna forget. He pulled up on me. I had 1,000 subs and check came on. It's too bad. My super, I didn't know to turn on my super chat. <laughs> oh, shit. That's, hey, remember that, uh, Richie Mack? Yeah. I didn't, yeah. I didn't know, I didn't, I didn't know to turn on my super chats. Yeah. Damn. Oh, yeah. Yeah. I was watching. Check, you check. Was, 
Texas he was hot with himself. He was hot with himself. He talked about it for like two, three days. I'm like, you gotta let it go, boss. Man, I can I can let that go, man. I can let that go. Right. Yeah. That's what's up. That's man. what's up. But man, I just wanted to just drop in and say what's up to y'all. Say what's up to Razor Rays, man. Just uh, give, give y'all right. a quick hey. little shout out. Yeah, hey. disturb y'all chat. But man, right boss, and keep before doing you get what off, you're doing love I'm... entertainment. Do what you're doing, Felicia. I see y'all. Okay, before Kings you get dreams, off, I'm, there I'm he is. Holler at my cool. King, Kings and Dreams. I, I was just about to give him a shout out. He there now. What up, Kings? What's going on, man? What's going on, Richie Mac? What's going man. on, man? How's it going, here, man? man? Trying to barely hear y'all. Like, if the volume was a 10, I hear y'all at like two. So I got to really like Damn. focus to hear what y'all are saying. I don't know why it's doing that. All but. right. So hey, can, hey, can well, you hit? Matt, I'm going to be going for a while. So once you wake up, get your coffee, you want to tap back in an hour or so, you know me. Okay. I'll probably be going for a while. So right. <laughs> right. tap back in. <laughs> right. Okay. King, you good? Yeah, man. I'm good, man. Um, okay. Listen, man. I, you know, I, I got a I got a strong week this week, man. Tap in, man. Tap in. Yeah. Do like boss do. Like like what, what boss does. See, boss make it where you can't make no excuse. Like he sends you the <laughs> shit before the stream. He sends you something during the stream. And he might send you something after the stream. So, so just make sure you just keep me, keep me, keep me up. And if I got I'm, you. If I'm, if I'm in the mix, I'm with, what day is that? Because you know I'm a day ahead of y'all. So what day you uh, yeah, so uh so so I, I'm I'm gonna be there. I'm gonna be there um thir by Thursday your time by like um, I, I would say by like two two a.m. your time. Okay. Yeah, it's gonna be tough. But if I'm up editing, if I'm up editing, oh, you're talking about the live. I'm, I'm, I think so. I'm sorry, my bad. My, my bad. You talking about when I arrive? No, 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 no. Uh, nine a.m. your time. Um, on Thursday. You arrive in Thailand? No, no Medellin. 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 Oh, got you, got you, got you, got you. Yeah. Okay. Okay. So, yeah. yeah. Nine a.m. I'm up. I'm up. Yeah. Yep. Up. So we, 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 we definitely get that in, man, for sure. For sure. All right, cool. Just make sure you hit me up. I got you. Plug. Just, hey, 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 King, just talk to the plug. I got you. <laughs> I got you. I'm on it. <laughs> All right, Razor Ray, shout out to you, brother. Salute to you. Salute to your right. guns. You know, I don't know how you get to the airport with them guns, but yeah, right. yeah, Hercules. <laughs> Hercules, Hercules, Hercules. All right, y'all. I can't Richie tell Max, salute, man. <laughs> Right on, man. Right on. Cool. Oh, shit. Cool. Oh, we, we got check in the background. It's not going to, uh, come on, man. Get it right. Check, check. in the background? Check it. Yeah. It's, uh, me, I got to stay. I'm, yeah. I'm out of bed. I'm out, I'm out of some basis. Oh, my goodness. They would man, need look. to, oh, uh, man. Get it right, check. Oh, uh, man. He, yeah, he, he's, he's in my back room, but the vice not out, connected. Man. Oh uh, man, he's right there. But someone else is in my back room been waiting. I'm gonna bring I'm gonna bring up my co-pilot. I see you. My co-pilot. Oh G. What up? What up, what up? What's going on, OG? What's up? But we got we got check in effect. Check in effect. It's in the background trying to get it right. So what up, OG and the Kings of Dreams? How the hell are you doing? Same old, same old shit. Just a different day. <sighs> Raise a raise, man. You, re you ready for Wednesday? It's, it's about to get spicy, man. It's ready? about to get Let's spicy on Wednesday. Hey, yeah. Listen, I know you talk about snow buddies, but I, I, I like melanin too, man. I'm just saying. Come so. on now. Say that. <laughs> you like, I like, you like, I like melanin, melanin man. too. We got to show the receipts. In many, many. I know they got them, some Pesa, some Pesa females out there. Paisa, Paisa, Paisa. Ah, uh, yeah, I'm, I'm buying. Yeah, pa yeah, yeah, but Paisa, 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 Paisa. That just mean like you know, country. It's, it's just slang for like you know, like Medellin. Uh -huh. Like you from, uh -huh. you know, you from there. Mm -hmm. You know, uh, so you know how like you know how like we'll call like Brooklyn the jungle, or you know, Oakland uh -huh. will call it the Bay or whatever. You know what I'm saying? That's oh, it. It's okay. just yeah, it's just a, yeah. It doesn't matter if you oh. you know dark, light, oh, okay. whatever. Yeah. So I've been saying it wrong all the time. So I've been looking like an idiot. I'm glad you. <laughs> I'm glad you stopped me from looking like an idiot on my channel. But you you I'm good. I'm saying Pfizer, Pfizer. <laughs> nah, uh, you good. Nah, you good, fam. Thank you, man. Thank you, man. Yeah, yeah, yeah. We gonna, it's gonna be lit. It's gonna be lit. No matter what we do, you know, when we when we get together, we be lit. You know what I mean? The chat be lit. It doesn't matter. Being Medellin and Matrix, it don't matter where we at. You know what I mean? No. Nah, definitely, man. Definitely. I, I mean, yeah. So <clears throat> it's it's gonna be good, man. Like like I get there. I get there early, so I'll, I'll have enough time to, you know, settle in, move around, and do what I got to do. But by the time by the time the live starts, it's gonna be live. 
That's all. That's all. Right. Well, OG, where you at? Where you at, OG? I'm in Corona, Cali. California. You in California, Cali? So you're not you in Cali, not that Cali. You in the California, the Matrix, California. Yeah. Oh, man. Yeah. We thought you was in Cali, Cali Columbia. <laughs> Cali curves. <laughs> Not yet. There, I, nah, he uh OG. I thought you're going to um Cartagena though, right? Yeah. Yeah. In May. Oh. Okay. Hey, that's my birthday month. Yeah, I might see you out there. <laughs> well, it'll be at the end of May. It'll be at the end of May, like yeah. Yeah. My birthday in the May. Okay. Clock tower. Yeah. <laughs> we can hook up. <laughs> yeah, drink some Aguilas. That's yep. gonna be epic. That's gonna yeah. be epic, definitely, definitely. Oh man, that would be, you know, woo! And Big Boss, we gotta get Big Boss out there and caught the hater too. Oh yeah, he might uh, like to look at the to look at the place. wall, right? <laughs> to look at the wall. Oh, oh yeah, yeah. Look at the wall and go to that mud castle, the the, 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 the mud mud volcano. You gonna put the mud on you? You, you know, you know. Get cleansed. Get cleansed. Yes, get cleansed. <laughs> You know, I don't want to get cleansed. I want to get dirty. You're going to get on tour. You're going to get dirty, yeah, too. I'm trying to keep I'm trying to keep I'm trying to keep a straight face look at that uh, big boss. But... <laughs> oh, shit. Check any fact that you is that the real check? That's this it? me, bro. This me, bro. Oh, <laughs> shit. Check in effect in the building. Hey, 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 salute to everybody in the chat, man. Big Boss doing his thing. The man is 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 on the come up, on the rise right mm -hmm. now. Salute to you, man. Salute to Felicia, everybody on the chat. Zoom to Thailand, Buck Travels, uh, Love Entertainment. Salute to everybody, man. I appreciate y'all boys supporting me too, man, for real. We doing it big over here in Brazil, man. And oh, yeah, you know I'm going to Thailand. Talking. You back in Brazil, huh? Because I be seeing your little thumbnails, man. You be having a fire, bro. Your little, well, your little guides, your guys to be throwing you around. Yeah, well, you you know, you know, I, I I usually have a guide, but sometimes you know, if I see something real nice on that on on my video, I'd be like, hold on, pause, boom, let me get that right there. Let me yeah, screenshot sure. that. Uh, so, let me get that. Oh man, that country, that country came out. Where you where you from again, check? I'm from Miami. Born and raised? Born and raised in Miami. Oh, man, you sounded like some, some country. Where are your people from? Your people must not be from there. <laughs> <laughs> I heard that Miami is the out. south, bro. Miami is the south. Miami is the south. Okay. <laughs> yeah, okay, Miami south. the south. That's we're what's right. up. <laughs> man, I love Brazil, man. Brazil is number two behind China. So, check. I know. I, did I ask you when, you when you came on my channel, you been to Thailand yet, bro? I never been to Thailand, so you already know when I go there. Oh man, it's gonna be a movie. It's gonna be. It's, it's gonna be. It's gonna be, a, it's gonna be a literal movie with you, Mr. Ray. YouTuber. It's gonna be a literal movie. Raise. It's gonna be a movie. Raise. <laughs> I'm gonna be yo. I'm gonna be front row. Front row for that movie. I'm gonna get the tickets early. Pre-order my ticket to that. <laughs> get hey, get your popcorns and and beer ready. Oh yeah, I'm gonna have, to, I'm gonna have my suitcases on tap for sure. Check. <laughs> yeah, just for the record, I'm in I'm in um Salvador Bahia right now. I left uh Rio. Oh wow. shit. Wow. Yeah. Okay, wow. right on. So uh Zoom to Thailand check. I need you on Zoom. Let's get it. Ace live this Tuesday. What? Wow. What? Hey, you didn't tell me that. This is <laughs> Mac, you gonna have Ace Live on Tuesday? Oh wow. Wow. <laughs> He's in Brazil too. Huh? Yeah, he's, he's in, in Brazil, Brazil right now. Ace in Brazil? Oh, yeah. shit. Oh, wow. shit. Oh, shit. Damn. Hey, um, chat, do you got you got Zoom's number yet? No, nah, I don't have his info. I'll I, I, I give it to you. I, I, I'll All right. Don't worry about it. I'll give it to you. Boss is the plug. The oh, plug. wow. I didn't know yet. Oh, shit. He's going to have Ace on Tuesday? God, dang. Crazy. Bring, hey, bring, bring Ace on, um, on Real Talk. <laughs> okay, I got oh can I tell him T Love? Can I tell him? I got somebody? Okay, so it's it's Ace, you, and another big one. Uh-oh. Mm. It's a seal. It's a seal. Yeah. Cause you, you know how these, I, 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 I spoke to I spoke to him on the phone, like spoke spoke on the phone. We gonna make it happen. It was right before I went to Mexico with Flyboy and um 
He said, oh, I, I got you. I know I'm going to have is. you on. I'm going to let you guys. Uh-oh. I know who it is. Uh-oh. T nah, I ain't going to say nothing. Nah, don't worry. Your secret's safe, bro. Yeah. yeah I ain't going to say nothing. Keep it for a surprise. Keep it for yeah. Surprise. T Love said, tell him. Uh, I'm going to keep it for a surprise. But I yeah. you guys kind of know, because because in our circle, it's basically check, ace live, and you know you know who. So yeah, it's, it's, yeah. it's the you know who. Yeah. He, he agreed to come on the show. We literally spoke on the phone uh, right before I went to Mexico. It's just a <coughs> it's just a timing thing. Once you said that, once you said the country, you gave it away. Oh. Okay. okay. Hey, but I'm doing a vid. I'm actually doing a video with him too. But oh. we plan to do it in person. So whenever oh, we're in the dope. same country, whenever we're in the same country, we gonna do it together. Dope, man. I hey. love that, man. Big, a big collapse. Big collapse, man. Mm -hmm. Hey, I'm, 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 I'm going to. You got to speak things into existence. Yes. So I'm gonna celebrate. I'm gonna celebrate 100k right now. Cause for me is already it's the next day. It's two, for Yo, me it's two o'clock in the morning, so it's the next day. So I'm gonna celebrate a hundred k today, even though I'm not there yet. I'm probably like five hundred short, but I know I'm gonna have five hundred tomorrow. So I'm celebrating my hundred k. Right. right now, I'm That's celebrating. What's up, man. That's what's up. Hold on. Hold on. Let me go to my. Oh, chair. I'm gonna get it. It's gonna be there tomorrow. Don't worry, you'll see. Whoa! So y'all see it right here, cause you know I got you. I got you on my feature. You, you're way down here. Whoa! Ninety nine point six. Whoa! Four hundred. Four hundred away. Four hundred away. Yeah, well, see, that's From, crazy. Yeah. So I'm celebrating hundred k today. That's crazy. Yeah. When you wake up, when you wake up, you gonna get it. Yeah, probably when I wake, cause it's cause it's two o'clock where I'm at. So by the time I wake wow. up, nine o'clock. Yeah. Dude, you was at 68.5 when you came on my channel. How long ago was that? It had to be a month. What? That was the, the, the new year, right? The new year when you got a thousand subs, right? You were saying? Oh, okay. Yeah. So it was since the new year. Oh, yeah, year. yeah, yeah. You had a thousand subs when I got on the show. Yep. Yeah. Yeah. That's, sure that's one reason why you came on. Yeah. 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 Yep. When was that, man? Well, appreciate uh, the congratulations. Lo uh, love. Uh, entertainment tv and hd chilling shout out to you for right supporting here. my <clears throat> channel and um right. looking out right how many videos you got he got like uh how many videos you got check i got like 200 like probably like 216 217 wow. wow you put in that work man you deserve it man you put in that yeah. work jan 28 january 28 you had 68.68.5 Oh, they, wow. so, <laughs> he got the big boss got the receipts. Got the receipts. <laughs> yeah, I know he got you can't hey you cannot make up some story on Big Ball Show, bro. He'll pull up the, he'll pull up the receipts pull and you say, Hey receipt. man, I didn't say that. And he'll go up and, and look at the video and be like, Yes, you did. <laughs> you got the drone. Oh yeah, man. And so January 28th to March uh 12th, you jumped up almost 30k subs. That is crazy. Crazy, crazy, crazy. Courtesy see a big boss. Huh? Courtesy yeah. Boss. You, yeah. You. Hey, uh, after <laughs> once I hit 100, because you know, I always I always had the title, the under uh, Mr. Underrated. That used to be my title. Oh, okay. But I guess I'm going to hang up the title uh, today and probably uh, pass it on to somebody else. Mm. All right. Wow. That's what's up, man. That's what's up. Yeah, man. You a real one, bro. You a real one. You, you step down. You step down in the trenches. To mess with bossy boss man you oh no nah, but i knew you but we we've been rocking with each other before <clears> you <throat> even had your channel though yeah, you before, know what i'm saying yeah, but right. Yeah, you're right but you know how, but you know you know how some you some youtubers can be man especially when they reach a certain level you know they be like ah oh, man you got to get your weight up before i come on your channel you know <laughs> you, you know what i'm saying and you wouldn't even like that so you you a real one bro in my book i don't care what nobody say they might talk about you bad but you're a real one in my book yeah <laughs> So we got a uh, we got Zoom we got Zoom. Too bad you went on here. Hey Zoom, get the link. Come back on real fast. Come back on before um check checks out. Zoom to Thailand. Congrats. The trick for the smaller YouTubers is to come on the live with the big or YouTubers. Get some shine. Use that as commercial for your own channel. That's how I did it with the lead attorney. Oh, that's, that's true. Uh, no, that's true. That's true. Um, 
Yeah, I'm I'm actually I'm actually gonna be um I'm actually gonna be putting like some some clips together like the Zoom shouting me out. And I'm gonna use check check in effect too, man. But that's the thing, like we all like wanna build it together, man. And um nice. like how we how we all, especially us as brothers, like we all building this thing, man. Like this is a beautiful thing, man. This is a real beautiful thing. In the matrix, nice. outside the matrix, wherever you at. Like as long as us brothers, we understand. Like we we come from something, and we building this together. We uplifting each other. You know what I'm saying? Because we've seen people who don't look like us do right. that, and it, and it's been way past time for us to do that. Right. Facts. And Facts. it's so and, it, and it's no excuse. It's so easy to do. It's just a clip. Yes, it's some schedule out your time. We all are busy. The content creators and whatnot. We all are busy. We working. We making content. We traveling. But outside of getting getting our time schedules together, all it is is a little bit of time. Right. If you're right. a big you if you're a big YouTuber and you only can give somebody 10, 15 minutes, that's great. If you're a small YouTuber, you can give somebody an hour, that's great. It's just time. Right. What does it take to pull up on somebody's <clears throat> channel and say, Hey, what's up? Right. Yo, 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 this is my man. Subscribe to my man. Peace. How much does that cost? I would say I would recommend having that notification bell on and soon as that person get on on a live be one of the first 20 30 people there because yeah. if it's a big youtuber he has so many yeah. super um, he has so many chats and it's going so fast right so either two things you could do is jump on early you know therefore you can get a shout out or even donate and when you donate it's right there and he's going to read it no matter what so boom that's right. an easy shout yep. out right there from the donation but yeah. once it's once it's up to like three, four hundred, yeah. three, four hundred people in the building, man, yeah, your message right. is barely gonna get read. Cause like even me, I'm trying to read messages, and sometimes I'm missing, and somebody will hit me up on IG saying, "Oh, check, why you didn't read my <laughs> messages, man?" Uh, I'm like, "Come on, bro, I had three, four hundred people on the live. How am I gonna read one message?" You know what I'm saying? So yeah, not it ain't. It's so. not like somebody disrespecting you not reading your messages. It really goes fast. Right. Like I watch uh I watched Zoom to Thailand live with uh Michael and he had a lot of people on that live. And yeah. I know them, I know no, them chats did. was going like fast, you know what I'm saying? Yep. You can't catch all of them. So it's like that sometimes. Mm. Yeah, like yeah, uh, you know, no, you definitely right because um I, I got it in the middle of when he was talking to uh Michael um uh, Michael Jai White and uh yeah. and, and that and that chat room was going off. Like, Man. Yeah, like you can't, you can't, you can't catch. Yeah, it was so many messages in there. You can't catch everything. So exactly. Um, but you know what? Shout out to Zoom. He did a great job, though. Um, he had. I, I watched that stream too, and I mm -hmm. came on at the end. He had over. He had almost eight hundred people watching. Almost mm -hmm. eight hundred people with a lot of chats. Zoom did a great job, humanly possible, reading almost every super super chat. You know, of course, right. it's the way he had to do it. You know, he had talked with uh, Michael John and then stop him and then read and go back and forth. But shout out to uh, Richie Mack. He did a great job keeping up with the Super Chats. Right. Facts. Yeah. Yep. It's, especially when it's orange and pink. Ooh. Ah. <laughs> yeah, that's true. That's you can't true. miss those colors. You can't. Hey, <laughs> you know what? I'm not going to miss this color right here because my guy right here, Uh, you know what I'm saying? I, I appreciate him, Omar Suarez, with the dollar ninety nine. I was the first person he ever super chatted uh, on my last uh, last week, and um, for weeks before that, he said, "Hey, when I get some money together, I'm gonna try to give you a super chat." So I appreciate it, man. I appreciate it when it comes from the heart, man. Yeah. So Omar, you can give me ninety nine cent, and that's like you giving me a hundred dollars, only from you though, only from you. Shout out to Omar, man. I see you. Uh, yes, sir. But yeah, like you said, uh, check especially when they um orange and um. Pink. Yeah. I ain't got too many purples. I got a purple before though. Purple is a fifty bucks, and a red. A red is a hundred, right? Red is a hundred. Yeah. yeah. Red is a hundred. <clears throat> purple is fifty, and a twenty and twenty dollars is like orange, orange. and ten dollars is yellow. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah, but you know, even like. <clears throat> even if the, some people, you know, it's not even all of, I mean, obviously that helps, but it's not about the super chats, but somebody just watching 
your whole video can help your channel a lot it helps. with the click. It helps with mm -hmm. the um with the duration, the click through rate. They see checking effect. They click on it. They see uh real talk. They click. It helps with that. You know, it helps with the with the algorithm and all that. And at the end of the day, that helps your channel grow also. So right. that can you know that's just a, as important as a super chat. Yeah, right. you know it is. You know, for real, like you say, do either or. Uh, if you know. <clears throat> Because it can get kind of expensive, right? You know, sometimes I even got to watch it. You know, I I pay it forward because I'm a content creator. I know how hard it is. Uh, so I appreciate other content creators. But sometimes I got to watch it because it's so easy now to get the money. It's so easy to do it on your phone. And then a right. month later, you say, what? <laughs> but hey, man. But you know what? You know what I'm saying? We spend money um, on other things. So like I say, I don't really club like that while I'm in the States because, you know, I'm travel minded. So a lot of that money I'm not wasting at the clubs. I can give to content creators. You know what I'm saying? That's giving me value. Entertainment is value and knowledge and information is really value. Right. Right. Yeah. Especially, especially Razor Ray. Razor Ray channel gives a lot of value. Cartagena. You have an effect, give a ton of value, Richie Mack and everybody. So you, this YouTube, what people are getting for free from watching the video, back in the day, you would have to like go to a travel agent or some shit like that. You know what I mean? <coughs> so That's you true. get a lot of upfront free right. value. So what's $5 or $10 or $20 or more for all the value, saving you time, uh, like I say, one of the earliest videos I saw about Razor Ray before I even knew him, he was giving um, reviews on hotel, guest friendly hotel. Up, <laughs> how, what, how valuable is that information to somebody on the ground? Yeah. You know what yeah. I mean? That's just an example. We froze. That's actually very valuable because you'll be feeling like shit if you went to Cartagena, you get a hotel and you can't bring nobody over. So, you know what I mean? Yeah. That's kind of, uh, and, and then, and then you, you already booked it for a whole you, week. <laughs> you already, you already booked right. it. Right. Hundred, what, what, two, three hundred dollars already. Yeah. Booked. So exactly. what is $20? So what is a $20? What is a $50 super chat? If I just right. say, if I just saved you that headache, what is $50? Exactly. So people right. got to think of it in that, in that mind frame. Absolutely. Like, you, you know, like, you know, like back in the days uh, when we all like used to do like book reports or whatever for, for school, we had to go physically to the library and look up all this information. So like if people can't give, you know, 10, 15, 20 dollars, whatever it is to get this information and you also get some entertainment value because, you know, when the library, you couldn't go and make noise like the, the library, like they would kick you out. <laughs> they they always had that mean, they had that mean old lady, the mean old oh, lady. Right. Yeah. The library. <laughs> yeah. She said wear her glasses like this. <laughs> right. So they have a ruler. Yeah. Exactly. Yeah. But, um, you know, all jokes aside, but we, we able to get this information just by, you know, just by clicking a video and looking up information, right? So if somebody wants to know something about, you know, uh, Southeast Asia, particularly Philippines and Thailand, you go to Zoom. Go to Zoom. Zoom. You know what I mean? If you um, want to know about Cartagena, you know, right? Raise a raise. And, raise. And, and, and what you just said, like you don't want to spend two, three, four hundred dollars um, on, on a hotel, and you can't you you can't enjoy yourself. You don't want that. You don't want that. You definitely don't want that. We super fat. We super fat. You can't enjoy yourself. Now, Richie Mack, you back You back with the echo. Richie Mack, mute yourself. Mute yourself and click over. You back with the echo. No. Um, I know how to fix that. There it is. No, I think when you hey, log on the computer, <laughs> when you log on the computer, YouTube's part is playing and also the StreamYard part is playing. So that's <clears> why it's echoing. You got yeah, he got to cut one of them. He got to cut one of them off. He can right. mute or just one. mute one of them. Just mute yeah, that's, that's yeah. Yeah. OG, my co-pilot used to do that all the time. Every, yes, time, I, well, every so, time I bring up OG, only nah, twice, ain't no boss. fight. You well, say? let me tell you. So there's a video. Twice, well, 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 let me tell you. There's a there's a video. <laughs> there's a there's a video. There's a video on, on Flyboy's channel where I did that, and like the whole chat was saying, like, 
dude sound like he's underwater. And I'm like, I'm like, why they keep clowning me? It's because I had YouTube playing and I was on uh the stream yard. This that's was a big that's what does it. That's what that's exactly what does it. Yep. Yeah. And that's exactly what it was. <laughs> oh, I, oh, I told you, Ricky. That. <laughs> that's exactly what it was. Yeah, I'm trying to pick that. I'm gonna turn shit up. <laughs> what up, though? You shit, but you know, back then there wasn't a lot of brothers doing YouTube, uh, giving out this info. You know, so many people are actually starting to get a passport. And fly and go to different countries because back then brothers wasn't even thinking about passports. No, you know what I mean, it was I like, know I wasn't. you know, no. it was like, man, you know, so I, I watching my channel, I know a lot of people actually applied for a passport and you know, check, I applied for my passport, check, you know, so it, it's we help out a lot of people with these traveling channels and you know, what I'm saying, showing them the ropes and avo and raise a raise of these videos with robberies. That you never know, somebody could be in a situation, yeah. and 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 um, they could see, they could feel like, oh, I remember Raise a Raise video when somebody got this person got robbed. This is the same tricky situation. Nah, let me stay yeah. away from that. You know, right, right. So, yeah. and 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 me personally, I never been to Thailand, and now I'm thinking about going there. Well, I'm not thinking I am gonna go there. Right. So you know what I'm saying? Uh -oh. <laughs> oh yeah. Uh oh. We we so every, everybody. I, 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 think, I think we got somebody on the panel who know a little something about Thailand. <laughs> right. <laughs> hey, hey! I just want to say, man. You know, all you brothers, man, just positive brothers. Check. I'm so happy for you, man. I just want you to know, man. I, I was already subscribed. I didn't just start. You know, D ride like 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 once boss put me on to see who you was. I was there, so I love what you're doing. Give it up to all you guys. Kings and dreams on the come up. What up, OG? Yeah, Gotta say hi to everybody, up, man. That's a good thing. But when y'all brothers come to Thailand, boss boss, I, I, I know. Boss explains it better than everybody, but man, it, 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 it's, it's, it's hard to believe, man. It really is. Y'all gotta be better. Man. No, I, yeah. I'll I'll tell you, I'll, I'll tell you, man. Uh, like. I was watching, I was watching MTR and MTR put me on. And then like, I basically was like, I'm not saying this because you were on the panel, but real talk, I was binge watching your videos and I'm like, dude, like I need to go there now. And I'm looking up the information and I'm like, oh, they, you know, it's locked down. I'm like, damn, it's like a fish to get in there. But I'm like, I, but in it, the interest was there like immediately. So um, kind of like uh, kind of like what uh, what Chuck was saying, like that information wasn't privy to us, you know, back then. And then now, like we have all of these um, content creators that are, you know, having these channels talking about different locations all around the world and encouraging, you know, men who look like us to get passports. So that's a beautiful thing. The thing I don't get, I, yeah. I still think maybe you can tap in on this. I don't get how. Y'all gotta explain this to me, man. Like seriously, I got I got intelligent brothers, raise and raise. I got everybody OG. Y'all gotta explain to me how it's humanly possible to hate on a black man for having a passport. That's part one of the question. That's part one. Part two is how are y'all even wasting y'all time trying to explain yourselves? Like, you don't owe nobody no explanation for being happy and living your life. So y'all got to help me with that, man. How does anybody <laughs> hate on somebody for having... We're going we to we let OG, OG, you answer that. The, <laughs> o, the only non-YouTuber on here. <laughs> I don't know why people hate on other people success or, you know, I, I really don't. It's just, I think it's just selfish and jealousy. Some people don't want to do it. Some people want to do it and they can't. And then they get mad when somebody else is doing it. <clears throat> so they want to, you know, bring them down. I just don't get it, though. I mean, it should be motivation, though, I would think. You know what I mean? Because we're not bothering nobody. You know what I mean? I'm out here in Thailand. Like, what what, what I do? <laughs> <laughs> yes, um, well, I, I didn't know if anybody wanted to go next, but I, I guess I'll, I'll kind of piggyback. Yeah, like the the simplest thing is that unfortunately you know people are miserable and when they see people being happy enjoying the, their lives and traveling they get jealous of that and maybe it's because they're prop they're not managing their finances properly 
and they're not taking care of their business. Uh, one of the reasons why, like, I want to start my channel and I, 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 you know, I preach about men being RP aware. This is one of the things about being aware, making sure that you're taking care of your finances, making sure that you can, you know, put yourself in a position to where you can be happy. You know what I mean? Like you went to Thailand, like, you know, for business and now you're out there full time. You enjoy living your life, you know, playing golf and and that's that's a beautiful thing but some people will see that like oh man like well what did he do to deserve that like no he you know you took the time to take care of your finances and this is how you can enjoy your life and right. other, men, other men can do that too sorry not to cut you off. i was just gonna say other men can do that too but they end up spending their finances on probably bs right but here's my issue i get that and that makes sense i get all of that yeah. The part I don't get is like we all I can't I speak for everybody on here. We all come from a rap culture. Right. We all know what flossing look like. We all know what flexing look like. Mm -hmm. We all know what stunting look like. We all know what jewelry look like. Yep. We all know what flash and money look like. We're not doing that. Like I can see the envy for that because you're like, damn, this nigga's got this cold. This nigga, you know, but we're we're giving the game, trying to right. encourage people to do better. That's that's the part that like blows my mind, you know what I mean. So yes, right. I, I agree. Well, I, okay, go ahead, check, go ahead, go ahead, check. I, I had, I mean, and when it came to my channel in the beginning, when I first started doing videos, you have no haters. Like, and then when your videos become, when you become monetized, your channel start growing. That's when all of a sudden haters come out, and a lot. There's, I mean, there's several reasons. One reason, it could be somebody building a platform, trying to build something against you it could be a person who's trying to build something to where he can make a video about you to build clout to get clout to get your audience to Come his on. Mm -hmm. you know what i'm saying so when you when he was when you when he writes when he writes something and you respond to him now you're giving him shine especially if you mention his name because now it's like oh who's this guy that's talking about zoom the mm -hmm. let me go on his channel and see him so a lot mm -hmm. of time it's, it's all clout that's one second reason is it could be people just jealousy, man. You know what I mean? Just jealous of you traveling, jealous of you having a good time, jealous of your life because that person can't live that life that you have. Exactly. Now, I, in the beginning, I used to, I used to entertain that, and when I, when I, when I, when I was entertaining that, my channel would not grow. As soon as I let that go and I stopped letting that affect my channel, my channel started growing. And guess what? That hater disappeared. But there's always a new one that comes. They come like every six months. <laughs> It'll be a new one that comes. You know, they'll say stupid shit on your channel like, hey, I don't know why you guys go to another country to look at these women. And I turn around the question and respond, well, I don't know why you guys look at YouTube and look at these women on YouTube. So you're doing the same Hello? thing. You're, you know what I mean? Yeah, with your so, thirsty self. Why <laughs> do those videos with those thumbnails get the most clicks and views? Right. Exactly. Exactly. But the reason why I say that about the 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 haters is because it, it, I, it I'm living proof. Somebody I had a hater that was talking, 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 and next thing you know, he had a channel, and his channel was based off of that. Off you? you? Know what I'm saying? Off of you? His whole channel was based yeah. off you? No, it was it was well not all, not all oh, of it okay. off of me, but other off mm -hmm. other YouTubers also. Okay. Yeah. 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 So that, that, yeah. But that's the thing. Me. I'm sorry. Go ahead, Ray. I'm sorry. I jumped in on yeah. you. I, I know who he's talking about. That troll, that mega troll. I call them because they have channels. That's why I say mega troll because they have people in the, in the comments. They have a channel and they will make up. I seen checking effect on that guy's uh, channel before. Like, why does checking effect go there? Right. And uh, why is he even, you know, going down to that uh, that troll channel and uh, putting putting himself through that? And but uh, it was it was entertaining though. To be honest, with you. But, <laughs> I'm not gonna name the, the name the troll. Don't. But it's basically not on my channel. Do not name. You will do names. Yeah. Mm -hmm. Hey, check. I need to see that one. Hey, Rays. I need to see that one though. <laughs> I need to see how I need to see how Check handled that because I don't give him no shine. But I think that at all. me neither. Yeah, uh, I think all those oh, big are big boss. That's the dude. That's the dude you showed me the other day. Yeah. Okay. Okay. Yeah. 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 Oh, you know, you know what I'm talking about. Yeah. I think it got deleted. I think it got deleted. Uh, yeah. 
Yeah, but it was man, cool. hold on. Shout out to Love Entertainment, man. He didn't put all of us up in there. <laughs> I appreciate that. Man. Hey, 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 Rage, Rage, don't make me take this shirt off, Rage. Don't make me <laughs> I know, right? Hey, hey, I think we got enough people. I think we can jump Rage now, man. We can take him. Come on. I'm ready. I'm ready. Hey, we got to get him more drunker. Drink some more drinks. <laughs> <laughs> I got out of basin, man. Oh, man. <laughs> I didn't expect checking the fucking Zoom to Thailand to be up here. Man, I that's the plug. Anything it's happened? Good. Anything happened on Big Boss Show, man? Hey, and that's and that's show, man. Hey, and like Check was saying, like y'all gotta understand, it's like some people say on oh, Zoom, like you doing this, you you know, you got fifty k subs, man. How quick do I have to humble myself when Check is about to hit a hundred in ten more minutes? Yeah, right. <laughs> everybody, everybody, everybody's gonna be bigger than you, so it don't really matter what it everybody's is. Everybody's gonna be bigger. And who you are, so, the, so like you know, people like 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 Big Boss Kings and Dreams, even you, Ray. It's like y'all doing y'all thing. As long as you stay consistent and do what you're doing, you're gonna get there. Like Check says something that I pay strict attention to. He he got over two hundred something videos. That's a lot of fucking work. Uh, he no, that's a lot of work. He deserves it. You know what I mean? Yeah, yeah. Like Big Boss said, he struggled to get his thousand. I did see, you know, it, it, it's it's hard, but that's the whole point. YouTube do that. Like Reigns was saying, like they put you through it to see yes. if you're really gonna make it through this boot camp to see if yes. you're really worthy to be getting them Google checks. Mm -hmm. So you know what I mean. So they put you through it, man. So don't get discouraged. Don't pay attention to the numbers as much. Even though I do, I look all the time. Like my numbers is like <laughs> slowing down. Thank you. <laughs> I should have slowed it down. It does that. It yeah. does that. It yeah. it'll slow it'll slow down and then eventually. A uh, one one video would have like shock value. That's mm. what it's called. One video have shock value. Once that one video have shock value, you're gonna mm. see the rest of your videos go up again. That's how yeah. it works. It's crazy. Yeah. That's it does that thing. to a lot of people. Uh -huh. I was wondering though. I was taking it personal. <laughs> like what I do? It to, All I have was Michael Jackson. Yeah, yeah, yeah. It, it, it that, that the way YouTube works is weird, man. Like it, it uh, they'll like. They'll, you'll get push, 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 and then all of a sudden it'll slow down. And then once you get that one shock value video, you'll mm -hmm. see the other video start pushing again. Yeah, okay. it's it's oh. like a you, you know like I, I don't know if, if any of y'all football fans, but it's kind of like that running back like throughout the game get like mm -hmm. one or two yards, maybe sure. three yards. Mm -hmm. Then it's like that big hole they just bust for like a seventy yard gain. And, and yeah. Edgar and James. Oh, yeah. Yeah, exactly. Yeah, yep, exactly. And then you know, kind of what uh, Chuck was saying, that one video that gives like that shock value opens the floodgates, and there you go. You know, exactly. Hey, it's like it's like what Big Boss said about uh, raising raise. We all can jump, raise and raise. All of us, <laughs> all of our numbers together can't jump. Can't, can't, can't right. jump check. You know what I mean? Nope. No, but listen, I <laughs> I've Joe seen... fifty raise two my one. Uh, no disrespect, <laughs> Kenya Dream. That's all right. He coming. No, no well, yeah, I, I'm. I'm. You know, I know I'm the rookie. I, I kind of just started. Like, I know y'all might have seen me on Flyboys, but like now I'm doing my own thing. So, right, it's all good. I love yeah. Flyboy Way too, man. That's what we need. We need to add Flyboy Way to the stream. Flyboy is cool. And then we can jump. We can. We can jump. Check. <laughs> Hold on. Let me. Let me hold him up. Yo, fifty. He's forty. Well, yeah, he, shit, that's ninety. He, he, He's in Miami right now. now. Hey, Chuck, we coming for you, Chuck. <laughs> That's hey, not enough. Hey, That's not hey, enough. We still hey, don't have um, enough. This is how I feel, personally, how I feel <laughs> when, out, it come in, when it comes to when it When it comes to YouTube, I feel like it's a marathon, not a race. Because right. I've started, and, like, I remember one time, I remember I had, like, uh, 5,000 subscribers, and there was another dude who had, like, 6,000 subscribers, and I watched this dude channel go from 6,000 all the way to 45,000. 45, and from that 45,000, from my 5,000, I only jumped probably like 2,000. And then eventually, my channel passed hit, ended up passing his channel. So that's why I say it's a marathon. Right. And it, you know, somebody will blow up, you can blow up, anybody can blow up. Right. You know, right. and it could be that one video that gets you 10, 15,000 subscribers. Just right. that one video. Oh, one right. video. <clears throat> yeah. But it's like one. it's like what I say. What I what I say, and Boss said it earlier too. 
it's this is not rocket scientists, man. All, science. All we have to do is just stick together, bro, and, and, and form a printable, impenetrable wall around the haters where they can't bust through, and the good people that's really working hard, putting it down, support each other, and we can win, man. It's not a hard concept, you know what I mean? So. You know, we got we to gotta bring up brothers like Kings and Dreams. You got to bring up the plug, Big Boss. You know, we got to do our things. That's why, y'all, when I say, you know, I got Ace Live, my, my man Dre from Andrea and, and, and Andrea Love Crossing Borders hooked me up with Ace Live. You know what I mean? Okay. have to do that. Dre, uh, uh, Big Boss, is hooking me up with Checks in Effect. You know what I mean? And then that way we can help pick y'all up. So like I said, when I do my stream and, and Checks got a good thing, I can't see everything that's going on, but I can see the Super Chats. So that's how you promote yourself. You jump on there with us, with yep. me and Michael Jai Wilder, me and Check Effect, and you get to have that that minute, that 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 minute to shine and use it for your shit. Like I said, that's what I did with um with with, with um TLA, the lead attorney. Yeah. So y'all take advantage of it. That's the dream. That's what it is. It's yeah. cool. Oh, oh, you oh yeah. Bro, I'm, you yeah, get I'm way definitely, more yeah. yeah, I'm definitely gonna right. do that. But you know who? But you know who TLA? You know who mm -hmm. TLA used? Right, because 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 it's okay. all like the domino effect. He, uh, he used KS because KS oh. hopped on there and he uh, took clips uh, of him having conversations with, uh, with with him and Kevin Samuels, and his page blew up even more. Yeah, it's it's yeah. a whole domino effect. It is. We just got to stick together, bro. But you know, the bigger YouTubers like 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 Boss said, sometimes they won't come on. Like I got people I've written that don't oh, even respond. Shit. Yeah, I, yeah, yeah. I, I just I just sent him the link. So okay. Oh, there he is. There he I, is. I have, I have people, I have I have people going, that didn't respond, but responding back now. <laughs> hey, 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 check. It's called the Vapors. Shout out to Biz Marquis. Shout out to Biz Marquis, man. Yeah. And that's what it is. It shouldn't have to come to that. But, 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 hey, check. Don't lie. You know it feels good when they do that, though, right? Yeah, yeah, yeah it does. It does. It does. <laughs> it does. Hey, check, check. I, I, yo, uh, I want to just like uh, thank you for popping into my chats on my streams. You you be popping in is like that's great. Just you typing, taking you know time out to type into my live stream chats is is you know I'm oh I'm, nah, you I'm know, happy I... to talk to you and tell you in person. You know, but on this YouTube platform that I, I appreciate you hopping into my chats. Nah, no tell problem, you. man. You know, you know, Big cool. J, Big J's the homie. I hang on. I hung out with Big J a couple times. Oh yeah, okay. and I discovered you from Big J. So once it's Big J deep. told me you were, you was official, Big J said, "Yeah, he's official." Yeah. I, I, I that was it. I said, "Say less." I told Big J, "Say less." Big that was J it. Came to the Dominican Republic. Yeah. Okay. Yeah. All right. Yeah. 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 Thank you. Thank you. I appreciate you. No problems, bro. But I'm gonna let you guys go, man. It was <laughs> nice talking, man. I got a, a I got a, a one of the guys from rio is over here and we're doing something at 10 in the morning and it's like three almost three right now so uh it's hard for me to get up early so i'm gonna go ahead and call it in man it was nice oh flyboy hey, why hey, i gotta go with flyboy why i gotta go with flyboy here before you go you gotta say he got the do rag like tupac p-o-y Okay. Uh, you, you, you got to spell it out. <laughs> you got to spell it out. <laughs> <laughs> What's going on, everybody? This is your boy, F-L-Y. Come on, X-Y. F-L-Y, B-O-Y, W-A-Y. Don't ask me. I'm just in the house. Damn, you're in the Matrix. You're in the Matrix, cuz. You're in the Matrix. Huh? You're in the Matrix. You're in the Matrix, cuz. Man, yeah. I mean, I, I, I think, I think, uh, Miami got to have some weapon. I think Miami got to be like something else because of all the international box here, man. I literally just knocked down like. Uh, oh wait, this not. Hmm. Do Keep tell. it clean. It keep it there. clean. You, you, stop, you, you ain't got to keep it clean. This is a big ball show. You ain't got to keep it clean. <laughs> <laughs> I want to hear it. Why your, why your Wi-Fi got to mess up? Yeah. I, just turn, I, just, I, just turn, I just turn my Wi-Fi on, on, on my phone. But I literally... All right, so quick, quick story time. It's going to be a story time in the future. But you guys will get it first. Um, so as you guys know, I got my place in South Beach. And I was down here this morning, right? And this, this girl... This girl was going to um this woman was going to Spain, but she had like a seven hour layover in Miami. 
So she and it, it, within her layover, she came to my house. So we smashed. I got some top, and then I took her back to the airport. Literally, she's from Hawaii. She lived in Hawaii. She was going to Spain, and she just so stopped in Miami for the first time. So I had a long day. I've been up just like eight this wow. morning. Wow. What's going on, everybody? Yo? Right. Wow. Wow. Big ball. Ten games. Boom. Boy, Jay, man. She, got the she got the Tupac do rag on. She's feeling the vibe. <laughs> oh, yeah. I just came from um, Uncut Miami. Um, it's like a little little nightclub in Miami. This girl, okay. from, this girl from London I met in um. Oh my in, god! Uh, Spain, London. What's no, yeah, you know, I met a girl from London when I was in um Canada, and she had like a little a little shindig there. So many women there. Yeah. Crazy. Who you think? Who you think you are, Negro? Oh, that's that same. Oh, you know, that's that same. Oh, no, no. That's that same. Who you, man? Tell me the thing. Well, big boss, big boss, you saw you, 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 you was doing the big movies in Fly the Carmen, man. Yeah, big boss, big boss, is bringing a set to women, man. I was trying. I, I, now he did. A, no he lack did. of trying, man. <laughs> I, oh, I man. saw you doing your thing. You hollered at that chick from France. You just walked up <laughs> on her, got the number. I got, I still got the footage. I don't know what to do with it though. <laughs> <laughs> there it is. Oh, so I gotta man. give a shout out to y'all before I go too. I gotta get you know what I'm about to do. So I ain't even gotta tell y'all what I'm about to do. I'm about to get my edit on. But uh man, fly boy, you know I love you, bro. We we got no, some work no, we, 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 <laughs> uh chatted up behind the scenes, so you know I'm always here when you need um retired, man. Yeah, yeah, do your do your thing and check, check. I need that. Uh boss gonna send me your info. I, I did, I did already. Okay, good, <laughs> Look, good, okay. Not- Okay, For sure. I'm gonna get on if I can get up on that stream, Kings and Dreams. You said it'll be morning time, my time, right? Yeah, so, um, yeah, I'm gonna so I'm gonna be doing um, so um, I'm gonna be doing a collab with Razor Rays on his channel. Um, okay, yeah, so so it's gonna be so it's gonna be nine o'clock in the morning, your time. Okay, just hit me a link, and then and then, uh, and then on Monday, and then on Monday, the big panel is going to be uh, Big Boss, Flyboy, uh, and the two other uh, content creators. Uh, that's going to be on my channel, and then that's going to be at 8 a.m. your time. Hey man, you better than me because I can't get Flyboy away on my channel. Well, that's my best friend. Dang, Flyboy, why you like that, man? Nah, man. I got lucky. I got lucky and got on my channel. He told me he had to check his schedule. He was like, you know what, check. I got to check my schedule. I'm, I'm free this day. I had to. I had to cut my live and wait for the day he was free to be able to put. Me. Uh, we, 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 we went to high school together, so he can't dodge me. I know where he lives. So. <laughs> You, oh, have okay, all that dirt. you have all that personal dirt. Negro don't let right, me. Don't right, let right. me tell him about that time when. <laughs> That's what's up, man. But yeah, man. So I'm gonna let y'all have it, man. I'll yeah, see I'm out of here too, man. Yeah, right. yeah, yeah. Check and, Zoom, uh, man. Salute to both of y'all, man. Um, you know, uh, congratulations. Uh, check hitting that hundred k. Zoom, you, you, you definitely on your way, man. Um, you know, so. I, I will definitely be popping up in your chat in y'all lives, like yo, what's up? <laughs> so as you should. Yeah, we on our way. It, it ain't a me or or you or I. Yeah, it's we. We, it's we, 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 exactly. we. Us, us, us. I'm gonna go. I, what I do, like I told boss, when I'm editing, I'll go back and I have like I don't know if you see the TV back there, but I'm yeah. like listening to y'all and watch y'all in the background. I'm yeah. about to catch up on my check and effect video because check go kind of hard on them. You know what I mean? So I'm yeah. gonna go check, do my research. And uh and really get in. I'm gonna I'm gonna try and find that video that Razor Razor is talking about too. I'm gonna see what I can do. But I'm gonna go in and do that, man. But man, shout out to y'all, all of y'all, man. And I'll see y'all. I'll catch y'all on the next one. Yes, all right, bro. All right, y'all boys. I'm out of here too. All okay. right, man. Peace. Peace. Right. Thank you for pulling up. We just had Richie Mac zoom to Thailand and check in full effect. And we have the flyboy way. I think you kind of froze, man. Flyboy, yeah. He, he yeah, he froze. Um, yeah, yeah. He's he's probably gonna have to reset his um, right, his, his his router or something. Yeah, yeah, yeah. So what I'm gonna do? I'm gonna help you out. Um, far be it from Big Boss to kick off Flyboy, but I'm gonna help you. I'm gonna kick you off. Boom. Um, come back on. You got the link. Come back on. But I, I kicked them <laughs> off so it can reset. Yeah. That's what's up, man. Razor Ray HD chilling. Thanks, bro. 
thing. And shout out to Razor Ray for coming on the chat early yeah, on, man. man. It was just only the bossy boss. Boss was on the ropes, and Razor Ray came in and tagged me in. Tag me in. And Razor Ray just came in and helped out the bossy boss. A shout out to Razor Ray. Razor Ray is a real one. Um, Zoom yeah. leading the way in Thailand. Venice Whalen chick was nice fly boy. Oh, yeah, 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 yeah. Yeah, he's talking about the, uh, the, 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 the twin. Yeah. The twin. Woo. Yeah. Was nice. That was nice. That was nice. She was nice, man. Yeah. Epic live. Epic. Not <clears throat> definitely, definitely epic, man. Definitely epic. Definitely epic. For some reason, for some reason, like, for some reason, I was like, I was like, I know. Let me send that super chat early. Yeah. Set the toe, man. Set, set the, the toe. toe. Yeah. yeah. It's up to you. I guess you, you good karma. You said you sent that early super chat. That was good karma to set everything up. Moochie T I, says, I just love how you brothers are supporting each other. That is what we should do in all areas of life, uplifting each other. A rising tide lift all boats. I like that. I first heard uh yeah. I first heard uh what you call it say that first uh Ben Carson. Now, however you feel about him, but Ben Dr. Ben <clears throat> yeah. Carson, he said that. He said a rising tide lifts all boats. And speaking of lifting boats, boom. You suffers at this dollar sign. The dollar sign flyboy way. Man, you got you guys gotta bear with me because I'm gonna be so low energy. I told you guys I had a long day. Well, nah, well, so hold on. Good, so man. I got I got a question to that. How did you come up on the um Hawaiian chick that lay over seven hours? How did you yeah. meet her? How did you My, how? How way? My, how? My, Miami just different. OG, what's up, man? What's, what's up, up flyboy? Miami just different, bro. Like this is this, this is like the second time. It happened where it just things worked out exactly how it's supposed to work out. Like I literally, yo, I literally talked to her this morning. Her plane landed in Miami. <laughs> her plane landed in Miami at seven o'clock. Her plane landed in Miami at seven o'clock. She contacted me at seven thirty. She was over here by seven by eight eight fifteen, and she stayed until I dropped off at the airport at two o'clock. And like I said, just Tinder, man. Tinder, okay. Tinder. Oh, okay, off Tinder. Ah, and, and you and you met her on Tinder like the same day, like within that same day. You just met. I, I met her. Or I had you been talking to her like for a week, like a week. No, no, I met her seven. I made her met her like seven fifteen this morning. And by eight fifteen, she was at my. She was at the crib. Wow, I'm saying the Tinder match. You met the. You met her on Tinder today too. I met wow. her on so, so not like not like no one week, no one week of pregame and the two weeks. Not not at all. Like I literally say, yo. Come by, hang out. She didn't want to sit in the airport for for seven hours. Right. Her uh, flight was her, her layover was seven hours from Hawaii. Look so, at you oh. in a central location, right by the airport, man. You can come up a lot like that, man. It seems like now. I mean, I thought I thought it was that way, but it's not even that way because New Jersey is a central location, and so is New York. But this is only happens in Miami, man. Only in <clears> Miami, <throat> huh? Yeah, my, oh, yeah. Miami. Yeah, Miami is. Uh, it's yeah, my, my Miami is so so different, like because like man, like you could meet people like who sound like uh like who had the accent like checking effect, and then there could be some people who may sound like me and Flyboy or you, Big Boss or OG, like and they could be from there too. Like it's it's just it's it's weird. I, I don't want to say weird like in a bad way, but I mean like it's just its own different type of world. Like it is so like. Stuff like what just happened this morning, like I can see that only happening in Miami. Only or Miami. Maybe I got Vegas. Moved to Miami then. My, Miami or Vegas. Those are the yeah, only Vegas, two huh? that I could see Vegas. something like that happening. They just ready, huh? Is it something about being there? You know what? It's funny you say that because you know, I'll be watching the um the videos of the these youngsters, these several youngsters that's always in Miami, uh, you know, hollering at the chicks, you know, asking them mm -hmm. questions and whatnot. And it seems like when the girls be in Miami, they be ready. They be in a different frequency. He said, where you oh, from? Shoot. I'm, I'm from North Carolina. I'm from here. I'm from there. But when they in Miami, man, they be ready. They be turned up. Hold up. Yeah. I got some footage I can show you guys. <laughs> okay. I haven't okay. uploaded this yet. But it's on, my, it's on my laptop. I don't know. If, oh, shoot. All right. That was my yeah. Yeah. It's on my laptop. Oh, yeah, shoot. Share the screen. What were you about to say, um, King? 
Yeah, no, I, w- I was going to say while, while Flyboy's uh, getting that together, um, I was just going to say, like, I, I think it's because I think it's because of uh, like Miami is like it's such like a big like melting pot. And it's so much like it's so much competition. Like everybody's like trying to do like four or five different things because like like everybody's on a hustle there. Like mm. some type of hustle, some type of come up or whatever. And then like uh, like. A, a large percentage of, of the women are attractive, you know, what, what, you know, what, whether they're coming from overseas, whether they're coming from the East coast, the West coast, you know, um, Europe, wherever they all come in to Miami. It's a centralized location beach. And, uh, especially like if you're like traveling to the Caribbean or, um, Latin America, it's right there. So like I, when they come there, it's like, they instantly know it's like playoff time. Right, you and know what I mean. So they instantly know. Yeah, and on on, t- on top on top of that, this is why I say like even though Miami is the matrix, it's so different because yeah, most people here are not really from here. No, nope. okay. they're from like like Latin American countries, and mm-hmm. then they, there's people from France and all yeah, over Europe. There. Yeah, but um, the most important thing is that when they come to Miami because of the weather, they they just want to have fun and and party and. Right, it, it's it's different, man. It so, different. They, yeah, so you say they're coming there to have fun, to let, let their hair down because they're mm-hmm. away from their people. Yeah, I Bingo. get it. Yep. Bingo. Man. Yeah. So, I mean, <laughs> they, and all you the, the kids you talk about that was out there, they was everybody was out. It was cold because it was it was raining, but everybody because it's spring break. Oh, oh wow! It's spring. It was the start of spring break, rather. Right. Um, oh yeah, that's true. Yeah, you know I got I got to edit all these clips and stuff, but I'm gonna show y'all on my camera. Y'all keep talking, and I just show y'all as y'all oh, yeah, talk. Yeah. yeah, I was. Uh, uh, yeah, I had a question about. Uh, I had a question for for Omar in the chat. Is your last name Suarez? I think I, I feel like your last name is Suarez. But uh, oh, okay, he's from Miami too. Cool. I'm gonna mute the volume on this thing though, because no, nah, you're good. You're good. So uh Omar uh Suer- Suarez says, I grew up in Miami, like check. Miami is unreal. Yeah. Damn. Yep. <clears throat> so this this is when uh oh jeez. This is when they had Osiris, uh the singer. I don't know if you guys can see the singer. You might not work out with this. Okay, oh, now Osiris kind of, singer. Yeah, yeah. Okay. He, he, he's in his Lamborghini. And what you're going to see is a bunch of people run up to the Lamborghini. Yeah. Oh, and they're going to see security come and stop him. Yeah, yeah. You see that? You see security pushing. Whoa, he looked like he grabbed his gun. Yeah. Osiris, huh? That's a yeah. clean ass car. Whoa, yeah. whoa, di- whoa, 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 whoa. Did you see that? Did you see the Kool Aid man oh. at the end? Yeah, that big old, yeah. <laughs> yeah. Yuck. Yeah, she she messed up the shot. Everything was cool till she got in there. I uh, know. Okay. Who's she running? Who, who she running from? I got, I'm, I'm gonna show you one good. Chasing after the hamburger. Found <laughs> All right, so oh. this is gonna be my video when I when I do the uh, B roll video. Uh, okay. He's good. He's like so freaking cute. Um, uh, uh, yeah, it's almost washed out. Oh, yeah, I can see that. What the oh, oh man, she twerk. Oh man, yeah, we can't see the twerk though. Yeah, because yeah. it's kind of like too bright, but we kind of yeah. saw it. Yeah, man, you got some footage, huh? What that was today? That was all today, man. And it was cool. If it was warmer, it would have been a lot more stuff, man. Wow, man. Wow. So maybe since since I ain't got the vax and I can't travel. Maybe I need to uh, oversee. Maybe I need to, need to uh, take a flight out to Miami. Oh, I, I, I'll tell you people here now, too, because um, I, I'm going to announce it on my channel after I... Um, oh, my God. She's really cute. I'm going to announce it on my channel after I... Uh, oh, my God. This is going to be nice. Um, Let us see, man. Let us see. After I... Because uh, next week, uh, me and DJ Chisel are going to do a review to okay. Fly to Carmen and a okay. review to Tulum. I think okay. Wednesday and Friday, we'll probably do uh, Tulum Wednesday <laughs> and apply to Carmen Friday. And then I'm going to announce to my channel either Monday or Wednesday, sometime the following week, that um we, we're going to Costa Rica. Costa Rica, huh? We're going to Costa man, Rica. Man, I, you know, these dudes would happen to go on, on the weekend where it's my son's birthday. 
Yeah. We're going to, we're going to Costa Rica in May, uh, in May. For, for about a week. We're going to San Jose and we're going mm -hmm. to Jaco, uh, Haku. So it's going to be, it's going to be, I, I, normally I only go on uh, two vacations. Uh, you know, I slow down two vacations so I can save money, but because I'm, I'm not going to be able to get the place in Mexico until at least four years from now, um, when the, you know, when the government you know, switch over for a little bit and I could claim from higher. Anyway, um, I'm going to spend <laughs> time and, I, and I'm going to go to uh, more places. So I probably, I might, I might, I'm definitely going to Costa Rica. That's already booked. But I'm, okay, I'm trying to sneak in Cuba for like three days, also. Ooh. Wait, so when is that? Like around the same time you coming back? You gonna connect uh, that? Nah, uh, cause the whole thing is, is I, at work I got a whole week off. That's gonna be going to Costa Rica. Cuba, Cuba might be like a quick visit in like, let's say, something like July, like July, mm -hmm. or August. I mean July or August. Because I'm messing with you. I'm messing with you. With yeah, Cuba, I, I, I'll, I'll make that one. With yeah, Cuba, I all, with, you. with Cuba, all I gotta do is take two days off. I gotta take Friday off and Thursday and Thursday off, or Friday and Monday off, and I can go to Cuba and come right back. I'm not, I'm not planning on spending no no big money in Cuba. I, I can take a thousand dollars and be overly because I'm I'm buying the painting out there, so. Yeah, you and them paid, man. Shout out to you. I seen that in real life with myself when you was out there. And uh, oh, yeah, yeah, yeah. play the Carmen. You went. Hey, so did you ever get it? Did you ever get the uh, the uh Scarface yeah, painting? It's, it's, it's right. Um, I can't even. It's right. Oh, right so you got it. Okay. Uh, yeah. That was a nice painting too. Yeah, my first international uh painting. It's it's so I like it. Okay. So <laughs> man, uh, we have Mr. Game himself. <laughs> what you laughing for, Keys of Dreams? You got Mr. Game. <laughs> nah, I was uh I was debating uh Alex playing with fire and John Anthony today regarding game. You know, um obviously I, I don't know if you follow these guys, but John Anthony, like he lives in Brazil okay. and got and got him a Brazilian girl, and I'm pretty much telling him, like, okay, like you believe in game and everything, but why aren't you telling guys to go game girls in Brazil versus to staying here in the United States? And, you know, obviously they're a little silent on that, you know, because their market is guys to be here, give them the knowledge here, make them stay here versus exploring their options, you know? Right. right. Mm -hmm. well, you, 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 sure got, you sure got smoke for dating coaches, man. You got smoke for PUA <laughs> for dating coaches. Damn. Yeah, it's an ongoing battle. What I do understand that part. That 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 one I definitely understand because here's yeah. the thing: if I'm if my business is, um, and like I said, it's not for every dating coach. It's not, for, but if my business is teaching people how to, you know, feel comfortable with talking with women, and succeed in talking with women, and I know they don't need my help if they go overseas. It's like, but at the same token, it, I, I don't want to say don't need because, like I said before, I feel as though some guys do need that coach to give them the confidence so they don't go overseas and become a, a issue right. for all of us. Right, right. <laughs> Well, I, males. man, man, you, man, shout out to Flyboy for being so diplomatic. He just said <laughs> an issue for all of us, man. I, I, I like, I like that. <laughs> See, to to interpret that in Bos in Bostonese, go over there and fuck up the prices. <laughs> I'm gonna interpret Flyboy's diplomatic words in Bostonese. Go over there and fuck up the prices by being Whoa. beta male simps. Well, well that 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 affects all of us if guys are going to go out there and do that affect the prices it affects yeah. all of us and and, it, and 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 what you say you can literally spoil you can't spoil chicks who wasn't might they might not have been on that type of time but if uh -huh. so many american and gringos come do the same thing the chick you almost can't blame her eventually her mind is going to shift <laughs> why yeah. not i have yep. 15 other guys come do it why not? You're number 16. So right. guess what? This is the new program now. 
Right. Uh, you know, you know what's crazy? Uh so 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 this guy, he's a, a content creator. I think all of you know him. I don't want to say his name without his permission, but um he was telling me on WhatsApp, and I think um Big Boss, you might have mentioned that he might have sent this to you. But so um so this woman in this woman in uh in Latin America hit him up, asked him for a certain amount of money. So he said, Hey, you know what? Uh, I could set you up with a with a job interview. You could get a job. She <laughs> says, No, I don't. She says, I don't want a job interview. I just want the money. What? What? Hey, I might I might be starting a merge soon too. Like show the receipts. Okay. Like, guys, I like uh, that. I like that. That's I, right. I support That's that. I buy. I yeah, buy at least one T-shirt yeah, just for right. that. I buy at least right. one T-shirt just for that. How how does merge kind of work? Like you can uh, you can you can you can do you can do it um you can do it off like uh like 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 Teespring, okay. uh, for, or or if you have uh or if you do have like a a con a connect you know for somebody like who makes merch you could do it that way too but you know a lot of people just use like teespring okay that's okay. what i use that's how i made this uh i don't know if nobody i really to be honest i made this for me because it's just my it's just my logo mm -hmm. i don't know if nobody else want that but i'm i'm thinking of other uh <laughs> other uh designs you know uh -huh. for other people I don't really, I don't know if people really want my logo on a shirt or a, or a hoodie. I it, I made it just for me, so it's up there, but I didn't really make it public. But yeah, Teesprings, I made okay, it. Teesprings, Tea all you got to do is free. It's all, it, it don't cost any money. You just make an account. You see, you know, you got to give your email, your address, and just right. make an account. And once you make an account, you can put, you can upload your own design. Nice. And once you upload your design, you can put it on anything and and start it to sell it. Mm -hmm. Oh, okay. Nice, mm -hmm. nice. So, so yeah, that's that's some good ideals. You know, doing doing a few consultations here and there in Mexico. You know, giving guys the real game. Um, one dude thought about going to Mexicali compared to Tijuana, and I'm like, no, nah, you don't want to do that, man. <laughs> don't want to do that, <laughs> especially when it's your first time. Um, but yeah, yeah. you know. Making sure that cats, you know, have a great experience, you know, no matter what the budget is, and uh, you know, make moves from there, man. Yeah, you said, um, you said QB that uh, Guadalajara is like your favorite spot, right? Yes. Okay. Definitely. All definitely. Right. Shout out to Kenny Ken KPR one. Kenny Ken will be going there next week. Uh, Kenny Ken will be going to Guadalajara next week. Nice. Nice. Yeah. Nice. Yeah. And, and you said, uh, was it you or was it um, Milano? Because uh, because I think I think Milano might have said this, but one of y'all said like they go they go crazy over the brothers, right? Yeah, they they do. Um, I mean, it, it's a death, definitely a different scene. Like it's you're gonna be like, wow, this is Mexico. Like it's very very Eurocentric. So. <laughs> It's kind of like I, I kind of feel like I'm in Hollywood a little bit in Guadalajara, but when they see a brother in that scene, it's like, oh my gosh, because you know we're very, very you know limited out there mm -hmm. in Guadalajara, and I would say most of Mexico in general. Mm -hmm. um, but you know, I've gotten love there. A few other brothers got love out there. Uh, I mean, Tinder, Tinder Bumble is popping out there, including Mexico City. I mean, and the the Bumble is just amazing out there. Um, so it, it's just unlimited options depending depending on the way you move. Uh, what you got to say, Flyboy? What you got to say, man? Can you hear me, Flyboy? <laughs> What you gotta say? Oh shoot! <laughs> He's tired. He's tired. Yeah. No. Um. Tired and deaf. <laughs> no. I, I. I finally. Um. I had it on mute. I had the thing on mute because I didn't want you guys to hear the um. Oh. Stuff when I'm on the, the editing software. Oh, you edit, just, you're editing right now? No, I just downloaded the uh, video because when I got back in, I downloaded all the video from my my disc. Okay. And, oh. 
Uh, uh, oh, not to cut you off, but speaking yeah. new video, new video coming next week on yeah. Porto Penasco. That's gonna be a good one. All right. Well, that, that's Mexico, obviously, right? Right. It's about four hours south of Phoenix. Um, mm. Yeah, it's kind of like a it's a beach town, but it's great to party. Monster Minnow's kind of on the monger scene, but they they got them out there though. Uh, is a uh, is a uh, is Guadalajara? Uh, is that is that like? Do they have beaches there, or is it more no. kind of like metropolitan? Metropolitan. The nearest beach in Guadalajara would be Puerto Vallarta, which is about two hours away. Oh, yeah. Okay. Yeah. All right. So yeah. So so it's like so it's like uh, like Medellin. Like you yeah, know, it's yeah. exactly it's, it, it's exactly like Med Medellin. That means, that means the prices are good because when it's away from the beach and if it's an inner city, it's good prices for both. Right. If it's, by, <laughs> if it's by a beach and real touristy with the beach and the palm trees and the good weather, real touristy is bad prices for both. <laughs> Usually speaking. Right. Right, but uh, King of Dreams, yeah, man. I encourage you to at least try Guadalajara maybe one time, man. Yeah, I'm gonna, um, yeah, yeah, I'm, I'm gonna, I'm gonna try. Uh, I was, I, I was looking forward to, to Costa Rica, but the time where when Flyboy, um, and Chisel are going to Costa Rica, that's literally smack in the middle of like my son's birthday weekend, so there's no, no wiggle room. I know. I know. No wiggle room, huh? Yeah, so probably in the beginning of May is probably where I'll I'll do a uh, um Guadalajara. And then um in July and August, uh Fly and I'll probably make that quick run to uh Cuba. And boss. Oh, are oh, you pulling up too? Okay. I'm gonna debo I'm gonna debo my way on that trip. Try try and go <laughs> off. Try and go offense, man. Okay. Yeah, man. So it's Cuba. our trip. <laughs> there we go. Ha, have you been to Cuba before? No. That's not no, I, I always either. wanted to go. I always wanted to go. Flyboy, you've been there, right? Right. Okay. Pro pros and cons of Cuba. I hear that the internet's like really, really bad out there, but other than that, the women are great. Obviously, Cuban food is awesome. Oh. Yep. The beaches are nice. Uh, uh oh, I hear a butt. I hear a butt. Um, my perspective Cuban food isn't really awesome. They have places that have awesome Cuban food that I've been, but mm -hmm. I'd say a good 85% of Cuban food is exactly the same no matter where you go mm -hmm. because the government provides the food, right? So, and they don't, they don't have spices and stuff. Like oh, like, so it's a lot different from Miami. Yeah, Miami oh. is, is way different from Miami because oh, the thing is oh, that oh. they don't have the spices to spice up like just the like like what's it called the ube or ube and sasson and all that stuff. Right, seasoning. Right. Yeah, you don't have any <laughs> seasoning and spices. Yeah. And really, they, they don't have a lot of sugar over there except for natural sugar. So right. the taste is going to be your taste is going to be off for like maybe the first. Couple meals, your taste is going to be off, but mm. you'll get it. But there are some places that have almost everything in it, but it's going to be a higher price. Higher but price. When I say higher yeah. price, I mean like seven dollars, because seven dollars oh, is shit. a lot. Because mm -hmm. you know the average Cuban makes about like thirty to forty dollars a month. Doctors make about forty dollars a month. No way. Right. No. Right. It's communism no. out there. The no. whole country. Yeah. No. Yeah. Yeah. Forty yeah. yeah. dollars a month. That's yeah. no money. Uh, I, I heard okay, I heard in DR like a job would be two hundred dollars a month. Because you saying like forty dollars a month? Yeah. No, yeah, like yeah, like the average person in Cuba average. makes forty dollars a month. Yeah, I'm saying the government pays for everything. The government gives you food, the government oh, pays man. for your housing, the government pays for your health care. So, oh, so um, you almost really don't need money per yeah. se. Per se. Oh. Oh, but when you want to do stuff with it, like you might want to have somebody watch your kids or something like that, you get you, your, your job only pays you about forty dollars a month. Doctors and physicians get paid about sixty something dollars a month, and this is a monthly thing. So when you go over there, if you do dibble or dabble in the pro scene, it's easier to negotiate because at the end of the day, I know that you don't make this much, and if I at, at the same token, I know that there's not going to be a lot of tourists there. 
anymore because of the situation that's, that's been going on during the pandemic and what happened over there with the government during the pandemic. So you got to understand that, like, this this $40, this, 20, this, this $30, I'm going to say 30 at least, but this $30 is going to go further than anywhere else in the, in, in the country, in the world I can think of. So now, now so, you're talking big boss language. So, so fly, so fly, uh, so fly. I, I was uh, so fly. So fly. Um, Quan, Quan, uh, Quan, Quan said, uh, I, I "Looking boy, now, Quan. forget August. We're going next week. No Saturday Night Live next week. Boss will be in Cuba." Yeah, I was shitty that. internet, boss. Like, no uh, yeah, lie. It's, 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 it's not. It's not. Right. So here's the thing about the Cuban internet. It's, it's not shitty per se, but I will say this: because you have to get an internet card to get internet, it doesn't exist if you don't have the card. Secondly, oh, wow. if you have the card, if your Airbnb host doesn't have a router, your internet is going to be crappy. Like my Airbnb host had a router, as you guys can see from the from the video, the black man's got the uh, Cuba, Havana, Cuba. The um Airbnb I stayed at was like better than my crib in Miami inside. Damn. The outside didn't look like that, so they had they had the right precautions. However, once again, you know, oh, that's still playing. Damn. Hmm? You know, but, you know, what I'm about to do. But oh. <laughs> <laughs> hey, but now you gotta uh, you gotta have a starter from like, no, well, maybe not, from like two. Did that other video that you that I was on, you get to monetize that? Huh? Did you get to monetize the other video I, I was on? Did I get the mon? What did I get to monetize? What? Yeah. No, I ain't, I didn't get to monetize. What are you talking about? No. Oh, you said no, you didn't get to monetize it. No, I I said did you get to monetize the oh, other video oh, I was oh, on? Oh. Oh, uh, yeah, the club one. Yes, because I, I, I have to go back in and um, I have to mute a lot of the uh, the songs from the club. Oh, not the club, not the club one, man. Uh, remember, I remember we did we did a video with you and you and I. Oh, yeah, I'm yeah, I'm sure. Yeah, I'm you, sure. Okay, so then, so then, then it's gonna it's gonna work for you if you play the Black Man's God. Oh, okay. So, um, all right. So, where, where where's this video at, man? It, the black man's got to uh, Havana, Cuba. Man, big big boss like them prices, man. He's like, shit. So, yeah, so, so I, I was saying, I was saying, uh, Flyboy. Uh -oh. um, I, uh -oh. I was saying, who I was saying, who, who is this, man? Who is this? Is this? So, which one is this one? Is this black man guy? First I like one, this first one, one, the first one, the first one. First one. I like this one though. Oh, you can that one too. But I like that one. The first one probably a little more details. Nah, I forget. I, I like what I like, man. Oh, that looks like Vegas. <laughs> that don't look like Cuba. <laughs> don't ask oh. why. Oh shit! Okay. Don't Nine ask Vegas. why. See, this is Cuba, huh? Right, that's Cuba. You got good, good, clear camera on this. Okay. Uh, mm -hmm. My my phone like, that's when I bought my first my phone when I bought the four K uh Note Nine. Okay. So, in, in Cuba, like I said, it's 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 pretty chill, like, and the people are very nice. The people are very nice, and it's like for you to run out of money in Cuba, something wrong, something wrong with your life. You or you could be doing a lot and you didn't bring enough. That's the worst thing. I'd rather over Dang, look at that person's feet now. Yeah, I, I wanted to over bring enough money because you like you see the the place I stayed, it was like it wasn't like a, a normal what people would think Cuban would be. It's high quality stuff. Uh-huh. Now what about like the money exchange and everything? Like were you <laughs> good? Were you good out there in the ATMs or no, there's no ATMs. There's no AT ATM. That's what I'm saying. This is hard. Whatever money you bring to Cuba is all you have. There's no <laughs> way to get any money. <laughs> Into Cuba. <laughs> oh, so not even in my QB voice. <laughs> what? There's no way to get money into Cuba as a United States citizen at all, unless you have family who are Cubans, and even then, it's limited to how much you can send. Fuck. Eating, boy. So what? What about Western Union? Like they don't even oh, got that. Man. 
No, they, they, you can't, as a United States citizen, you can't do that. Hey, what's going on? Hey. You know what I mean? Like, the only, all, like that, and that was the biggest issue why I couldn't overdo what I wanted to do because I had only run like $800 or $900. So once I ran out of money, I, I basically had to rely on my boys. My boys always got money, so it was cool. But it's, um, that's all you have, man. You don't have any more money. Damn. Damn. If you spend, okay. if you spend all your money, boss, and you have no, that's why you have to really separate your money into days. Because if you don't separate it into days in Cuba, what happens is that you overly spend your money, and you have no way to get food. You have no way to get, uh, anything because you can't go to the ATM. There's no cards allowed. There's no Western Union. Nobody can wire you any money, transfer any money. You can't pay for anything online what? except for the Airbnb. So it's like, what? yeah. No, so it might be it might be good to do to take that in like you say in small chunks like <clears> two <throat> day trips, you know, where it's safe, you know. Take yeah, that, yeah, take that I, chunk. I stay, I stay five five. Well, you gotta understand, I went with four other people, I but um, you. or three other people. But I stayed three five people. days. So okay. it, it, the the good the good thing about with going with three other people is that if I rent when I ran out of money, my brother was there. Okay. My brother, was there. my brother was Mel was there. If, if when Mel when Mel ran out of money, my other brother, my other homie, um, uh, Louis P, Louis, Louis J was there. And then if Louis J ran out of money, then, then the other homie Doy was there. So it was like we were all bringing enough money. But if, if one of us ran out of money, the other one got us because if we all ran out of money, yeah, that'd have been, that been fucked in the game. Hey, so <laughs> so I mean. I'm gonna ask you: Did did that happen? Did any of you guys? You don't have to say who. No, I ran out of money. Of you ran out of money that trip. Yeah, I, I ran out of money. One of my other homies ran out of money because okay. the fact that, and it okay. wasn't the fact that we don't have we didn't have money. We had yeah, I, I get it. Right. Oh we yeah, I seen it. This is good. Uh, shout out to you for doing this. Yeah, that this was dope. Right. Here. Okay. Yeah. 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 That's, Contributing that's, to that's the community. Stuff. That's what's up. <clears> yeah. Good what citizen brother, right there. <laughs> <laughs> It's a Cuba is definitely must be must go before they lock it down again. Before they lock it down again, yeah, huh? yeah. it's coming. Yeah, I like I like them prices, like QB say, man. What? Yeah, so hey, she lit. Hey, she little too. Hey, uh, hey. a skinny mini. Yeah, she skinny. Yeah, normally, hey, hey, the flyboy way dollar sign. <laughs> F T A L whatever. Don't ask why. <laughs> I can't do it. I'm not him. So somebody said in the chat, you can't even use your Visa or Mastercard out there, right? You cannot. No. Oof. This is longer. I'm gonna let this play. Yeah, we are gonna talk while it's playing though. But uh, what? Wait. Damn. We what? live. <laughs> what I mean? Uh, yeah, but um. Okay, I'm I'm at, I, I'm messing with you. You say, hey, you say you say August, huh? I, that's not get the Cuba trip is not guaranteed because I gotta really see how my my big go. But yeah, it's yeah. definitely coming up. If it's okay. not this year, it's definitely know. next year. Just let me know. It's de- anytime it's not this, just, anytime it's in the summer. Let I've already talked to my time. I've talked to my guy. He got the place now. With Cuba, you're gonna have to actually. You're really not, but it's gonna cost you mad money to not take the COVID test in Cuba. Because mm. to get back from Cuba, the only way you can get back from Cuba and not take the COVID test is take a flight from Cuba to Mexico, right? And then walk across the border. And oh, what I what I did uh, when we came back from Player of the Carmen. But the issue with that is that the Cuba to Mexico flight is like a thousand dollars. Yeah. Oh, so shit. you know what? Fuck so, that. Yeah. So, no. So when I was looking at uh, the DR, right, I did, I did the exact same thing. I typed it in from mm-hmm. whatever airport, even Santo Domingo, let alone SCI or POP to Mexico. The cheapest I saw was two grand. Yep. Mm-hmm. I'm like, what? Yep. From DR to Mexico? Yep. Mm-hmm. So, yeah. It, 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 so that's the issue. Like, but it, from Miami, it's from Miami, it's only like four hundred dollars, and plus you got to pay seventy five dollars for a visa because the, the support the Cuban people. That's so basically like four seventy five, five hundred from Miami, you can get to um Cuba. So like I said, I'm only going to go over there for three three to four days. Like I'll leave on a Thursday Thursday, no mm-hmm. Friday morning. 
I'll see you there Friday night, Saturday night, Sunday night, and come back Monday at the latest. So, mm -hmm. wow. <clears throat> yeah. But everything out there is cheap. The food, the women, everything, right? Services. Like, they, no one, they don't like saying cheap. So it's economical, yes. Oh, everything yeah. everything out there is economic, like super economic. economic. Yeah, like, so, yeah. Yeah, if if uh fly, I don't know if you saw what, what I posted, but uh that's that's what Quan had told me what it was. You can, but then again, you, you're gonna have to give up some quality. You have to, you have to give up quality. quality. It's not like Columbia. Like in Columbia, you can get some quality for ten dollars because the quality might only be like twenty one or twenty. Like 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 the girl I showed you guys in my video, she was twenty years old. So yeah. that quality, you you can get that for low because they just don't. I guess know the game. However, yeah, but, so what about like a premium, like like you know premium, like 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 the uh, like the Venezuelan. You want a premium? A woman, they charge, charge, charge you, but it's hard to see over. It's hard to see them saying anything over sixty dollars, because a hundred, because anything over sixty dollars, or you know, I wouldn't even say a hundred, but anything over sixty dollars to them, and even to them, is going to sound unrealistic because doctors get paid sixty dollars a month. Right. And, and Damn. Ask, even if you're a United States citizen or a foreigner, for me to ask you for what doctors get paid a month to spend an hour or a night with me, I can I can't imagine them fathoming that in their head to, to make sense of that. Okay. Yeah. And, and what like about 40, like your... 40 is gonna be my ceiling, man. I got the 40 for I got the 40 watt. <laughs> 40, 40, 40, 40, 40. Yeah, I had I had I had the, the three some the three I, I had this. was 80. 2020 20, 20, twin. Man. No, 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 twin, twin, twin. Nah. Nah. With the girls of Cuba. <laughs> Women in Cuba. So, so what about like your twin. cell phone service? Was that working? Yes and no. <laughs> yes and I no. say yes because my cell phone service worked if I wanted to make if I had to make an emergency call or something like that. However, if I wanted to use data, it did not work. Okay. So when you so, call, it will work, but data, no. Right, no. Like Instagram, YouTube, all that, no, none of that. Twitter, none of that. Okay. Are you roaming? No, there's no roaming. There's, there's, no, there's, there's no satellite for it to connect to. So it's like, well, well, in, in Cuba, it's like it was no, like, whatever, I don't know if it was a satellite, it was nothing that it could connect to in Cuba for data. Gotcha. Nothing to connect to. Damn. So, 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 the, uh, so there's no so there's no social media over there's there. There's no tower. There ain't no there's cell there's tower social media over there. It's not. They're not like in the dust. But what it is is that Facebook is big over there. Facebook is the big thing in Cuba. Um, Instagram isn't as big. YouTube is big. YouTube is big in Cuba. So those are the forms of social media they have over there. Do you know, like Facebook is really big, like yeah, yeah, but you can't hit them up on Bumble or anything like that. Nah, but they do have. Oh, it's just it's something else too. Um, what is it called? It's uh, my head day. Off the back, I can't think of what it's called. You can watch your commercial. <laughs> you get paid, like, man. Uh, you can watch your Bumble. commercial. You can get paid. I ain't gonna skip it while you talk. I just can't. I just can't remember exactly what it was, but there is some kind of dating thing over there that you can get over here. And I, I just don't trust it. I mean, because the women that are on those sites are going to be women who are normally accustomed to dealing with Americans, which they're still not going to try to charge you an astronomical price because, once again, doctors make $59 a year in a woman. I, oh. I mean, about a year, a month. A month in their month, head, yeah. they're looking like, I don't know how I'm going to ask for what a doctor is asking. Mm -hmm. Okay, wow. well that's that's so, good so to know this, about. So this is what the average person makes in a month. Yeah. So you 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 can uh, Google it and find out. <laughs> Big boss, yes. <laughs> I, I got I got that. Hold on, watch this. I got that. Shout out this to my got that. I got the whole I got the whole kit, but this is like uh one of the bottles, Manscaped. I got that. I got the razor too. My son got it for me for Father's Day or something like that. The whole little kit. So, so I got the. Uh, now I got the. I got the. I got the manscape. I think what is it like for four point oh? Now it, it. You know, it does. It does work, man. It does yeah. work. Shout out to manscape. 
Yes. So boss, if I get big. I'm gonna tell him. I'm gonna tell him to sponsor my channel. Hell yeah. So Shit, boss, yeah. You, you're you're trying to get to Cuba without without taking a COVID test. Hell yeah, Ooh. man. I ain't tr I'm just trying to just just move like a ghost, man. Just right. go where I need to go without no test, man. Okay. <laughs> he said okay. <laughs> no, I, I mean, hey, I, I, I totally understand, but shit, if it's two thousand dollars to fly out of Mexico City or something. Oh well, no, well, no. Uh, so on that one, I'm I'm gonna rethink I'm gonna rethink my strategy on that one. Uh, right. You ain't now, no now Flyboy, wouldn't it be a little bit cheaper to get there from Cancun versus like Mexico City? Uh no. See, the good, the good thing is that uh, big, big Boss, you can bring it up. You can Google you, you can Google and see exactly what it is. Um, It is from Mexico City. I think it was like uh, eight, eight, nine hundred. From Cancun, it was like eleven hundred. And yeah, you know, uh, New Jersey, it's like five hundred. But um, in, uh, in Miami, it's like three to four hundred. Mm. All right. I'm trying to get off YouTube, just go straight to Google. You know what I'm saying? Just type in Google. Yeah, but yeah, but I'm on YouTube though. So yeah, I'm just gonna. Oh, and tap, I was in, in, in tap yeah. Google. yeah. So boom, there we go. Yeah. All right. Um, Flights from Miami to Cuba. I'm doing chief flight first. Chief flights. And then this is how I do mine. All right. Boop. And so we're gonna say you should do Google though, but I Google. guess I tried should, to tell yeah. Google, Google is to me is the lowest. Like I was having yeah. with somebody yeah, yeah. Was and I'm like, no, Google is always the lowest. Well, chief flights is low. no, no, no. So Google. maybe try San Francisco to, to Cuba boss. It's it's a uh, it's Havana, right? To mm -hmm. Havana, yeah. Hey, All right, so I downloaded this too. Scroll down. No, no, no. Scroll down. There you go. Oh, oh, right, right, right here. There. Yeah. So. Okay. So like. Ooh, so five eighty. You see that? But that's twelve hours. From where? We have a long layover, though. That's the problem. Yeah. Right. Whoa. Yeah. Scroll down, big box. Show flights right there. Show yeah, flights there you go. Yeah. Now scroll down. Jet Blue. One stop. But it's weird to have. I guess it's San Fran. That's why they stop. Yeah. Mm hmm. You can also check with Southwest. Southwest flights. No, I, like, I just typed. I just typed in the flights. Yeah, and they Google, searched Google, and told me to. Google uh, shows everything that's available. Yeah, yeah, exactly. Right. So JetBlue five eighty, man, they winning six hundred bucks. The issue is that with JetBlue is, is a five hour flight. Well, I don't know. You is is a five hour stop in Fort Lauderdale. Boss, go to the right and click underneath the price there. To, yeah, there you go. So you got a five-hour layover in Fort Lauderdale. Overnight. So you oh. get there at 10 p.m. I mean, you get there at 6.54 a.m. And you don't leave until 12.26. So, yes. I could do some. Maybe I can uh, go see some sites for five hours in Fort Lauderdale. Maybe. And then I get, oh, and I get to uh, there at, like, almost, like, 2 in the afternoon, 1.45 p.m., 600 bucks round trip. Often delay 30 minutes. Can't beat that. That's a good deal. 600, 600 bucks round trip. Yeah, that's a good deal. With a five-hour layover in uh Miami. I mean Fort Lauderdale. Yeah, you can't beat that with a stick. And that's because and that's like what eight like one month off. Well, you know, like one month off. If you push it off, it gets normally cheaper, right? Yeah. Well, I, I, I just put for uh, I just put for July and um it had it at 700 the Whoa, one layover. Really? Yeah, seven hundred with one layover. They should just have to shop around. Yeah. So to say 
Fourth of July. Oh yeah, I see. Right. Yeah, it jumped. You can look at. That's the weekend. That's the Fourth of July weekend. And it's dropped back down. Damn, why does it get hot? Oh, cause maybe because it's just straight summertime. Yeah. More people traveling during the summer. Okay, but yeah. Then right here, it gets cheap again for the 17th, 18th, 600 right there. Dang, 730 on the 15th, and then $130 cheaper one day later. Damn. And then cheaper here and cheaper here. And 600 here, that'll probably go. Mm, okay. Not bad, round trip. Just got to take that COVID test coming back. Dang, 390, what the hell? 390, what's this about? Certain days. Certain days, huh? Yeah, and it's a 390. It's green. There, there. Wow. Catch these days. Round trip. I Jeez. paid um 240 something one way to uh Cartagena. Damn. Where do you see that? Where you see that? I ain't even looking at that, man. Wow. Okay. Okay. The A's have it. And the A's have it. Wow. I had to come all that time. <laughs> that comment. I don't know. The hmm. prices will get cheaper, but it's hurricane season <laughs> late summer. Shout out to Clifton to going places. Damn. It's always something, huh? It's in it's inexpensive through Panama. Hmm. Okay. <laughs> Uh, Clifton, I just put two week Cuba salary in my car. Yep, <laughs> right, man. Seven dollar gas here in California, straight up. It's straight seven dollars, bro. Ridiculous. Still tripping. I know it's wow. five dollars. I know it's five dollars in other places, but it was yep. already like five dollars for us already. So ours went to, to seven. Damn. I won't give the name in this chat though. Nines to tens. What? What are you talking about? What? what you, what's? Oh, nightclubs. Nah, he said. Oh, um, some yeah. ass. Yeah. Whoa, for real? In Cuba? You talking about in Cuba? Uh, uh T Love Entertainment? Because I wasn't following the chat. Because I know T Love. T Love. He he been to Cuba. He, he the first one to really put Cuba on my um radar because he still have footage and videos from uh from Cuba from his trip. And he told me about Cuba about two years ago. Man, they tripping, tripping. Straight tripping. Straight. Mm -hmm. Say that. Say it again, OG. Passport Straight pay. Tripping. Straight they were tripping. Right? They were charging a hundred dollars at the rich clubs. Now you're doing too much. Knowing the doctors make sixty bucks a month, you better mm -hmm. not ask me for that for no one night. And they not even a doctor. Right. And even it, well, they might be a doctor. They're here, doctor. You're funny, boss. You got to do some surgery. Get me right. <laughs> wow. All right. And all night, there ain't no one out. There ain't no one hour crap either. We're talking all night. I, yeah, well, in Cuba, it's different. It's a little different in Cuba. Um, Break it down. Break it down. Okay, so I might not word this correctly. I might. It might be more stuff than I know, but just from my experience. Okay. Cuba doesn't really want its citizens intermingling with United States citizens, at mm -hmm. least United States citizens. The reason mm -hmm. why I say that is because a lot of the times – the women, unless the, it's really rare, like I got one that did it and it was really rare. Even okay. the host at my Airbnb is like, This is really rare that oh, a woman wow. does this. A woman is very rare that she's going to stay with you more than an hour. Hmm. It's even more rare that she's going to stay overnight in hmm. Cuba because the thing is this during the daytime, you they if I so you let's say you, you're seen with a woman during the daytime, everything might be hunky dory, everybody, everything goes smoothly. When you leave United States, leave to the United States, they're going to automatically assume that this woman has a lot of money because she's been with you during the day. And then they're going to harass this woman. And then there's going to be an issue about all that stuff for her. Not as much for you, but as much as, as much for her. So because of that, a lot of women, if they do involve in pro stuff, it's going to be boop, 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 and they're going to be trying to get up out of it. 
Mm. I, I remember someone was telling me, it might have been um, T Love, shout out to Love Entertainment. Someone was telling me that if you're going to be with a woman pro, and even not a pro, because a lot of times they're going to assume pro activities anyway when it's male and female dynamic. The woman has to like walk behind you or in front of you. You're not to be seen really walking side by side together. Even if you guys are together, you're going to have to separate yourself and she walks behind you. And if you get in a taxi cab, she used to get pay for her to get in another cab. You guys are not to be seen in the same cab. Right. So we, why is that though? Why? Uh, here's the thing. Break, that, break that down. I'll make it I'll make it more clear. Like, okay. It has to be a separate okay, so you guys are not to be really seen together. Yeah, basically what basically what Big Boss just said. Now the cops will cause a big scene if you get seen. We had a situation where it, there were so many of us that we couldn't all fit in one taxi cab. So what happened was that some of my people got in a taxi cab with some like hustlers that just had to happen to have a car and the police pulled them over but the <laughs> reason why the police let them go is because they had the united states citizens in the car and it was it was like three of them but they really got scolded and who knows what happened after we left but um because they were in the car and and it's at nighttime it's like you know because the whole thing is like this cuba in my opinion this is my opinion my opinion i don't know my opinion Cuba is, is a communism, right? Yeah. United States is a democracy, right? Cuban, okay. Cuban's government really runs a lot of the stuff that happens over there, right? United States citizens have a lot of free will over here. So when we go over to Cuba, they don't really want our mental uh, understanding of how the world works. Well, I guess I can say it like that. And our physical monetary power to corrupt the system that they have already. So they don't want they don't want they don't want the the, the teens and the young adults in Cuba ah. who have been trained and 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 schooled into the system the same way United States citizens have been trained and schooled into the, into the system they don't want them to automatically see somebody that looks just like them tell them a whole different way of the world because then it changes their. Not, their not for you. Not for you. <clears throat> yeah, you talking about like their uh, ideal. Shout out to uh, yeah, yeah. shout out to Global Paper. Um yeah, I yeah, uh ideology. Okay. Right. All right. Wow, so it gets deep. Talking about geopolitical stuff, yeah. huh? Yeah, G G Global Paper says something deep other than Brazil or die. I'm like, all right, man, come on, let's go. Jamie said Cuba <laughs> knows how the world works. They just don't F with capitalism. Yep. Well, capitalism is how also how the world works. I mean, they can be mm -hmm. they can be they can be in the Stone Age, dinosaur age if they want to. We see how much longer that'll last. But it, you know, it is what it is. Everybody do something. Okay, so um, right now I'm going to bring on uh, my moderator, T Love Love Entertainment. He's been to Cuba uh, a couple of times, and he's the one that first put me on to Cuba. So he's going to add a little more to this conversation. Oh. Shout out to T-Love, T-Lizzy. Hey, what's, what's up? up? What's up, panel? What's up? What's up, love one? Everybody can hear me okay? Yeah, yeah. we can hear you pretty much, yeah. All so good. what do you, yeah, what do you yeah. have to add to this uh, situation, this conversation, Mr. T-Love, about your time in well, Cuba? Well, the Flyboy way is correct on all on all comments. Uh, the only difference is that um, they will stay two to three hours, but they're definitely not doing it all night. Um, but he's right with everything else he said. You know, it's, it's pretty much just like that. You feel me? Um, but yeah, yeah. I mean, it's a beautiful place, man. And it's a beautiful situation. You got average between 20 to 60 bucks for your for your encounters, interactions. You feel me? Okay. Uh, but uh, but they got some high prices out there. But are they nines and tens where they have them at? Um, it's, it's they love they love black men. They love black Americans. Uh, the people do because they feel if you come there that you kind of want with the people. Since they know America doesn't want us there, and that we don't get down with them, so the fact that we're there, they show us a lot of love, and um, they really don't have a lot because a lot of stuff is rationed. So where we go and eat and the things we go and do, we're like top one percent. So he, right. Flyboy's right about how they want us intermingling, you know, with ideologies and things like that, with the people, you know. It is a big queuing system, a lot of lines, 
the people stand in to go get things they need. They have community gardens and things like that. A lot of people, there's a Malacan in mostly all of these, all these big countries that we like to frequent, Latin countries is Malacan. So it's a big Malacan, long Malacan, about five to eight miles long. People get a bottle of rum or whatever, cigars, music, and they go by the Malacan and hang out all night. And you can do that. And that's, that's Old Havana, going down to Miramar Beach and all that, which I know the flyboy way went down there, which is real cool. They got a new beach down there too, which is real mm. cool. Um, well, topless, I should say. Crazy. Topless. Topless, yeah, yeah. You know, you know what I'm talking about, Flyboy, right? I heard about it, but I didn't get a chance to see it. Yeah, yeah, yeah. It's crazy. And that's where the high end club is down there. Oh, it, the high end club. The one, the one that I know it's by the one, the 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 uh, one I went to. Miramar, but, yeah. But they kept trying to get us to go to the, the tourist beaches of uh, Veradero. Of, of course, like of course, of course. And yeah, but no, nah, you have to go like, to the local speech. Like the away. local speech. Yeah, the local speech is where it's correct. Yeah. But um, but then you got you got two different set you got two different main parts of Havana too. You got old Havana, then you got the Havana where like they have like the military uh, uh, museums where you can see the tanks and all that. And close by is where you can also see the old cars lined up, the old cannons, and kind of like the touristy area. But then there's another part of Havana too by the old the old hotels, and by the old hotels. That's where you want to stay on Airbnbs because uh, it's 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 easier for you to walk around and kick it and and link up with all the different you know people the way we like to do, you know. But um, but 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 the videos that that uh, Flyboy showed you are like in the touristy areas where they have the clubs where you can salsa and do all the things. So it's a lot of interaction with other tourists. Back in the day, you would see like the Russians, the Australians, a lot of different Europeans. That's the that's a vacation spot for them. Right. Whereas for Americans, it's not. So you would see a lot right. of that. But right now, right now, it's probably a good time to go because they need a tourist dollar since the Russians aren't going to be going. You feel me? Yeah. Rus so, Russians ain't going too much nowhere right now except for Ukraine. Nah. <laughs> and then another thing in Cuba, and, and Flyboy will, will probably uh, concur with this, is that, you know, a lot of the products are Chinese and Russian there anyway. Like yeah, you'll mm -hmm. see a lot of Russian vehicles, Renaults. You'll see a lot of Russian vehicles, Russian products. So right now they might be hurt. You feel me? So it might be a good time to go out there. Oh wow, wow. Okay. Yeah, yeah. So you got, how many how many it's times just, have how many times have you been to Cuba? T Love once? No, I've been no, I've been I only been twice. Well, you oh you've been twice. You've been to Cuba. How how yeah. long was both of your trips? Both both times. A week. A week. I did the same thing Flavor did. Yeah. Okay. And the key is he's right about the money too. Some people tell you to get Euro and go over there. Because the thing with the money, you if you do it wrong, you're going to get hit twice. You're going to get hit on a transfer to to, to exchange the money, and then you're going to get hit coming back, trying to change the money back. Because there's two types of currency there, and they're not going to let you use their currency. They not. They don't? So Wait, wait, wait. Huh? What? I they have a currency, it. too. Yeah, yeah, okay. But, okay, so when you go there, like, you know, we are travelers. So when we go there, we bring our USD we can't go exchange our USD for... No, you can, money? but it's CUC. I mean, uh, the Flyboy can break it down since he's a panel guest, but it's CUC and then it's other Colombia pesos. And basically, our pesos that we're able to use is one for one on, on, on the value and rate, where theirs might be like 26 to one or something like that. And, and, and that's the issue they're having right now with, with the uh, with the CUP. Like I said, he's like, uh, yeah. like uh, T-Love said, there are two different currencies. Is the CUP up it is the CUC cup. Exactly. Cup, exactly. That they use in Cuba, the, between the people who live in Cuba, they use CUC. CUP is a, is a is what Cuba wanted to uh, translate United States dollars and other currencies into. The issue with that is that because the United States is taxed in Cuba at a higher rate than any other country is taxed for for um foreign uh trans uh, for a monetary transaction change of change of money because of the United States tax it end up being 89 cents for every one Cuban uh CUP which is outrageous if you know how far the United States is ahead economically of of Cuba that you would have a thought that the number one currency the number one used currency in the world is actually below Cuba because it's 89 cents to one so that whole thing is getting changed around now, at the same token, here's the thing. 
if you're using CUPs, right, which you're going to be using, they're going to still charge you like it's like a like a a United States dollar, which is weird. Like if you go to souvenir shops, you'll pay the almost a United States price because you're paying. You got to think about it. Every dollar is eighty nine cents. So whereas you're not giving, if, if they something costs four dollars, you're not really giving four American dollars. What you're giving is like six American, seven American dollars. So it's like. It's it's weird, but um, you got and another thing is that don't if you here's the thing because of the exchange difference, right? If you what most people do is they take their money from the United States, right, and they go to the bank and they turn it into euros because in the United States your bank is not going to change charge you a transact a uh, currency exchange fee. The no, bank, your bank just, is not going to charge you. That. It's just straight across. It's just straight across, right? And then you take the euros. And you go to Cuba, and now you don't you don't get taxed at eighty nine cents per dollar. You get taxed at like 90, 95 cent percent. So you made an extra fourteen dollars almost, or extra ten dollars for every um for every uh dollar. You made an extra ten dollars. So that's that's the situation there, and it's still changing. So. He's exactly right, and then you get hit on the backside when you when you want to uh, convert your currency back. So that's why you either buy euro or you stay with the hundred dollar bills, because the hundred dollar bills because it has value. You can still gain, because you're gonna lose ten percent on your dollar as soon as you touch down, and then you're gonna lose five to seven on the way back. That sounds like Grand Cayman. If you Grand Cayman is their money is, is stronger than the U.S. It's twenty cents on a dollar. What? So if you got fifty thousand, you don't lost ten thousand. I'm, I'm not. I'm not used to traveling to countries where my USD is worth less than theirs. I'm used to going where <laughs> one US dollar is strong. It's like twenty of theirs. What the hell? It's I ain't going, I'm not going backwards. It's my, only two you my, my United, my United States dollar. Backed by the United States military and oil, is works less than a third world country. So now I'm a third boss is a third world citizen. Hell but you'll make it up. Now nah, you're gonna make it up though when you get to moving around though because everything's so inexpensive. Yeah, you still got the power. You still got the power. Shout out to the to the vital message. That's one of my subs. He has yeah, yeah, the vital too. message. He's a real one. Shout out yeah. to the vital message. Yeah, yeah, yeah. But no, nah, no, nah, fuck boy, right on everything. Right, <laughs> man. Now, nah, Cuba, the spot though. Everybody should experience it once. Please believe it. Right. Okay, I'll give it a chance. I give anything a a roll in a hay, so to speak. <laughs> oh, but damn. My money is gonna be lesser. So my one American dollar is like eight is like eighty nine cents. So I right. lose like eleven cents off top for yes. every dollar. And the way the way it breaks down, it's not like you just lose the money. You lose first for for the tax that Cuba charges American citizens, American United States. Then you lose again because the currency exchange. So yeah, it, it's gonna be it's gonna be uh. 80, 80, 80, 89 cents per 89 cents. So one dollar. Yeah, it's been steady. It's been steady. You're gonna lose 10 cents on the dollar going in on the change. That's that's pretty it's been that way. Yeah. It's been that way. Expect that. Expect that. Okay. First time I went I ordered money from the bank and I ordered Canadian dollars, even though it was a little lower than US, I just wanted to have the currency. But when I got there, I got hit again, so it kind of hurt me. So the next time I just use straight dollars because the euro was had a little more value and I was gonna have to pay more for the euro from the bank. So I just went ahead and used hundred dollars. It worked with it. Aye, aye, aye. All right, fellas. But the, I just finished uploading on my film. I'm probably going to jump about right now. But I appreciate y'all for the new panel. I will see you guys nice. again. All and, right, my um, boy. Yeah, yeah. QB passport, OG, T Love, Kings and Dreams, right. Big Boss. It's your boy F R E. Dollar sign H fresh at the Flyboy Way. That's T H E F L Y B O Y W A Y. Don't ask why to check out the channel. And I got this chick that want me to hang out with her right now, but I am too tired, so I'm going to sleep. Yeah, we see. You're tired, bro. You're tired. That's what players do, though. See, salute to you. Salute. Right on. Boom. Wow, man. Okay, okay. 
It still sounds like Cuba survived, though. I'm, I'm, I'm gonna give it a run for his money. Literally, give it a run. <laughs> for his money. Damn, <laughs> you kind of threw me for a loop, man. I didn't, I didn't like the sound of that. I'm walking to a situation. Where my U.S. dollar is used against me. I'm used to the dollar being, being my superpower. So, yeah, man, uh, I'm, I'm about to get my parachute ready, but I had a couple of questions uh, for, for T Love. Yeah, we, we, we miss it. We missing an hour, so we we jumping from uh from like two a.m. to we not even get to two a.m. straight straight to three a.m. Yeah, so that just means in a few hours, knock on the door. Where's my breakfast? So you know, seven year old. Oh, man. oh, your son? Yeah, yeah, yeah. Yeah. You so you said you when we was texting earlier on some other stuff about our thing this Monday. You said you was out bowling. Yeah. How yeah. was that? Uh, it was good, man. It was great, man. Uh, so they have like uh, they have like this um, glow bowling. So took him there, um, and then uh, my other friend he brought his daughter. So you know it was uh, you know dad's hanging out with the kids, man. So that's cool. Yeah, absolutely, man. Absolutely, man. For sure, for sure. Uh, T love. So um, so so I was talking. So I was talking to uh, so I was talking to fly offline, and. It looks like we looks like we're talking about like four days. So, how much money do you think we would need for four days, uh, Flyboy, Big Boss, and myself? It depends on how it depends on how you're getting down. I mean, what type of entertainment you really looking to do? How you're trying to entertain yourself? Because the food's very inexpensive, and it's not uh, like you're going to be like paying entrance for stuff to do like that. It's not crazy. So, would you say one female friend per day? uh let's say let's say let, let's say like uh for the four days um like if you want to double or triple up Ooh, he's a i'll say i'll say i would say i would just say 100 would keep you safe for that you're not gonna spend all that yeah that's not gonna keep that's not you're not gonna spend all of that yeah so but we yeah but we like yeah but what if like you know you want premium not not like you know not 87 <laughs> gas you want that 93. okay uh, JJ, uh, shout, out, shout out to uh, jj and his double it double it double it double it so, you say double it then double so, so, double so, double so, so four days eight hundred dollars yeah and the only reason well, i said that's you because you, you said you said triple though you said you said you triple triple it you want three a day, right? Double or three a day? How many a day? Oh, how yeah. How many a day and then double that? Yeah. So I, well, I was saying double or triple, just, you know. Oh, I'm triple. Just, I mean, I, I put 100 on each one because you're including the fun. And what I'm saying is you may buy some drinks. You might buy a plate, an extra plate of food with that with that engagement. Mm -hmm. You know what I'm saying? Uh, yeah. You know what I'm saying? So, yeah, but I'm just saying the totality of everything from transportation to everything, you know? So, so, four, so four I said 100. Oh, okay. So, four days, $400. Four days, $400, one. If it's two, I would go 200. And if it's if it's three, I would go 300 a day. Right. You're not going to spend that. But I'm saying because you can't get any more money, there's no right. way for you to get any money extra if you need it. No way. That's wow. a little dangerous, no way. man. Shit. Get that through me. your brain. I got it. Now, some people might say, some people might say that I'm saying too much for for the experience, but we all know it's better to have and not need the need and not have. So that's why I say that. Right Absolutely. now, yeah. how, how, is this safe out there? Because it's like, yo, if I hella can't safe, money hella safe, hella safe. Three o'clock in the morning, I was walking the streets. Okay, I'm, I'm gonna say, I'm gonna say this. Okay, he asked a good question. Thailand, 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 and Q are the safest place I've ever been in the world. Okay, he said this. You said he asked to say, you said, Hell, let's say three in the morning walking around. My thing yeah. is, you're gonna have all that money on you. Well, not on you, on you, you know, at, nah, you're at gonna have it in your Airbnb spot, or whatever. You're gonna, have, <laughs> you're, gonna cool. have the bag, you're gonna have the bag with you in country. You're gonna have the bag because you can't get new money. Don't Hell nobody want to go to jail, but, yeah. but 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 police because I know how. Mexico police. I know you a police, right. you a Mexico guy. I know how Mexico police get down. Police. No, and if you have no, money, they know you're right. American. You got the bag. Right. You can't bring the right. police interaction. Right. 
I didn't feel that. The only thing I felt with the police, the only time I felt police eyes on me was when I went towards women. That was it. Yeah. Okay. So you don't got to worry about them extorting you too much. Nah, they're very helpful. No, okay. not even the drivers. I had a personal driver, which I can give you guys, but I, I, I had a couple. But nah, not even that, man. None of those people want to go to jail down there. They don't want to go to jail down there. None of the people. You know what I'm saying? Right. Mm -mm. Now, I'm and, I can honestly, and I can honestly worry say about... the girls, the, I wouldn't even worry about the girls stealing. Keep it real. It, it wasn't none of that, man. Okay. You know? Okay. You bring, you bring gifts for the people, bring chocolate and other things for the people. You know what I'm saying? Free some chocolate, bring the chocolate, bring different gifts for the people, for the family, for the kids, batteries, toiletries, different things that can fit in your bag that don't weigh a lot. You know, uh, even certain clothing, clothing items, you know what I'm saying? And uh, they'll appreciate it. They'll really, really appreciate it. The people will. I mean, you're doing that. You're doing that. But no, nah, no. Nah, uh, safety is not a concern in Cuba. Honestly. Okay. I, I think if you talk to anyone, they'll tell you that's not a concern. But if you're not, if you're not trying to really, really, really play hard, you don't need a lot of money in Cuba. Cuba is a very inexpensive place to be if you're not trying to play hard. You know what right, I'm saying? Because right, right. you, you might meet one female and be cool with her the whole time and you're not going to need hardly no money because Ooh, she's not going to be tripping she's not going to be tripping each day or getting some money they're not like like the fly boy way said it's not like that they're not like they're not going to be on that hype about paper almost like uh, thailand was they weren't yeah. really on the hype they was on they the experience on, on money like that right but big box nah. is ready to bust it open over there right <laughs> yeah, but, we don't even, but, I, but i know big boss very well and he had you between 20 or 60 and be cool. Okay. And he might have no problem. And I have no problem. The clothes are ready. And he doesn't drink. 60 though, but yeah. And he doesn't drink. So, really, I should say. So, I don't should be sitting around 30 every time. It should be no problems. Gotcha. Yeah. But now, I mean, but going, going back to your case of dreams, I mean, honestly, to me, I think safely 150 a day is cool. So, so, so for your trip, but you have to always include transportation that, right? Because yeah. if your Airbnb, if your Airbnb host doesn't set up transportation from the airport, then you need to get your own ride from the airport. But hopefully your Airbnb. And, and, and host, how much is that more or less? 25 bucks. Okay. U.S. They'll try like 25 bucks. That's when I first came, my Airbnb host hooked up my transportation the first trip. And that was, that was like $25 after that. I found my own transportation walking around and talking to guys and um, found some good drivers, you know, that took me all around, you know what I'm saying? And, and it was good. And they went triple, you know, you do like we do anywhere else. You know, you buy your driver something to eat while y'all kicking it, you know, they, and a lot of the drivers are the plug too. So whatever you like and need, the drivers got that. So that's why I can tell you the variance between 20 to 30, 30 to 60, basically the drivers got all that for you. And then they also protect. They'll protect you in terms of time, time, and I know what you want. Let me take right here to it. You know what I'm right. saying? Right, right. Yeah, it's there. We're it's out there. there. It's out there. Yeah, it's out there. Yeah. Right. But the people are beautiful, and they and they love. They love our color. They love. They love. They love the brothers that come there. You know, like 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 you know, like just like the, the Black Panthers pushing to Cuba during the time when we had issues. You know, they love brothers coming to Cuba. You know what I'm Tupac, Tupac might really be alive exactly. out there. Exactly. <laughs> exactly. Well, yeah, you know, yeah. When yeah. you were out there, did you see like them? Because, you know, I, I've been in Miami and South Florida, like the white Cuban girls with the with the green eyes. and, and Amazing. 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 Okay. Yes, I did. And they had on all the white. And I don't know if there was uh, practice in Santa Maria or what, but they had on. The whole white, the whole like like uh, the flyboy had on this little head piece just now. They had on the all white. Had they had the head piece, amazing. I mean, some of the most beautiful women I ever seen in my life are in Cuba, no doubt, you no know, doubt. And I, and I just leave it there because I don't want boss to put the cap hat on me. But uh, yeah, but nah, they there, uh, they there. Yeah, <laughs> when you start when you start talking over uh, Brazil, yeah. Then I might I might have, now, I might have. But Brazil was that. But no, Brazil, well, no, no, no. Who's going uh, to this right uh, here? Uh, <laughs> hey, Cuba, 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 Cuba has some amazingly beautiful women of all different shades with different mixtures, like like you said, what 
look white bright but with green eyes gray eyes all of that all of that thick curly hair, thin, curly hair the lisa bonet curly hair afrocentric uh, yeah all of that damn yeah they got, uh, so, so boss i'm gonna give you the spot i'm gonna give you the spot i'm gonna give you the club to give to them offline where, where it's the ultimate club that everybody, anybody ever went to Cuba knows about. That's like Cuba, uh, Castro's people kind of own it, still kind of run it, and uh, they got top in, incredible. But but yeah, they, they talking that top dollar. I could do a top dollar uh, like once 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 or twice, you know. Oh yeah yeah, I'll give you an example. When I walked in the spot, they had a dude playing electric violin in the corner, neon lights all around the club. It's one of the most incredible bras I've ever seen in my life up in the I didn't I didn't think I was gonna find out in Cuba. And I was like, mm. man, where am I? Right. And uh it's for real. Yeah. But but then I got to talking to him, I realized where I was at. I was at a high place. Because they place. was asking top dollar. I, yeah, I, I could do that for the for the experience, for the one, two time for yeah. the experience. You know but Cuba saying? got it, man. Cuba's beautiful. And then you know, you got if you want to get more to the cultural, cultural, you go down to Santiago, you go further down, but you know, really you could have stayed in old Havana. And be cool, you know. Hmm. Cubana. Yeah. Cubana. Cubana yeah. Means if you ever get married, it's gonna be a Filipina race in Philippines, a Cubana race in Cuba. Yeah, that was gonna be yeah. my last question. Like, uh, well, what about like the what about like the non pros? Like, like, uh, are they hard all to over? Find? No, oh. they're not hard to find. Oh. Hard, not hard to find. Easy to talk to. The problem is you're not gonna talk to them on the street. Because if you bring attention to them or yourself, the police will come down on that. So when you get in a place, a place of business, they have little shops where people sit down and drink beer and stuff like that. You know, they, they have a live band playing. They have a few clubs you can go into and interact with them there, and, and you won't have an issue. Um, but yeah, I mean, no, out yeah, in public, no, you're not regular do that. girls. Though. And so, regular, and so, no, these are why, regular girls. Why, these are regular why, girls. Why, do the, why oh, okay. do the police be tripping like that? <laughs> I think, mean, it's, I think it's on what, I think it's on what, but I think it's on what, I think it's what, uh, exactly on what the, uh, the fight boy way he was speaking about, ideology. about the, indoct the ideology, ideology, indoctrination, indoctrination of change, you know, changing, okay. changing their mindset of the our Western ways, right? Um, yeah. But they don't deal with that, man. Every chick that we dealt with on my trips, because there's other brothers that linked up out there. We we told people where the address was. They went to it, or they followed us. Right. Mm. And but if you cross the street, uh huh. Too low. Okay, so I get it. Ideology, whatever. So how come they don't trip, like, or do they trip like that? If they see you really chopping it up with a, a with a uh, Cuban male, with a Cuban man, like mom they don't mom. trip at all. They don't trip at all. So what, trip is, at all. what is the difference? <laughs> I don't know. The man, the man would be. I don't know. The man would be like if you guys were planning. I don't, like I don't know. I don't know. I don't know if they think you, they're trying to sell you, you know, something. On so woman, they give it a pass. You know, on a woman, you're only talking about whatever. If you talk to a man, you could be planning like some real stuff. Like I don't know. I don't you, know you, because you show it's the like, police this. Like look. Yeah, I don't, don't even know, bro. This is not gonna mess up your ideology. They got this little. If I'm talking to another man, if I'm talking to a man, I could be setting up like some know, gorilla, so some gorilla operation, some some special out black op. If I'm talking to, yeah, a I don't man, know. You know I, I think I think I think because I think because they just use common sense to say if this female is talking to this dude and she look good, she's probably trying to set up something with this foreigner, and they will accost her immediately, and it'll be a big problem. But it's true like though. I kid you not. That sounds like hating. That is sound like hating to me. Sound like they don't want the prostitution over there. That's what it sounds like. Oh, gee, because I think you're you exactly can right. Man. You can talk to a but man. But it's kind of bad because you don't know that woman might be a regular woman, and not and not. But the thing is, when you're over there, they don't even want. It ain't, that ain't gonna even happen, bro. I'm telling you. Not even at the internet part. When I went and got an internet card, I was you know trying to put my bid in on some things, and it wasn't happening like that. You know what I'm saying? Right. They they didn't want to position themselves in such a manner. They were nice, but they didn't want to position themselves in such a manner to cause a scene to them, you know. So so I learned it quick. So it's a quick, you know. This is where I'm at, or where will you be later on, or this is where I'm staying. Here's my address. Let me know if you want to come through. Here's you know my number because I had a house phone in my Airbnb, so I had a number too. So you know, yeah, house yeah. phone. Yeah, because the cell phone ain't gonna do you too much good. So it's good to get a place with a house phone with a landline. What you yeah, said. and they got to 
So Clifton going places say Vietnam is a communist country, and technically you can't sex foreigners, but it's not difficult. Just hotels will block you. So, so is that a communist exactly. thing? Is that a communist thing where they kind of just hate with mixing communist might be, and American might be. Westerners because of ideology? Might so be. How, how do you get the yeah, girls in the hotel then? No, you can No, you well, I said Airbnb. I said Airbnb. I said Airbnb. I said Airbnb, I said Airbnb. Oh, when they came to Airbnb, we just walked upstairs. Yeah. Okay. So, so, um, and nobody questioned you when you're in the building. Um, and, and the police aren't the police. The police aren't posted on every corner. They're police. They're in the areas where people frequent, like social areas. So once you I hit the side that. streets, no police, no police are seeing them, but they see oh, you on the main so, street. So that but, means you gotta stay at an Airbnb if you want the pros to come through. Not necessarily. There's some hotels that are, that are guest friendly, but I'm just saying that's the best move. Get your Airbnb rest. Okay. Not all hotels are the same. Not all hotels are the same. That's the same thing in Medellin. That's the same thing in Cartagena. Not all not all hotels are the same. No, some are guest friendly. Some are. I was yeah. just about to say Cartagena. It's kind of yeah. it's hard. I mean, you can find it, but it's you know it's harder. harder. Yeah. But so, Cuba, they, they understand what it is, man. They understand what it is. And the females that the females, whether they're regular citizens or whether they're working girls. I don't even want to call them working girls because they're they might be females that just are need us some money and they get with you because i didn't really feel what everybody i dealt with i didn't feel like that they, they were working girls i really honestly felt like they were like this an opportunity for me to have something right so, so that so that means so that means they didn't get up and me. they didn't get up and leave right away after one pop nah nah none of them rush none of them rush okay. and there was no rushing <laughs> Cause, it, cause wasn't no Russian, up, it wasn't no Russian, but it wasn't. It wasn't overnight. It wasn't overnight either. Get up, if they get up, if they get up, if they get up and leave after one pop, they're a working girl. So I don't, uh, I don't care what you. I can't even answer. I can't even answer that because I didn't experience it that way. Okay. Yeah. Okay. Yeah. You're right. You said they they didn't happen. Yeah. But I'm saying if they did. Yeah. So yeah. And I didn't hear it happen to anybody that I know that's gone. Everyone that I know that's gone that's experienced Cuba, and I'm sure uh, the flubber will concur this. None of them, none, no one experienced that. There was good interactions. It wasn't no, no, like, it didn't feel like, like, okay, I'm on the clock. Okay, thank you. I got to roll. It wasn't like that. But it wasn't no, it wasn't the overnight situation. It wasn't no yeah. overnight. Okay. Nah. But I was popping in and out there, too. A cool middle ground. That's cool. Right. Right. They have a cool, they have a cool, they had a cool night vibe, too. So I was outside and inside. I was back and forth. So it wasn't like, you know. I mean, like I said, people out three o'clock in the morning. They got parks where you can go and use internet. People out late night, early morning, out kicking it, drinking coffee, cups of coffee, over by the morning. I'm out at three o'clock in the morning. I'm trying to pull something, man. And they're they gonna be outside too. Be out. so, now the top quality not gonna be outside, but you know, at that hour, unless they're at an event or a club or something, you know. I, I need to hit something. I I'll take a six at that point. Three o'clock in the morning, I'll take a six. So, yeah. I gotta get so, so Jay Lee says Vietnamese people. He said Vietnamese people can't have sex with foreigners. What the fuck? Where are you getting this info from, Clifton? I never heard anything like that before. <laughs> Clifton say, Clifton say, I was there. Okay, I was there. And Vietnam, oh, the country, they technically you're not technically technically you're not supposed to. You can obviously you can. But you technically can't, and they make it hard. Is what he's saying. He was there. I'm not. I'm going to defer to him until I go myself. So it is what it is. Hey, yeah, uh, uh, that's yeah. interesting, T Love. That's very interesting. So it, it is a little yeah. weird dynamic. You're going to have to kind of work through what you're saying is working. I think so. Okay. I think so. I used to. I used to have Cuba. I used to have Cuba, boss. Huh? You can go out there on a serious budget. Yeah. Uh-huh. Uh, so yeah. I, I just I, I just had a so I had one question in reference to to the phone. So um, so like they don't have like WhatsApp there, so that's why you need like the landline. They do have WhatsApp there. I know a girl right now talks to Cuba that has WhatsApp, but but her frequency of getting on WhatsApp is not not like how we do it. We on WhatsApp twenty four. She's not on WhatsApp like that. She might message yeah. me today. We might not speak to tomorrow. You know what I mean? Because the internet, you, it's the okay. internet. Yeah, but so they pushed, you... they pushed, they pushed the Facebook line. Because what happens is you get a, you get an internet card. They have internet parks and they have 
places where you can, they got like a, like a, you know, those old, when you used to go to track meet and they had those little, uh, little cubicles where people would be selling tickets or like the little fairs to sell tickets. They got a booth like that. You walk yeah. up to it. And they even got guys that'll sell you internet cards. It'll be a three hour internet card or one hour internet card. And, but you got to be in that area to use it. So you will sit there and use it for whatever you need. And then you'll push on. Yeah. It's not right. internet, like walking around like that. Yeah. Walk like around. you're not going to go to the Melicon and use the card. So, so dudes ain't got to worry about being a Western Union poppy in Cuba, mm -hmm. right? Never. <laughs> I, I, I I don't know about that, man. It's you know they, they're simping everywhere, man. Yeah, I don't right. care where you do it. No, no. You know how they simping? The, the only way they would simp over there is they would basically overpay and just like like she might say, "Well, give me this," and he might be like, "You know what? I'm gonna bless you and give you that." That's uh, how they gonna simp. They're not gonna be sending it over. Now, what they might do is they might pack an extra suitcase and go to the chick and say, "This whole suitcase is for you." Ooh, ooh. Ooh, wow. wow! Wow! Hey, big boss, I'm yeah. gonna get, I'm gonna get going, bro. You yeah, know, me, me too, man. It's uh, yeah, it's, yeah the, the, the the time, the time, the time has jumped. <laughs> what time is it? Still over here, yeah, yeah, it's late. It's, OG, yeah. OG, my co-pilot. We're gonna put hand them their parachutes. <laughs> yeah, we're gonna get yeah. them parachutes. Sub to the channel, passport flexing. New video Hold coming on. next week. <clears throat> King right, of Dreams, we'll we'll do a, a a collab soon, bro, on your channel. Yeah, definitely, definitely. Uh, yes, yeah, it's, it's gonna have to be when I get back from uh for, from Medellin because I'm leaving um I'm leaving early early Wednesday morning. Like my flight is at like okay like like, like five in the morning. So okay, cool. When right. we get back, no worries. All right, my dude. But yes, for right. sure, QB man, we gonna do it, man. Okay, boss, it's been a pleasure. OG T T, T, T Leezy, you know I'll get at y'all. Mm -hmm. All right. All right. Take care. Hey, get, get your game. For sure. For sure. Practice yeah, your man. game, QB. Practice <laughs> your game, man. <laughs> oh shit. O OG, OG, big boss. Shout out to uh, T Love for for the uh, for the Cuba game. Uh, Flyboy right. Way. Uh, no you know, um, check. Uh, Zoom to Thailand. There you go. The panel. Everybody, man, um, this was definitely uh, an epic, an epic live, man. Another epic live, man. We we got a we got a lot of information here, you know. And OG, man, it was good to see you back because I had gotten here a couple of times. I was like, where is he at, man? <laughs> right, man. I'm yeah, he had me flying the plane with no co-pilot, man. <laughs> Sorry, boss. It's all good, man. You know, like I got sidetracked. I couldn't find your uh, videos, boss. I'm like, where's? I couldn't find anything on you. That's why I miss you. And then I saw the repeat. I'm like, oh man. Yeah, that's all yeah. good, man. Life happens, man. But um, but definitely everybody uh, you know, subscribe to the channel. Uh this upcoming Monday, 8 p.m. Eastern Standard Time. Gonna have Big Boss, the Flyboy Way, uh, a couple of others. Um, gonna be live on my channel. Uh then Tuesday, we got the uh, you know, we got the pregame to Medine. And then Wednesday, uh, official live, 9 p.m. Eastern Standard Time with Raise the Race. And I'll figure it out from there. But that is Monday, Tuesday, and Wednesday lineup. And I lineup. got yeah, and I got some things coming Thursday throughout the weekend. So uh, I got boots on the ground in Medellin, and I can't wait, man. So just make sure you follow me, Kings and Dreams. That is on YouTube, Instagram. Shout out to everybody again. Uh, you know, Zoom to Thailand. Uh, check in effect, Flyboy Way, uh, QB Passport uh, Flexing, T Love, OG, and the man of the hour who put all this together, Big Boss. I'm out. You out. King and Dreams. That's what it is, man. Then it was three. Yeah, and OG it. and my moderator, T Leezy, all yeah. from Oakland, California. That's right. And soon I'm going to get a parachute from OG. But uh, I wanted to just say that, uh, you know, because we got to let you and OG fly the ship on home, however long y'all stay on, you know what I'm saying? Uh, but, uh, yeah, I mean, I, I mean, if King and Dreams is really going to do it like that, yeah, I mean, I think that two or three hundred a day will keep him safe, you know what I mean? So that because he won't be able to get any more money because he can always bring money back home, you feel me? Uh, but you just don't want to be out there and be short, and then and then got to figure out what you're gonna do for the next couple of days. 
because you're in the country and the prices can rise up because it's, it's, it's about necessity, right? So if they start running low on a certain type of product or food or something, that, that, that can escalate, you know? And then what you gotta do, you know, because you are in a country that's, that has major restrictions on it. You are in a country that America doesn't deal with. You are in a country that gets major support for Russia right now. Russia is basically in the little war. So all they have for them is China. But they owe Russia money because they pay Russia. So, I mean, at the same time, you know, you just want to be paid for that while you're out there. So that way, no matter what it is, you can handle it, you know, and then, you know, come back with the rest. Uh, all right, but, uh, yeah, you should have dropped and told everybody who you still have on, man. <laughs> you know what I'm saying? One of the, one of the people in the panel kind of said it, and I was like, I saw you post it. I was like, oh, okay, they sharp. You know, your future guests. Right, 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 right. Yeah, yeah, yeah. They picked it up. They picked up on it. Like I say, there's only so many at the top echelon. So you got the yeah. five, you got check and effect. You know, you got the other <laughs> one. So I got the other one. I got the other one soon. Yeah, yeah. Soon. Okay. I know you're probably taking it. I have asked. I know you're on top of it. You know, I think everybody should enjoy that. We just got to get it out there so people can really view. This was an epic live tonight. It shows your power of networking brothers to work together. So it's a good look. Hey, definitely. Hey, man, it's a beautiful thing that people are receptive, right? So right. all I can do is throw a pass. Brothers got to catch it. <laughs> so I'm, yeah, glad I think, I'm glad people yeah, I think are that, putting down. No, you're right. I think a lot of good jewels were dropped tonight, too, with you guys, with you guys interaction. So it's really good. You feel me? But uh, no, I appreciate coming up just to let people know a little something about Cuba, but Cuba's a must go to, and uh, they enjoy it. But like you know, you know, you got me for the information need to share with the brothers. Plus, um, you know, other brothers too that have been to Cuba that can give you their run too, and we can put it all together for people to have uh, you know enough information to make their own proper decisions for how they like to move. Right. Um, yeah. definitely other than that, I'm, I'm definitely intrigued. I mean, it sounds like a challenge, but this sounds like a nice challenge though, like a nice little puzzle to figure out, like. Doable, doable, and you know, challenging, but you know, here's the thing here's the thing a working girl career is not legal over there, so so they got to be careful how they move. Okay, they can't be over there, like you know, some country where it says legal for this and that, and they're legal over there, especially with a foreigner. So, you know, they got to be careful how they get out. So if they get out wrong, they can have a problem with the law, right? So, that's right. why I say, that's why I say. You know, it can work to your favor on what you like to do and how you like to get down because they're going to be like, okay, well, it is what it is because what I'm going to do, I'm going to go and report him to somebody. Right. Right. So, yeah, okay, here, yeah, I'll take the 20. <laughs> I'll take the 30. Yeah. <laughs> yeah, there you go. There you go. Now we talk. But it's all about, it's all about interacting and giving them love because they're not even tripping like that. You, you might give them a meal and they're hungry, you might give them a beverage and they're thirsty. So, uh, real fast before you step down, obviously, yeah. it's a, it, they speak Spanish, right? Spanish speaking country? Predominantly, but there's some that speak English around you. Yeah. Oh, okay. Predominantly. Okay. And then, yeah. Okay. Ooh. And you saying that the what's the name don't be working? You download, right? You're going to download your trans. You're going to download your. your you're going to download that. Pre, okay. pre download okay. that. Oh, you know, you know where I was going with that then. Yeah. 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 And my bad. I should have also mentioned download your maps. And download your your uh, translator. Download those two things. Download it. There ain't no there download ain't your any, map. It's gonna be iffy, spotty, and whatever. Yeah, yeah. Download those two things. Your translator and your. You can download your translator and your maps so that when you're driving around, you know where you're at, okay. and things like that too. Okay. Yeah, yeah. And on that note, I'm out. Boom. Well, thank you, man. As always, T Love, T Leasy, helping out in the. Uh, in the chat moderating coming up yes, on sir. the channel and um also helping out bossy boss in the background uh as my strategist uh one of the a big help in my strategy so shout out oh uh, yeah um, all the way to the top baby payment man peace peace og all right peace t love take care be blessed then there was two yeah i'm gonna get to this uh super chat i did i just didn't want to cut off t love uh to read the super chat uh, but now T Love stepped down. Uh, thanks for T Love. Uh, the super chat, Kings and Dreams, ten dollars, man. Thank you for the ten dollars, bro. Epic live, epic lives. Thanks, big boss. 
Yes, sir. Yes, sir. Yeah, you know you got clips coming off of this, man. <laughs> so right on, man. I would gladly accept this ten dollars uh, for the clips that you're gonna use. Uh, it's all good. Real talk, man. That's that's what we do, man. We work together. Yes, sir. Man, we got our dog, Yogi. Yogi still awake? And Yogi needs to go to bed. <laughs> What's up, Yogi? What's up, Yogi? You miss me? You miss Bossy Boss, Yogi, Yogi? He said, yep. Miss Bossy Boss? He said, yep. He miss Man. you. <laughs> I'm going to see you in real life uh, whenever uh, OG moves to Cartagena and it gets situated <laughs> and then brings you down there. And then much later, I go down to visit and stay at one of the extra rooms of OG, I'm going to finally see our doggy, Yogi Yogi. <laughs> yeah. That's what's up, man. <laughs> Shout out to Yogi Yogi Yogi. Man, right? Man, you're welcome. You're welcome, kings and dreams. You're welcome. Mm -hmm. But it's all good, man. It's all good. It's all good. Have at it, bro. Have at it. Have at it. Yes, sir. Content on content on content. We're rocking for four hours, man. I can keep going at least another hour. You know me. I got a good, I always got a good five in me. Four or five. Six max. Uh oh, you know the time change tonight, right? Oh, for real? It do? Yes. I didn't know that. So you're gonna lose, it, you're gonna lose an hour. So if it's 11, 12 now, it's already 12. It's already after midnight. If yeah. you know. Well, not yet, but yeah. So, but not yet, but yeah. So you're gonna lose an hour. It's what? gonna be daylight saving time. What? Say it ain't so. It is so. Damn it. Yeah, man. <laughs> he said the bars, man. Yeah, uh, you right. Thailand got them blowjob bars, man. That was so lit. <laughs> blowjob bars was lit, man. Just like it sound. Exactly <laughs> like that. Man, I ain't never experienced nothing like that. Yeah, man. So, like I say, man, I can keep going. I ain't really ran out of gas. So I just don't have a whole, whole lot to say, but I can keep going. Um, the people out there, we dropped the link again. Uh, I, I, I can bring another person or two on, depending on who you are. Book Travel, you out there, Book Travel? I got twenty. I got twenty-four people. I don't know who the twenty-four, but I got twenty-four still rocking with me. There's the link if you want to come up with boss and the co-pilot OG. There's the link. You can click it and come up. Um, would you say Clifton? So I work an hour less. Yeah, I be hating that when you be at work. Philly is security guard or whatnot. Security guard working a night shift, working a graveyard shift, and the time goes back. Or the time goes for it. Like, how does that work, man? Yeah, I know. <laughs> That's crazy. That is crazy, bro. I'll pay you an extra hour. Yeah, they better. And then what happened when it jumps? <laughs> when it jumps forward, when you get off, you get off. You work hour. Hour. Yeah, but it's yeah. That's crazy. <laughs> All right, happens tonight, huh? Damn, damn it, Gina. Shit, boss might uh have to make a burrito run, man. Hey, boss, I saw you trying to do that little pull up. What happened, man? You couldn't get up there. Ah, uh, yeah, <laughs> I couldn't do it, man. I couldn't do that one pull up. But it, to my credit, man, that wasn't like a whole bar where I get my hand around the bar. I know it was a log. It was a yeah, log. It, it was it was a log. Yeah, so my hand on the log. My hand was kind of like that. And if I, I think if I had the bar, I I, I want to say I could have got one. I, you know, I'm I'm surprised. I'm surprised myself. I I didn't get one. I literally thought I had like three, four, five in me. Yo, you saw I could not pull my. And again, like I say, I couldn't get the thumb. Right. It was. Yeah. It was just my hand was just on the log. Right. But the chick did it though. The chick yeah. did it. Yeah. The chick did it, and she pulled her whole self up. You know. Uh, so um. Oh, I, I do got the video on my phone somewhere. She uh was on the pole, on the street pole. I saw that. Yeah. Yeah, outside on the street. Yeah. yeah uh, Flyboy had that on his. Yeah. Yeah. 
Yeah, yeah, yeah. Yeah, so she said, uh, yeah, so she was able to pull herself up on a regular street pole. So, mm -hmm. yeah, she was able to pull up on that log. Pause. Wasn't my log, though. <laughs> yeah, mm -hmm. no, I couldn't do it to answer your question. I couldn't do it, man. Boss, I got to get in shape, bro. I got to get in shape. Boss, could not pull myself up one time if my life depended on it i'd have been dead that day damn they say hey we'll give you all the coochie in here you want you you do that you i'm yeah, sure wow. you would have did it you'd have figured it I out did, I, did. I, I'd, I'd have did it then i'd have did it then <laughs> i'd have did it then i would have did it even more so than the gun to my head you tell me that i'd have did it i would have um uh, yeah, I thought I had that. I thought I had it on. Yeah, man. Overall, like overall, that trip was fun. It was fun. It was generally fun and cool and dope kicking it and hanging out with Flyboy. With man. the Flyboy. So shout out to Flyboy. It was cool and dope hanging out with him in real life. And it was fun. Just, it was dry for the most part. It was, you know. And so that's the only thing I did. I did not like. It was mostly a dry trip. But so it you didn't get nothing when you was there. You didn't get nothing. Well, yeah, okay. You might have missed out. No, so twice. Yeah, but, I saw a couple of girls you guys was looking at. Oh yeah, but the, yeah, the ones I got wasn't on camera. Those would have uh, been nice. No, so at a massage parlor, or, you know, a, a fake wannabe massage parlor, I paid extra for the extra massage, to the tune of a hundred bucks uh yeah. yeah and the quality of the girl might have been a six might have been a six i'm being generous with a six uh a, a extra massage hundred dollars and then a girl off a tender uh to come through that hung out for like two hours for also a hundred dollars uh she was like a six at best and so that was just too much money. A hundred dollars is too much money. Yeah. Um, you know me, I'm cheap. I don't like to pay more than 50. 60 is normally my max. 60 is my max, but I prefer 40 or 50. But I talked about a hundred and a hundred for a six. Damn. Wow. Not good. Not good. And so with those kind of prices and quality, then I just took what I can get, just those two, and left it alone. Good thing it was only a four-day trip. Out of those four days, I had two, and yeah. So the first the first two days were dry, and the last two days, bam, bam, a hundred, hundred, a hundred and hundred for sixes, not good, and whatever, man. Cancun was dry, period. Oh yeah, well yeah, well yeah. The can well the Cancun, yeah, we really didn't do Cancun per se. Cancun was just the airport to fly in and out. So we did Tulum and play at a Carmen. Right. Tulum, play at a Carmen, but we flew in and out of Cancun. So we didn't stay in Cancun. We just flew into Cancun and went right out. Yeah, so yeah, I, I would imagine if I'd have been in Cancun, it probably would have been even worse because Cancun is very touristy where the airport is and the major beach. So Cancun probably would have been even worse. So uh, yeah, I got zero in Tulum. Zero in Tulum. But when you saw the, uh, the the girl interactions, that was Tulum. So those are regular Matrix chicks. The first night, we, we saw those four chicks in a nightclub. And then the very next night at the restaurant, we invited two of the four girls to come. Those two girls never came. And then I met the other two girls at the restaurant and asked them to come join us. And we ended up hanging out after the restaurant at, the, uh, at a couple of bars. But nothing ever came of that. You know, regular Matrix stuff. Hanging out, buying drinks at the end of the night. Thank you. We had a good time. So, Snake Eyes. Zero, zero on Tulum for two days. Two days in, two days in Tulum strikeout. And then the next two days of Player to Carmen, one on each day. One, one, hundred, hundred, six, six. And, uh, yeah, at that point, it was just time to go. Right, I feel like Cliff down in Egyptian being in Egypt. 
yeah, man. So there's nothing to write home about. There's nothing to write home about at all. It's just a biological function to get it done, <laughs> you know, to get that out of me. And it's, <sighs> yeah, so. You probably did better than TJ, huh? Technically, I would have. And I hate to say it, but in all honesty, yeah. I mean, at, at that point, I might as well have been a TJ. Uh, and it's, it worked with the with the street with the street stuff. And up pay, up pay to, uh, you know, the base price of the street meat, like double that. To get what I want would have been about still half of you know yeah it's a trip where you gotta like force a, a a square peg into a round hole to get what you want you know it's just it didn't yeah. flow but right. I just had to do what I had to do and whatever man whatever so Clifton is uh, going places how much more is Cartagena than Medellin I know a little bit more oh yeah. Uh, some people say double, especially with the quotes right now. Yeah, what they ask and what they will accept, sometimes two different things. So a lot of times they're going to ask for the moon. The original quote, the initial quote, they will ask for the moon. But what they ask and what they will accept through your negotiation to knock it down. Yeah, but uh, just off top, the original quote, Cartagena is going to be more than Medellin. Again tourist tourist area with a beach if it's a beach nice weather nice weather in a beach tourist area always going to be more uh same exactly same thing with brazil even though their more is not a lot so their whole system is lesser thank god but still uh rio rio de janeiro coca cabana by the beach by the beach in Rio is more than the inner city of Sao Paulo. Again, anytime you're going to be by a beach, Sasua Beach, more than the inner city of Santiago. Anytime you're by a beach, a tourist area beach with good weather, that beach tourist area raises the price. Girls just get greedy. They get greedy because they know you're a tourist and you're there for the beach. You're there for the good weather. You get, you're there for the, for the, uh, the drink, the drink, the drink out the coconut on the beach, they're going to run it up. So, my, I don't need a beach. I like a, I like a beach, but damn, if the beach is going to be the reason, put me in the middle of the city then. And then watch them prices go down. Put you in the hood. <laughs> put me in, okay, now now we, we're not even talking Medellin. Now we're talking Bogota. Yeah. Now we're talking Santa Fe, Bogota. Put yeah. me in the hood. If, if me being at a beach makes the prices go up then i'm going to reverse it put me right in the hood put me in the hood prices come down and it's a shame it's like that right that's a shame damn yeah but you know the girls they use every they use and they smart they use every trick and tactic any any excuse to raise the price any excuse any any excuse to raise the price so you buy a beach with good area, good good weather, all of that, it's going to be more. You pay for convenience, right? You pay right. for convenience. So guess what? Big boss, the robot monger, put me right in the middle of the fucking hood. Now, nah, bitch, watch that price come down. Mm -hmm. Now you on boss level. And boss is going to do what? Bust it up! Beat it up. Yeah, beat it up. But I say bust it up. But yeah, beat it up too. Yeah, so that's just how that goes, man. You can't be mad at it. That's that's the game. That's how the game is played. And uh, sometimes in Rome, you got to do as the Romans. <laughs> so that's, what I, that's what I did when I was in um uh, uh, in Mexico playing the I carnival. Saw you. you were Roman. I was a I was a straight <laughs> Roman. I was a Roman soldier, Roman legion. What the legion? A centurion. I was a Roman centurion. I was a Roman. I had to be a Roman. I didn't like it. I didn't like being a Roman. Mm -hmm. But if I if I want if I wanted to, if if I wanted to uh to smash, I had to be a Roman. And being a Roman mean I had to pay top dollar for for mid quality. Now they had good quality. Shout out. You see you seen Flyboys. Uh they mm -hmm. had good quality. But now you can't win for losing. You can't win from losing. So now if you want that good quality, 
Nigga, you really gonna be paying. Now you're talking 200 or better. Oh, no. Me and Flyboy was in a um, gentleman's club right across the street from my Airbnb. Now, this is still Tulum. This is where we went to play the Carmen. The first two, day, the first two days in Tulum, Tulum, right across the street from my Airbnb um, hotel, which is a gentleman's club. We went in there on a late night. Man, they was talking $300 USD. Damn. Bitch, that's a flight. Are you <laughs> fucking serious? Three, 300, 300 USD? Yeah, that's crazy. That is very crazy. It ain't you, worth it. At all. Mm-mm. At a gentleman's club. In a gentleman club on a late night, $300. Now, I don't know how they can justify that. I mean, that would even that that would not be worth it if it was overnight. It wouldn't be worth it. Let alone a a a, a, a sheen dig, a sheen dig, rolling the hay at, at the club in the back room at the club. Are you crazy? A back room at the club on a late night, three hundred bucks. What a if pop! It, if Two everybody pop? stopped paying, then hey, it wouldn't be none. They have to drop their prices. Everybody stopped paying. So right, so the simple fact that they can say that out their mouth that means somebody was paying before that. That's yeah. that's what it is. Yeah. Or or at least or at least the, maybe maybe the regular price is two two fifty, and you know they always going to try to swing for the fences, right? Mm-hmm. So even the regular price might be two, and I think it might be around two, two two fifty. They're going to start with three, see if they can get it. But even that that means guys are going there paying two hundred USD in Mexico. Yeah, this ain't Las Vegas. This no. ain't Miami. <laughs> I'm not flying way down here to pay you know two three hundred dollars. Are you crazy, man? So it is what it is. When in Rome, but uh, again, that's sometimes people putting things out of context. Again, squeezing a, a square peg through a round hole. If you if you go into those places a lot of times, you're gonna have a chick with you. You're gonna bring sand to the beach. You're gonna bring you know it's a it's a couple's place. You bring you bring your chick. You don't go there as a single solo man trying to hunt. Um, if you do, then you get hit with fuckery like that. So those kind of places, you know, you bring your chick with you. Yeah, that's not a place. Certain places are set up for certain shit. So you're trying to force your get down in their situation they already got set up they like nigga this is how we do here already that's fine if you want that then you go here or you go there but if you come here we already have a situation set up already so i gotta respect that right you know i just i just went so i can hook up with uh you know um collab with flyboy on some youtube shit um right. thinking i was gonna get some extra on the side you know it's like nah i said okay i learned my lesson i it's separate. It's a separation. Do you want this or do you want that? And if you want you this, this, or you can get that. Give it that. And if you want this, you better program. You better program your mind right for a certain setting. And this is what it is, right? And you can't be mad. Okay. Now I know. So uh, yeah. So the next few trips, I gotta get it in. Yeah. So uh, because I had ten, I had a ten. Nice looking at New Life in Medellin. For one of the six, right? Yeah, 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 exactly. Of course, exactly. That, that's what I'm saying. So that's what messes you up when you're a seasoned traveler. When you're a seasoned traveler and you've been other places, you know what shit's a cost. If you want to say it like that, you, if you want, and I choose to say it like that, but then technically, like every place yeah. is different. But in my mind, I know what the, I know what, what the money is worth, what I can get. I know if I go to Colombia, if I go to Colombia, go to Medellin, I know what the dollar will buy me. I know if I go to Brazil, Rio or Sao Paulo, I know what my dollar can buy me. Uh, my dollar rate and the quality to it. So now knowing that and I come here, you want a hundred dollars for this? <laughs> I'm like, wow, you know, it, it, it messed me up. But again, Every place is different. There, I had to be a Roman, as OG say. 
So I'm like, it messed me up. I'm like, wow. It's like, I know the value of my dollar, but the value don't go far here <laughs> because it's just too touristy. It's too close to U.S. Right. Colombia, Colombia is what it is. Brazil is what it is. It don't border the U.S. It don't, it don't share. It don't share a freaking land border, right? That you can walk across. It's too close to U.S. Anything too close to U.S. is going to be tainted. You got to get far away. Shout out to Thailand on the other side of the freaking world, where it's already tomorrow. Well, it's already tomorrow anyway. Which is already. 24 it's like it's literally like 20 something hours ahead it's almost mm-hmm. a full day ahead you got to get far away from america yep yeah so it is what it is and i knew that so it is what it is you know i start i start griping about it in a couple of weeks <laughs> but right now i'm still i'm still i'm still feeling it i'm still feeling the sting and the burn yeah uh, you look bitter yeah i'm still bitter <laughs> man i'm still bitter it'll go it'll go away in another month or so <laughs> and what really would make it go away is another trip to wash that one out. Yeah. <laughs> yeah, but shit, like I say, my the two sticks. Yeah. I don't got the two sticks. I'm all good now. I'm good. Oh, I'm you got good. the second one? Oh, you, you yeah. boosted by now, right? Huh? Are you boosted? Yeah, no, I ain't boosted, but I'm just, you know, the two sticks, that's all I'm two? getting. Oh, okay. Uh-uh. Yeah. Yeah. No booster. Fuck a no booster. booster. Yeah. Well, a lot of the mandates and stuff are starting to fall off. But okay. But okay, that might be the case. But some of the travel restrictions still in place, so that don't do me no good. That don't really do me a lot of good till the travel restrictions are removed from the entry to these countries, and then. The re entry well, the re entry back is just a PCR test, mm-hmm. and you know, me, I, ha- I haven't had a regular PCR test yet, so all my PCR tests have been salivas, mm, okay. um, and I don't know how long I can keep I can get away with that, but I've been lucky the last two in two years, I never had a regular um swab PCR test in two years and been traveling, <laughs> mm. hey, but uh, so. It is what it is. He said, I'm going there to get some content. What, Cancun? Yeah, that's what it's good for. So shout out to Flyboy. He's smart. I mean, he, he, he's a YouTuber. He, mm-hmm. He's a real he's a real life YouTuber. Went there. He went to a channel. You see, the way he put it together. And, it, and it's amazing, right? Because I was there, right? I was there. I seen pretty much what he seen. And I seen every time he pulled out his phone. Now, maybe yeah. I should have put out, I should have put out my phone. And sometimes I did. But uh, he was pulling on his phone every five minutes, and I seen I seen what he seen. I was right there, shoulder by shoulder. He put out his phone. We come back. I go to his channel, and I see the way he put it together. I'm like, wow, that's creative. So you know, it gave me a lot to work with, like for learning to really to really see that in real life. Mm-hmm. So you got you guys see it on the other end, just whatever. I was there with him on the ground, seeing the same stuff and watching him pull out his phone. And then see the transition, see the magic happens the way he put it all in a video. So that's dope. I wasn't doing it all like that. And uh, right. maybe and maybe in the future I would get better at doing that. Like when I'm out and about, pulling out my phone, grabbing a whole lot of random footage, grabbing a lot of footage, coming mm-hmm. back, figuring out what goes together, putting music with her, making a nice little package and bam, 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 bam. So that's dope. He did it right. That's how, that's how you're supposed to do it for YouTube. Yeah. That's how you're supposed to do it. Boss, I wasn't on that. <laughs> I wasn't on that time like that. Even though I'm a YouTuber myself, but I wasn't on that time. But, you know, it was good for me to take it in and to see it. I see the process better. And, uh, of course, when we was there, he was giving me a lot of game directly in my ear, really put me on game, telling me a lot of stuff. I still, he still put me on a lot of tips and tricks, a lot of secrets. So it was worth it, was worth it for that. Mm. But the other part of me is like, man... I couldn't bust it up. <laughs> Way boss wanted to, but you know it is, it is what it is. YouTube, you said no CTG. Yeah, well, you know, I, I want to go one time, and now I got to go because my co-pilot gonna be there. <laughs> so I, I really got to go. So, uh, you know, like I we'll, say, we'll accommodate you. Yeah, yeah, yeah. And like I said, I can I can go to any place at least once to check it out. Hell, I did play the Carmen in Tulum. 
I can go in. But now here's the thing, though. Am I, I'm at, well, with OG, I might stay there a few more days longer. What, what I was going to say, will I stay there for two weeks? No. <laughs> if I know a place is like that, then I'll make sure my time is short. Just really to experience it, to experience, to take it in, and to experience, and then I'm out. I won't really put down roots and stay there a long time. But um, but of course, when you live somewhere, when you're there for a long time, especially if you know the language, you can speak Spanish. If you can speak Spanish and you live there and you stay there for a long time, obviously, you can start to work. The dust will start to settle. The dust will start to settle and things will kind of even out and you can move around. When you there kind of hiked up on, on, on a weekend trip, you ain't got time all like that. So, and the chicks will hit you over the head for that. They will hit you over the head. He, oh, he said, oh, I mean, I'm not going to Cancun. Oh, okay. All right. Yeah. I, I would almost say don't. I mean, whatever. But okay. You didn't mean that anyway. You said, mm. I'm, I meant I'm not going to Cancun, but I'm going to Cartagena next month. Oh, okay. Well, that's what's up. Yeah. Cartagena, Cartagena. And the Cancun. To be honest, like I say, man, I can't put my stamp on it. Well, well, er, again, I guess I said it and I repeat myself again like I always do. For the Cancun, for Cancun, Tulum, play the Carmen, for Cancun, sand to the beach, bring a chick. Bring a chick and enjoy it because it has everything else, right? It has the weather. It has the food. They have seasoning. Unlike Cuba, they have seasoning. It's freaking Mexico. They got all kind of peppers, you know, spices, seasoning. They got, yeah. the, they got the food. They got the weather. They got the beaches. They got the vibes. They got all that. It's dope. It is dope. But if you're a single man trying to hunt, uh, it's better to bring to bring sand to the beach to bring a chick. Otherwise, your uh, your options are going to be the tourist chicks. And, it, and it's a big tourist area, and a lot of women um, travel, too. So you can come up on the tourist chicks, but the tourist chicks, they tend to run together in packs. Women don't travel by themselves. Like a man, like, shout out to Milano. Milano uh, did the video the other day, uh, the pros and cons of guys traveling solo and traveling in groups. Women don't travel solo, period. It's always going to be a group. So now your lone with self is going to be trying to pull a chick away from her girlfriends on a girl trip and you just not meeting her fresh from Adam. Don't know her Scott from Adam and trying to pull her away from her protective, her protective girlfriends. Oh they're yeah. Gonna real, they're going to be overly protective of her. Even if she's kind of with it, some of her, right. hate, some of her hating that her hating ass girlfriends, it'll be straight cock blocking. They're going to cock block. They're going to be overprotective. And sometimes rightly so in their minds, right? They don't know you. You're just right. a guy from Adam. So yeah. they're gonna be protective, and if you don't got a if you don't got a bunch of guys with you to kind of occupy them, you know what I'm saying, to be the wingman to occupy them, you're by yourself trying to pull one chick from it four or five work. chicks. It's not people guys can always talk a good game and talk bullshit, but in real life reality, how's that really gonna work, right? Yeah, how's that really gonna work in reality? You're one guy gonna try to pull one chick out of a group of four or five. You're gonna pull her from a group of four or five all by herself. Uh, you got to be a hell of a n- <laughs> hell yeah. of a nigga to do that because they're not having it. They're not gonna have it because they're gonna hate. They're gonna play. Yeah. The one they say he ain't got he ain't got no friends for me. Yeah, I ain't gonna let you have all the fun. And girl, we supposed to do this together. And you're gonna run off and leave. You know all this hating that shit. Yeah, it's just the chances are very low. And then with the locals, the locals don't look that hot. Uh, average the average the average locals don't look that hot. You know they kind of short, kind of stubby, kind of whatever. The average don't look that hot. And then the ones that do look good, oh, you can't win from losing. So yeah. my advice, if you're going to do the Cancun, bring a chick with you. That well, way, you, Cancun that is way you, can like, enjoy, you can enjoy the environment and you got a chick with you. Cancun's more like that, uh, you know, like spring break. That's basically what it is. That's mm. why people go there. Mm. College girls gone wild. Puts and going places. Well, the European and Australian girls travel alone. Well, what experience American black different story? Okay, I hear you. I hear you. I didn't really see no female alone by themselves, European or otherwise. 
is it was at least two. At yeah. least it's always two. gonna be a, it's always gonna be somebody with at them. least two. Yeah. I did not see one. I it's funny, I, I'm I'm really thinking. I almost did not just see one just la la la, this all by herself, lone wolf. Well, you know what? I kind of did. I take that back. I see, and the only one, maybe because I I, I I noticed this because that's the one flyboy ran up on. <laughs> It was it was a cool chick. I think she she must have been by herself, and Flyboy ran up on her. Conversation oh, is, that, with her. is that the one in the black dress? No, she didn't have no dress. It wasn't no club. It was just walking outside. Okay. Yeah, we were we were outside. We were by the clubs, and it was still daytime, kind of where well, the sun was setting. She was kind of by herself, I I think. And Flyboy uh, talked to her, spoke to her for a few minutes, and then next thing I know, the phones came out. They was just changing information. So uh, yeah, he came up, and she was from France, a white girl from France. Damn. Yeah. So yeah, I take that back. That's the white one time. I, yeah, that's the one time I seen that. But uh, normally they are gonna be in groups. Yeah, man. But like I said, though, it was a, it was a fun overall experience, like fun. But for what I like, nah, it wasn't. It wasn't like it wasn't it. So it wasn't really worth it. Well, you know, I, I don't I don't want to say that. I don't want to say the whole thing not worth it because just for why why I went was kind of worth it. Could have well, been better than okay. what Okay, so I got I got it right here. <laughs> I got it right here. Hold on. Hold on. It's gonna get big. My friend, let me take this. What's going on? Okay. Can you guy? Oh, okay. He did his thing. She had a nice little shape on her. Yeah, not bad at all. I'll take that. Yeah, yeah she was she was from France. Wow. Damn. Nice body. Mm. Yeah. I hope he got that. He got the number at least. Yeah, it'd be going to France then. <laughs> <laughs> Lean in. There's a lot of people. A lot of people. Yeah. You know, y'all, but it, you know, he was out there. Yeah. He was on it. He was on it. Conversating. Yeah. Mm -hmm. That's what's up. You know, you know, it just was what it was. I mean, you know, it's just yeah, yeah. I was there, and it's yeah. like you say, Clifton uh, to uh, Jamie's, or like I was there in Vietnam. I was there. I, I was on it literally. You see, there's people walking around. Hey. So hey, just bring your chick, man. Um, uh, yeah, bring your chick. Yeah, but okay, like you said, that one chick was from France. Europe, she was by herself for the most part. Yeah, you and you can get lucky, but then yeah, but then you're literally relying on luck i mean like you're flying all that way for luck yeah rolling the dice with a lone, yeah a lone european or australian chick that uh you can you can bag so yeah i mean it's good hey some people like those kind of odds me i'm not gonna bet like that. <laughs> i'm not gonna bet my limited my limited money my limited time money and resources on a on a long shot like that to get lucky Mm -mm. I need a more I need a more secure situation. Oh yeah, that's how bossy boss do it, man. Shout out to the vital message. Shout out to the vital message, man. You be having good uh good live streams too. I don't know how long yours normally be, but whenever I, I check in on your live streams, uh, you be having good you be having good uh solid uh panels. Um, uh, you be having a a, a good uh uh. Uh, watch rate right? you be having like 30 people watching you sometime and uh shout out to you your your channel um you, what you only have what a few hundred subscribers yet you're on your way to a thousand and uh you stay at least at 30 30 40 people watching you all the time uh, even right now i only got 26 and i have more earlier or even right now i got 26 so yeah you 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 uh be rocking pretty strong he said, I always appreciate the discussion. I usually go three hours long. Okay, about three hours. That's what's up. Yeah, like I say, man, you be having good, you be having good panels. 
a lot of strong people in your panel. You be having like 30 people, 30, 40 people watching you. So that's what's up, man. You you got a good following. The people that follow you got you got a good strong following. Especially, especially per per your uh subscriber count. Per your subscriber count, you be having about the same people that watch me. And I have more subscribers than you. So you're doing something right. That's what's up. Oh, yeah, right on, right on. Thank you. Thank you. I try, you know, as, as a whole, I try to have my whole platform try to be solid, you know. So thank you, man. Right on. Hey, you want to come up right now? You can come up and uh, chop it up with, with me and um, OG. You know, I'm trying to have people come up before before I, I, I dip up out of here. We're going to land the plane. <laughs> yeah, pe people like to be entertained, man. They like to sit back and be entertained. So um, it is what it is. Expo. Coming up on 1 o'clock. Coming up on 1 o'clock. Right. <laughs> it, it's so crazy. I remember uh, when he came in the background before, I saw the Sadducees, and I swore up and down. I said, this ain't him. This is Sadducees. And then QB has to say, no, that's him. So, okay. <laughs> I'm about to add Sadducees, which is the vital message. What's up, Sadducees? Oh, I'm doing well, man. Just hanging in there. Um, yeah. Staying up late, but that's where all the fun happens, I guess. <laughs> yeah, man. That's where the fun happens in the devil's hour, the witch, the bewitching hour. Oh, yeah. <laughs> that's where it goes down in the witching hour, man. So, hey, man, she, uh, how did you do on that test? Uh, well, I got to, I get to enjoy my break, so I, I passed him. Oh, that's what's up, man! Shout out to you. Hey, thanks, man. You sound like a, a smart young guy. You wouldn't you wouldn't be this far if you wasn't. So that's what's up. Yeah, it's either that or I'm I'm like stupid in other ways going through all this. <laughs> yeah, man. Well, life is always a balance, man. Oh yeah. Um, export or if we trying to say Lester Solomon exporting capitalism and way of life as more people are americanized yeah well that's always the thing right capitalism versus what i mean what do we want do we want communism over here or at least some type of venezuelan socialism do do we want do we want cuban do we want cuban communism or venezuelan venezuelan socialism what do we want over here man i mean like I'm okay with bringing business there. I just don't want to bring. I don't think they there. know what they want. Right, right. Well, you know, like you say, some things you can you can, you can borrow facets from each, right? But I think we want 70, 75 percent capitalism, right? And, and, and some socialism in there is good. You know, they say like certain facets we have can be considered socialist, like uh. Like what? I guess welfare and food stamps can be considered socialist. Socialism. You know, a yeah. little bit of socialism. Um, contractual rights is technically a socialist idea. That okay. you, to reinforce that you own property and if someone takes it from you, you're reimbursed. Yeah, that's kind of messed up. They should not be able to take it under any circumstances. If it's yours, it's yours. Yeah, yeah, but like if you were a true capitalist anarchistic system, like people would just be able to take it and no one would really be able to stop you. Oh, wow. Wow. Okay. So if you were a true capitalist, then it's like really You'd be an anarchist, dog. really. It's really dog eat dog. Yeah. Oh man. Well, maybe you don't need that. Maybe yeah, we need a, a little buffer of uh, a little <laughs> bit of socialism mixed in there. That sounds crazy. So a tr so you saying in a true capitalist but if you own it, you own it. So wait, you saying in a true? Well, you only really own it if you if you can protect it in a true capitalist system. Wait, wait, wait. You said what? You, you only own it if you can protect it. Yep. Damn. Wait. Well, no, I own it just because I own it. I don't have to protect. It. I own it. I got a deed. My deed is my protection. Yeah, and that's and that's contractual rights, which is if you're going to go technical, it is a socialist idea. Wow. So contractual, wait, 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 wait. So because it but everything is a contract. Wait. So if I if I if we write out a contract, an agreed upon contract that for business and, and we got to go by the contract, that's socialist. That's not capitalism. Yeah. So like let's say we make a deal and I okay. break it. 
the fact right. that you could that you you can take me to court that's that's using public money to to settle out a dispute mm. so it's technically a socialist idea normally it'd be like all right duel fucking kill me for it oh <laughs> whoa wow that's wow. how you so it so any any form any form of the government the city government big government local county government stepping in to provide a service is is uh socialist kind of it's, yeah it's, Te it's, technically yeah they have control. Well, yeah, they have a role. Well, yeah, well, okay. Well, like I say, nothing in this world is 100%. Because even, even China, who's supposed to be communist, they went, they lean very heavy into uh, the business now. Oh, but yeah, everything is controlled by the state. Yeah. Yeah. So what is what what is 100%? I, I think the closest you have to 100% anything, I think uh, North Korea is, a, is down there 100% communist, though. Yeah, but they still got black market un underground when they're starving. <laughs> they gotta yeah, go. Yeah. So that that, capitalism. that's capitalism there. That's yeah. capitalism. So so nothing nothing on this world can ever be one hundred percent anything yeah. because the human condition. So that reminds me yeah. of the Matrix again, of the movie The Matrix. And I said this example before, where uh, Agent Smith told Neil, he said in the first few versions of the Matrix crashed. Because we as machines didn't quite understand the nuance, complexity of, of humanism. Everything was 100% this or that, but the world doesn't work like that. So we had to learn to allow for the variance in there. Yeah. Right. Yeah. Well, and, and something I kind of like, I speculate this, but I think I see capitalism like a fire. You okay. can either have it like, you can even have it burn your state to the ground or you can have it um, grow it and, mm. and fuel it. Fuel and I see it. I see it as something like inevitable that it's it's kind of just a part of the nature and how you manage it is is how I, it's how you function. So like if you try to repress it, people are going to start making deals. People are going to start trying to accumulate wealth somehow. There's going to be a market somewhere. Somewhere. Yeah. You can't kill. You can't kill the beast. At best, you can control it, you can tame it, and if you yeah. neglect it or enrage it, it's going to run crazy, but you can't kill the beast. Yeah, that's what I'm thinking. Mm, interesting, interesting. King Tao says, boss, what's up with the two light-skinned chicks you and Flyboy met in Tulum? Ha! <laughs> yeah, we bring it back to that. Yeah, so real fact, even though me and um, Sadducees is getting on uh, a higher frequency conversation, I'll bring it back down to that. Yeah, everyone so, wants uh, to talk to women. Yeah, it, it all hey, it, it everything comes back around. But yeah, I, I answer that. So um, they, that was that was the the, the, the that should have went differently. So on that one, uh, me and Flyboy, we the first the first night the first full night in Tulum, we went out. We went to different bars and clubs. We ended up in this one bar that was lit. Uh, we ordered a pizza, and we were sitting at the bar. And I don't know how it happened or who came over first, but a little uh, skinny mini, little light-skinned skinny mini girl with a big old poofed-out Angela Davis afro came over to Flyboy and was kind of just flirting and making out with him. And then she invited us over to her group of girls. So it was four girls. It was her, the little skinny mini mini with the, with the afro. And it was a light-skinned uh, chick that was a Puerto Rican, the light-skinned chick. Then it was a white chick, and it was a dark-skinned um, black chick, those four chicks. And those four chicks, they were all turned up. They were from the East Coast. They all knew each other. Most of them, I believe, they were dancers. Uh, they were dancers. They were strippers, and they were from the East Coast. And they were all four was on vacation. So me and Flyboys with these four girls. So Flyboys with the little skinny chick with the afro. And I was with the light-skinned uh, Puerto Rican. And then the white chick and the black chick was there this also. So all four, all six of us was vibing. So at the end of the night, um, the, the, the dark-skinned chick and a white chick hooked up with these two white white guys and went home with them. So, but the perfect situation, then it left the other two, two and two for me and Flyboy. The Puerto Rican I was on and a, and a skinny one with the Afro um, Flyboy was on. But wouldn't you know, our, our two chicks 
followed the other chicks with the white guys. So whatever the hell that was about. So Flyboy is saying, man, that had to be a money situation. They probably went through. He's at the end of the day, in their real life, they're strippers. They're dancers. So, you know, they probably uh, smelled money. They went They went to go make a bag. So, like, wow. But we had the numbers. We had the, conf- the, the, uh, the, the numbers and whatnot. So the next night, we invited them out to the uh, restaurant. Me and Flyboy already had uh, reservations, and we each had a plus one. So even though it was me and Flyboy, we each could have had somebody. So we invited those two. They said they was going to come, and they were messing us, messaging us up to the time of, talking about they were on their way. They never showed up, but they was messaging us, said they was on their way. They never showed up. So that's what happened with that. And then when I was at the restaurant, I met two other chicks at the bar, and I invited the chicks to the table with me and Flyboy. So then we was back four again, and after the restaurant, we went to a few more club, um, few more bars, and um, after going to like two or three bars, then those two chicks eventually, you know, dipped off on it and said, thank you for the night. And they left. So that's what that was about, man. It, it is what it is. These are matrix chicks. These are matrix. Both set funny. Both sets of chicks were from the matrix. Um, and we just happened to meet them there. They were they were on vacation. So that's really the come up. You're going to mostly uh, your, your, your greatest chance is going to be with matrix or european or australian chicks on vacation but then you run into the same thing you're still dealing with matrix chicks the only benefit they're on vacation so hopefully you can catch them in a state where they're ready to turn up and they're ready to let their hair down they're not around their friends and family they're not around their co-workers they're not around their fellow students you know they're there the party with stage what happens there stays there hopefully you can catch them in a good vibe but you're dealing with matrix chicks and they flake like matrix chicks. They drink your drinks. They hang out with you for an hour or two. Okay. Thank, thank you. Thank you. We had a good night and they're gone. So that's what happened. Okay. King Tao. That's what happened. Chicks, matrix chicks are matrix chicks. No matter where you meet them. <laughs> they there to use you. They there to you. They drink, drink up your drinks. Okay. Thank you. We had a good night in Mexico. Same shit could have happened in Chicago. You deal, but like I say, you have a higher chance, but at the end of the day, it's just a chance. Nothing is guaranteed. And the only thing that's 95% guaranteed is pay for play. And even I guess you can probably run across a chick who's gonna probably, but at that point, that's a chick being disingenuous, dishonest. And then you have other problems. So if you have a if you have a pay for play that goes wrong, you have other problems going on. That means the chick she wants your money. And she's gonna try to play you. Columbia Medellin scoping me, right? <laughs> so yeah, if you have problem, if you have problems with a pay for play, that means you really got problems. Because normally, and see, guys don't understand what the pay for play, right? On a short trip, on on, on a four or five days, on one week, even a two week, you ain't there for a month or forty five days. On a short time trip, you there for a limited, a limited short time. You're trying to have fun. You, you have limited time, you pay the money, that money you're paying is, is supposed, in a perfect world, sometimes it don't, but it's supposed to pay for, eliminate certain problems. You don't have to take them out on 50 dates. You ain't got to take them out on, on, on three dates and buy them dinner and buy them drinks and try to get lucky and try to wine and dine them and, and use your charm. Now, yeah, of course, when you do all these extra things with it, that also, you know, it can make it better. But you're not taking them out on dates to wine and dine them or buy them a steak dinner to buy them lobster to buy them drinks and all this to try to use a lot of jokes and try to charm them. You cut through the chase, bam, bam, bam. Uh, you don't have to kind of worry about normally you shouldn't have to worry about them trying to rob you, trying to drug you. Why? Because they're getting upfront value. So it's not like they feel they're giving you something for free and now they got to kind of be sneaky to get a value on the back end. No. I'm giving you value up front for your time. I'm not paying you. I'm not paying you for sex. I'm paying you for your time. You're getting upfront value. That's normally what it's for. So guys have a lot of guys have a wrong misconception when it comes to pay for play. Pay for play serves a purpose, especially when you have limited time. You have limited time in country. Half the time you don't speak the language. So you're not going to sit there and have long philosophical debates about 
quasars and black holes and um and, and Venus and Mars. You don't even speak the fucking language. So you're not going to sit there and talk about the politics of a country. You don't speak the damn language. You know, your whole interaction is through a, a, a translator was already kind of weird and awkward already. So at that point, you're moving more to the physical, right? You're going to say the the, the base, basic minimal just, you know, to kind of vibe, but you're going to quickly transition to the physical aspect. You don't speak the fucking language. You can't sit there and vibe when you don't speak the language. You're only there for a short time. So, yeah, the pay for play comes in, removes a lot of headache, removes taking out all the dates. So there's a time and place for everything. That being said, you want to go the traditional route? You want to go to the, the, the GFE, the non-pro, the civilian route? Then that's a, that's his own set of uh, parameters with that. So it is what it is. So on my short trips, I am down for the calls. I am down to get it over with the boom, boom, bang. I'm not there for two or three weeks. I'm only there for seven to 10 days. I don't speak the language. I don't want to be around you too much. I want to get this over and done with, and I want to get to the next. I want to sample. I'm like a bee flying to flying to different um, flowers trying to sample because I'm only there for a short time. So that's what that's about. But yeah, it would it would it should it should have worked it would, in a perfect world that would have been dope. That would have been dope. The hookup with those chicks from the East Coast stripper chicks from the East Coast. They're on vacation. We're on vacation. Hey, let's vacation together. But no, it went standard Matrix uh, script, movie script. Thank you. Oh, thank you for the date. Thank you for the drinks. Bye. Uh, what you going to do? So I hope I answered your question. Uh, Clifton going places. LOL. In Peru, I had a girl who wanted to chat an extra hour after I was done. Yeah, we, are, we were naked in bed texting each other in the translator. Now, Funny shit in all my travels, I had that too, right? I had the pillow talk. I had the <laughs> pillow talk in text. And it was just it was just the weirdest, cutest little thing in vibe. Um yeah, I had that. When you travel, when you travel a lot, and depending on how you travel, right? Depending I'm I'm in I'm in the I'm in the shit. I'm in the middle of the shit. I'm in the mix. So my travel experience would be weird. If I was to put all of my stuff on YouTube. So I have that. I, I had that happen. Now, that's not the best. I don't try to do that a lot. But messing around like I do, I've been in that situation a couple of times. Because I don't speak the fucking language. I'm going to have sex. We're going to hook up. You're going to be in my room. We're going to bust. We're going to have sex. I don't speak the language. It's going to be a translator. And sometimes it's kind of weird. It's like I've been in that weird situation. You're laying there in the bed. Right. Like, it's so weird. Like, right. Uh. Really, you are you already you already done done the deed, right? So you're both naked, laying right on you, her head on your chest, and just for some physical contact, she'll lay her leg across your leg. She'll lay her leg across your leg, head on the chest. Your heads might be touching. You're looking at each other and you're texting, and it, everything is like a delay, right? It's like a delay, right? You text, send it, read it. Oh, laugh. She texts. It, the weirdest shit, right? You can't make this up. So, yeah. Hey, why don't you just pass the phone over? Well, yeah, we have. Oh no, it, it, something. Okay, okay, funny. Okay, funny. Say, say that. A lot of the times, that's what would end up happening. It'd be my phone. Uh, sometimes it'd be both phones, but a lot of a lot of times, no, that's what it is. Um, I have the the translator on my phone that shows both. Like the top might be English, the bottom mm -hmm. might be their language, and then we're we're doing this. Yeah. The same shit. Yeah. It's kind of washed out. Okay, I see it. Yeah, yeah, yeah. So a lot of times that's what it is. That's literally what it is. To be more exact, I was just trying to just kind of run past it. A lot of times that's exactly what it is. And normally it'd be my phone, right? Yeah. Boom, boom. We're going like this. And she's laying right here. Her leg, her leg is her leg is like across me. Her head might be on my chest. And you know, we just finished the D. It's pillow. Pillow talk instead of say pillow text. Weird as shit, you can't make it up. But these are human interactions. We're not robots, too. At the end of the day, we're not robots, right? Yeah. We're, we're, we're humans. We interact the way we do. The language is the barrier. So the only difference is now we're doing this. 
weird as shit. Weird as shit. Hey, you can't make it up. And sometimes, sometimes that is like the little extra fun that goes with it. Like, like even now, I'm, I'm kind of smiling in my head when I'm thinking back, remembering about it. You know, the cute, the cutie little things that happen. Weirdest shit ever. Weirdest shit. We travel for these experiences. So you guys um, asking me all these questions about these women. We've been talking women all night. I have an educated brother on the panel who's burning the midnight oil, who needs to be sleep. But he pulled up to Big Boss. And a man is soon to be a doctor in a few short years. And he's very smart and very intelligent. And when I go to his panels, I normally don't, um, his live streams, I normally don't comment on the chat. I just be ghosting. I be ghosting your live streams. I be checking you out. Hey, hey yo, I'll do whatever you want. Like, I appreciate that you're tuning in, man. Yeah, man. You be you be having good discuss, good, strong, solid discussions and stuff. You're a uh, very intelligent guy, stuck in medical school, studying to be a doctor. So, duh, you're pretty smart, right? Um, yeah, we were having a good conversation. King Town talk about, hey, man, what's up with those two chicks, man? <laughs> hey, shout yeah. out, hey. That's yeah. what built my channel, man. That's what built the channel. That's my base. That's my base subscribers. I gotta give them raw meat. I gotta give them red meat. Sometimes. Oh yeah, yeah. Like I've, I, I feel that too. Because like lately, I've been bringing on some of these sus. I, I, I don't really trust them. A lot of the, the dating coach type of things. Just kind of tell them. So what, what are you actually teaching these guys that they can't learn from just going out by themselves? And then they, I'm just fatigued from the whole like picking up women topic, man. It's just draining after a while because it's like not that complicated <laughs> yeah it's, but you know what it's never going to go away absolutely yeah the human, con the human condition it's never going away me and you can both die today a hundred years from now it, it's not going away absolutely yeah i was on a but it's funny how it always circles back like you're talking about we're talking about like some some constants in the human condition like that right. you have to consider when making society and then what about those two girls what about the two girls <laughs> what about <Okay>. the two <laughs> and then uh but yeah i had the same thing on a stream we were talking about like the i don't know i was on a stream talking about the possibility of um of like the metaverse and like all the recording of uh everything that you do that they practically can make a virtual copy of you and then maybe if the technology goes up, they can maybe like recreate you and print you out of a printer if the Damn. technology gets good. And then it goes Me? back to how do you pick hey, up man, women? What, what about the hoes, man? <laughs> bro. Can you print me a hoe? <laughs> bro, we're talking about some. Yeah, yeah, I hear you. But what about the hoes, though? Does she have big breasts? <laughs> yeah, yeah. You can't crazy. get away from it, man. A man is a man is a man is a man, man. That's what they want to hear. And, you know, I was talking with a, uh, another. Uh, content creator and he was just you know telling me about you know content creation and getting a lot of views and, and getting a lot of subs and it came back to women on the thumbnail women in the video but more even more that women on the thumbnail women with booty showing booty on the thumbnail uh it's just something about just the primal instinct in men oh, even yeah. on youtube this is YouTube. This is not X video. This is not Pornhub. But even on YouTube, showing women on the thumbnail. It's this basic, it's raw, it's animalistic, it's primal. But guess what? You get a hell of you. It works. It works. <laughs> you can't man. get away from it, man. It's a human condition. Yeah, yeah. I've been like kind of networking in those like crowds that always talking about women, man. But I gain like I've gained like what is it 30 or 40 subs the past like three days for it so it's it's working i guess <laughs> it's going to continue to work it's going to continue to work i'm talking to a guy who has six thousand subscribers and he has five videos i oh, said wow. dude how do you have five videos and six thousand subscribers i have 115 videos and one thousand subscribers with a hundred video a hundred yeah. videos one thousand subscribers you have five videos with 6,000 subscribers, and some of your five videos have 20, 30,000 views. He said, hey, man, you focus on the women. I said, that's that's what guys want. You know, you know it was like um, when I'm looking at the, the dating coach uh, people stuff and this and that, and they talk about, basically they talk about the females. They say, 
what a woman says she wants versus what a woman really go for. You know, they say they want the Prince Charming. They want the guy to open up the doors and 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 they want the white knight. Uh, yeah. But they, that's what they say what they want. But then you look at the guy they actually get. They get the bad boy, the one who talks shit, the one who smack them around. So, okay, fine. That's the females, right? For the guys. So the guys say, oh, man, you guys talk about women. We need to talk about finance. True. We need to talk about investments. True. We need to talk about crypto and investing and building and building up uh, generational wealth and health and fitness. We need to talk about that. We, we need to uh, build up men and we need to talk about uh, men um, building up and, and finance and this and that and that. That's what they say, right? Yeah. But what do they click on? The women. What did it, what did they click on? Can you print me a hoe? Hey, what about those two light skinned girls? Where yeah. the hoes at? <laughs> got a, do she got Pretty a fat bad. ass? Do she get a good much, head? Yeah. Hey, how much? How much she cost? What are you talking yeah, about? Pretty much. You just got there saying we need to talk about men's health and, and, and crypto and investment and this and that. So, you know what I'm saying? Just like the women who say who say what they want in a man, but then you look at what they really have and go for. The men talk all this shit. What do they click on? So, God damn it, you say that's not even your lane for the most part. You take the high road, the philosophical, the intellectual road. But lately, you've been dealing with uh, YouTubers, collabing with YouTubers who focus on the women, who focus on dating and this and that. Just in you doing that in a few days, you didn't got 30, 40 subs. Yep. You keep doing that, you're going to get more subs. So it is what it fucking is, man. It is. Yeah, it is what it is. Yeah, I just, I just think a lot of those guys are are simp's though, because they just talk about, oh, I'm wrecking up my lay count. My whole, my whole life's purpose is in the lay count, man. And I was like, ooh. And like, you're gonna dig in the trash and up that number ten times. Does that really make your life better when you could be getting some baddies, like baddies with the, with the pay to play, or, or getting like some decent chicks, like. Yeah, like other ways, like you know, quality over quantity, man. <laughs> yeah, it's the, it's the age old, it's the age old uh, uh, phenomenon quality over quantity. I'm a guy who believe in balance, like Thanos, yeah. my, like Thanos behind me right there. Balance as all things should be. So, uh, I'll take a whole lot of quality, I mean, a whole lot of quantity, and I would sprinkle it in with quality. Yeah, um, yeah, like the kind of idea. That, like, let's say, let's say that I cook like a Michelin star level of meal right there. Okay, I could show that off. I'm like, you know what? Look what I made. That's delicious right there. That's amazing. You're not doing it every night, but I'm not eating that every time. Like sometimes no. I'm hungry, and and there's a McDonald's right there. I'm not oh. gonna be bragging. Oh, I ate at McDonald's. I ate McDonald's three thousand times, bro. <laughs> that kind of thing. That's kind of how I see it with like a lot of these guys flexing their lay counts or whatever and it's just kind of pathetic man yeah and especially if your lay well yeah especially if your lay count is not quality like i well one i don't brag anyway uh yeah like that but if you are going to show your trace sometimes you know you might want to flex a little just a little flex a little and show a trophy uh she better be a trophy don't flex oh, no yeah. six. don't flex a six nobody wants to see a six why you think I haven't? I mean, I barely want to even talk about the two that I had in play in play of the Carmen. I talk about it. I'm not going to show them. Well, I only have I only have photos of one because one was in a um, massage house, so I won't have. But the one from Tinder, yeah, I, I got her Tinder photos and other photos. I'm not going to show those. That is not <laughs> worth showing. Not a, <laughs> not a, not a pro like. Not like the, the trophy, like, the trophy is like six inches tall, you know, that kind of thing. Right. Yeah, the, the one that, that, yeah. that's hidden in the corner with dust collecting. Is, <laughs> that kind let's of believe it. She was a dime, though. Yeah, I'll kind of show that. I oh, yeah, yeah, yeah. Look what I got, but uh, but even not really too much because then it, you know, then you kind of don't want to really always show. I mean, you can a pay to play one anyway because that's kind of you know. I'm the main pay to play guy, right? So yeah. far, far be it for me to talk against it because that's what I do. But I'm saying far as flexing on that because it's not really a, <laughs> a flex because anybody with that same amount of money could have got it. 
Yeah, you're like, hey, I got it. I got a I know a good deal. I don't want everyone else capitalizing on it. <laughs> that or, or that too. Or that or that too. Or that too. But I mean, well, funny, I wasn't coming from that regard. I'm coming from talking about just bragging and flexing on a pro. Dude, it's a pro. Whatever you pay, the next man could pay. You didn't really have game or anything special to set you apart. You met the the numerical number of money. Yeah. The like next any, man with like that any, amount of anyone money. Can, yeah. Anyone can go to the, the gourmet restaurant and buy, right, yeah, right, buy a right, nice exactly. cut exactly. of meat. But like, can you really like butcher the meat? Can you right. can you cook it? Can you can you make the sauce? Can you do right. all that? Show like, me that same baddie. Show me that same baddie that you got off game only. No money or or or, 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 like, or off of, or, off you, of know, you day, organic. Yeah, organic. you can't win for losing. This shit crazy. But you know what I'm saying. Yeah, I know what you're saying. I know what you're saying. Yeah, 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 yeah. It's the world is the world, man. You know what? Uh, so I still got 25 people. So this is what I'm going to do. I have a number in my head. Minimal. Uh, 25 people. If y'all still watching and that's just not bots or whatever. Boss is about to make a burrito run. If y'all want this live to keep going, I leave OG in charge. So she can stay up as long as he want. OG will run the stream. I hop on my phone. I drive to the burrito truck and keep everything going. If you guys want to see that, <coughs> type a one in the chat. If I don't get enough ones, I'm going to end the stream in the next uh, 10 minutes or so. <laughs> so I can make my burrito one. Last time I did this, I got a few ones. I didn't get enough. People don't think Big Boss mean what he say. When I say something, I'm not like other YouTubers. When I say something, I mean it. If you guys want to see that and keep this going, I want a one. I got 20-something people, so it's a certain number I expect to see. Otherwise, and it's good, I just, and after another five or ten minutes, I bid Sadducees good night. I give OG the last word. I end this, and I'll go get my burrito. So, okay. Hey, so, I, I, keep it, I keep it going. So, um, yeah, so back to what we were talking about, Sadducees. Um, damn. We had, a good, we had a good conversation about to go. Oh, yeah, uh, yeah. Yeah, we talk about the, the capitalism, and you were saying that technically – if uh the court if the if the pub if the public courts had to get involved that's a form of socialism if it was pure capitalism it would be no outside contracts just whatever you own your money and your gun and your rifle you that's have to what it, it man all and your good another company wanted to come you guys would shoot it out pretty much damn straight anarchy at that point all right. All right, Clifton and Egyptian, you got to go. See you next time. Well, thank you for rocking out, man. Thank you for rocking out, Clifton the Egyptian. Um, see you next time, sir. That's what's up. You said you think about three of us in. Well, the counter says 23. Now, you know, I am uh, not to end. You just left 22. The counter said 20 something. <laughs> we, got, we got some ghost watchers, or they fell asleep while watching the stream. And, and yeah. it, hey, but they'll give you that watch time, though. Exactly. Well, I don't need it no more, but yeah. Um, yeah, but so, uh, so how, by how many subscribers do you have now? Uh, 188 now. Okay, 188. Uh, it's it's climbing steadily. Yeah, well, you know the secret sauce. Keep talking yeah, about winning. Yeah, I know, I know the sauce. <laughs> and, and like, I you got to have something original too. Like, I see yeah. a lot of guys just copying trends, and that's just not man. That that's YouTube. That's all I see. And I, I, I feel a way. But at the same time, you know, I, I guess these guys doing what they got to do. But I, I feel a way when I see that, man. It's just a whole lot of copycats. It's kind of like cheating. But, cheating. The, but they but they don't last, though, is the thing. The copycats right. don't last. Like, they might have a video pop for, like, 50,000 views. But then they're but then they'll be the guy with, like, 10 to 20,000 subs. But their streams, are, are, they're, they're, they'll have 10 viewers in their streams. And their videos right. will have, like, 200 views. On the regular, <laughs> right? I be I be seeing that too. I be I be like, wow. Some sometimes some of these YouTubers with with a bigger channel, 
they go live, they might they probably get there 50 people. They might have like 10,000 subscribers and they can't get 50 people to watch their lives. I'm like, what's going on? No, I know. I see some they're their 10k subs and they're getting 20 viewers on their lives. That's ridiculous. Yeah. You get more than that. Like I say, pound for pound sometimes I notice um uh, shout out to you, um uh, Vital Message. Sometimes you have more um viewers than I have. And you don't even have 200 subscribers. Hey, appreciate it, man. I yeah. I've also like plugging this all over the place i've been hopping on streams just smart plugging <laughs> and then uh i got discord so i just i just put it in the server and, and guys there just go. watch it yeah i don't do no external yet i don't i don't um push it out to instagram like i need to facebook like i should have a discord jump on uh reddit and, and reddit posts you know i do none of that mine is just pure from the ground from the mud youtube and um, yeah, so when I finally um, start branching out and start utilizing these other alternative uh, media sources to feed back in, yeah, I just uh, see a, a, a big spike. But right now, it's just <coughs> all pure YouTube. Yeah, yeah. Well, at least you got some original content out there. You got your personality, which people can't replicate. Uh, no, you're bringing you're bringing yeah. options for people. You're not just right. following trends. So and you have to be out there in the field doing it. Yeah, well, you know, pretty much, I think everybody kind of can could, would agree. <laughs> my channel is a personality channel at this point. Uh, if it wasn't for my personality, I don't know what this channel would be. So, good thing, good thing, I was born with this personality. Yeah, but at least, at least, for good or bad, at least it's built on something that's you instead of a lot of these copycats that are just they're just hating on one channel and <laughs> yeah, and trying to leech clout. Right, 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 right. Dang, 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 dang. I don't think we're gonna get it, boss. No, we not. Yeah, hey, so I'm uh, um, the guarantee you're gonna get those burritos, though. Oh, no, that, that, that's going to happen. The only difference, <laughs> was, the only difference was, was I gonna bring you guys with me on the line? No, I'm gonna get it. My thing was uh, where, where I was gonna bring you guys on the line. I'm not getting enough participation, but shout out to the people who uh, who put one. Yeah, we're gonna, I'll go for another 10 minutes because you know, I like things to be even. So when I end the stream, I'll be at 5 30. I'm at 521 now on the time. Yeah, that's Grinding. all it is. Uh, so uh, on, on, on another note, um, Sadducees, uh, have you seen the new Batman movie yet? I have not. Yeah, I'm, I'm going to go see it tomorrow or today. Um, I, I, I actually bought my ticket already online. So my son's seen it. My son, he said out of a 10, he'd give it like a 9. I said, what? Huh. And my son grades hard, kind of. He's he has an old soul. He grades hard. I said, hmm. I said, I said the guy from Twilight? He said, Dad, you got to see it, Dad. I said, that thing is three hours, and it's still oh, good. He said, he said, yeah. He said, I did go to sleep for like 20 minutes. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, that movie. movie. Yeah, it's, it's straight. It's, it's literally 2.58, two yeah, hours, 58 hit minutes. That, hit that bathroom before the the movie starts. Oh, Exactly. Then I can. I like to drink a lot. I get thirsty a lot. I like to drink a lot. So yeah, man, and like, now they're serving beers at the at the movie theater. You gotta you gotta right. really get the bathroom. Right, right, right. Yeah, I got. I got. A, I'm watching a four four p.m. showing. My time four p.m. is three hours. So damn four to seven. Yeah. Um, yeah, that's a, check that's, it out. that's one of my streams, man. <laughs> yeah, that's yeah, that's that's a stream. Yeah, so. Uh, I don't know. Maybe I do a view, but you know, my channel ain't about that. You know, I I can't be doing too much wild stuff. That's almost a trip. Like me, you have a channel, you have your own niche. You got to kind of say you can branch out a little bit. Yeah, yeah. But big boss review of Batman. Is it like, what Negro? You a travel channel? And come to your channel, you hear about no damn Batman movie. <laughs> or you can always <laughs> reference it. You know, you like be right. be Bruce, you could be Bruce Wayne out here. <laughs> you be Bruce Wayne out here, yeah, exactly. <laughs> always bring it back around to travel, and that's why I used to travel. What? How does that make sense? Because if you have a passport, you could be like Batman and fly away, huh? I don't know. There you go. Yeah, right. Too many, Whatever. too many villains in your local club. Get your passport. Get, get out passport. of Gotham City. Go right. meet. Go meet some. <laughs> go meet some. Go meet some. Uh, go meet Catwoman. Yeah, go meet Batman, Catwoman. Huh? Yeah, but she Catwoman. That's not is that on Batman. Yep. Yeah, is I thought that was uh yeah it is yeah. What's the one I'm thinking about? Uh, with Spider Man, the uh, 
female Mary Jane or whatever. No, or no, Mary... she wears something. You got the green like... hornet. Talking about no. the green hornet. What the? the, the oh, Spider Man. It's a woman, man. I know, but she. They have. I think Silver they have a Sable on, or yeah? something. Oh. The green hornet. No. 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 Okay. Ah. It's it's a, it, you know and she might be inspired or oh or, you talking or, about bat you talking about Batwoman yeah okay no yeah no but, but I'm talking about, I'm talking about on Spider Man on Spider Man oh. it's a it's a female um not villain or anti hero I believe huh. I think I know you're talking about um, or, or am I tripping no there's probably one out there there's there's like yeah. a million characters and a all million characters yeah 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 but yeah yeah but the one yeah the one for uh for Batman is Catwoman and Batwoman, Cat and Batwoman. Yeah. But on Spider Man, it was also like a female. Um, oh, uh, she was like an black anti-hero. cat, black huh? cat. I think. Maybe black, I think it's black cat. Maybe uh, let's see. Come on, internet. She's like see. a blonde chick with the black, like le- like leather suit or whatever. You got the black leather suit. Yeah, exactly. Yeah, I know I'm a, not tripping. It's a blonde chick. I think. Usually. Hold on, black cat. I'm Spider Man, Marvel. Yeah. Yep, you're smart. So, uh, want still got this screen going. Boom. Black, black cat, Marvel. That's all I'm gonna put. Boom. See, I know I'm not crazy. I know it's something with Spider Man. See, I know I'm not crazy. Black, yeah, exactly. You are blind? She's Black right? Widow. Black Widow. No, no, it's, it's it literally said right here. It's Black Cat. It's, okay. it's Black Cat. Yeah, but something with, yeah with with Spider Man. Black Cat. Yeah, I know I'm not crazy, but see, but I'm, I'm then I'm thinking about um you said Cat Woman. So you know what? You know how they be kind of um copycatting. So I don't know. I wonder who came first. This black cat or a cat woman from DC. Yeah, similar character type though. Yeah. Right. Yeah. Like the troublemaker. Yeah. Like, with Spider Man. Yeah. I know I, I know I ain't crazy. I mean, it's been years, you know. I'm not really in the comments like that no more. Yeah. With Sp- with Spider Man. Yes, yeah, so you got the black leathers, the black leather suit. Okay, but then he said cat woman, cat woman and black cat with Spider Man. I know I ain't crazy. Right on, man. Yeah, you know your stuff, bro. Yeah, I, I don't. I just remember random details that right. I shouldn't remember. <laughs> <laughs> hey, man. But anyway, I'm about to get up out of here. So, any any last words for you, uh, Sadducees? A vital message. Uh, thanks for having me on. Uh, always a pleasure. Oh uh, um, man, it's all thanks. good. You're, all, you're always bringing love to my channel. I got to bring love back. Yeah, you go. Yeah, you do. You got to. Um, yeah, man. Um. You never, you, I'm just curious, because of the content and, you know, your schooling and whatnot, you never show your face on YouTube, right? No, not publicly. Not publicly. Okay. Like a few people know my face. Okay. Right on, right on. I was just curious. All right, man. Well, man, you keep doing what you're doing. I'm going to keep checking you out. I'm going to keep shouting you out. Whenever I drop the link, you're always good to come up. Only thing, my featured guest do have to cam up if you're featured, but when I drop the link on the panel, anybody come as long as I know it's you, right? But yeah, I trust you. I I, I know it's you. As long as I know it's you. When I drop the link in the panel, you always free to come up, bro. Yeah, I appreciate it, man. I'm gonna drop my email as well, so like you can get me for sure instead of some PP troll. Right, right. <laughs> well, yeah, do it in my uh, in my Instagram, Big Boss Go seven seven seven. Simplest shit in the world, right? Big Boss yeah. Go 777. I just put it in there. All right, cool, cool. All right, man. Well, you have a good night, good morning. Um, whatever. Yeah. What what are you gonna do? What are you gonna do in the day when you wake up or sleep? uh probably clean up a few things and then get right. ready for get ready for a stream. Oh, okay. So you, you you're going live uh today ish, tomorrow, yeah, whatever. Yeah, about um you're you're on the west coast, so it'd be like yeah. two p.m. Pacific, four p.m. central where I am. Okay. So it's gonna be it's it's probably gonna be more chill. It's gonna be more about like learning from your mistakes. You I got go. I got a guest on, so there you go. That should be nice and cool. It'll be I'll a break. It out. It'll be a break from all this this like 
What where the hoes at? Where the hoes at, man? <laughs> can you print me? Can you print me a hoe? <laughs> <laughs> yeah, and I even had like there was a guy I was talking about something, and I guess we were done talking about it and just talking about random things, and some random guy joined the stream and typed in the chat, get to the point, virgins. <laughs> <That> kind of thing. <laughs> it's kind of funny. <laughs> Oh, he joined the chat, not not your panel. No, nah, no, nah. yeah, the chat, the chat. Oh. It's funny. Well, yeah, you can't. Yeah, the, the chat is gonna be wild. So, man. They make me laugh. It's, yeah, it's the chat is gonna be wild. The chat is gonna be the chat. <laughs> yeah, now I, thought, I can't. I now I can't even. Your panel and did all that. I'm like, wow. Yeah, now I can't even tell. Better. Like now I can't even tell because the the chat just goes a million miles per hour, and I'm just like, ah, I, I can't even read it now. Right, right, right. <laughs> yeah, it is. It is what it is. And then, like you say, you be having um thought provoking discussion so depending on what the discussion is on on a um, panel it's going to reflect in the chat oh yeah oh yeah and hey and if you want to have a, a chat that is bipolar which is between deep discussion and where the hose at <laughs> we can maybe get something uh, we can get something set up <laughs> right yeah we definitely could do that yeah our, our chat be real bipolar your people and my people yeah hey, it'd be wow. it'd be it'd be quite the communion Right, quite the communion. Well, all right. Well, thank you, Mr. Sadducees. You have a good day. <laughs> hey, you too, man. All right, peace. Then it was Boss and OG who went all dark on me. What happened over there? Or, or the, oh, the light is out. Oh, and no sound. What's going? What's going on over there? Oh, gee. I don't okay. know why it went dark. Okay. Yeah. I mean, I can flip my light. Well, you know, it's it's all good. Well, if you smile, I don't think I can see it's your teeth. <laughs> <laughs> Damn, you black. Yeah. You say when you in school, Are you black. Yeah, uh-oh. He said it's yeah, that time. <laughs> oh, shit. He said it's that time, y'all. He said it's that time. Then it's not. What's going on? Bringing the plane down. Yeah. Dang. Landing. Yes, sir. Burrito time. Burrito, burrito, burrito. Yes, sir. Any last, any last words, OG? Hey, man. I appreciate the show. Appreciate you having me on. I miss you a few weeks, you know. But hey, it's all good. We back on track now. Man, we back on track. Uh. Only thing I'm going to say, we're going to have a show next week, even though I don't have a a guest yet. Hopefully right, I will. Right. If, I, if I don't, it'll be like tonight. It'll be a Saturday Night Live slash tap in without the guest um, right. next week. But the week after, the 26th, on the 26th, uh, it won't be a show per se. When I, what I will do though, because what's happening on the 26th? What's happening on 26th, boss? On Saturday the 26th, um, guys in my WhatsApp group, uh, the few guys who are in the Oakland Bay area, we're gonna do a, a local meetup and we're gonna go out up to Sacramento and go clubbing. Um, okay. one, of, one of the guys in my group, um, who lives in Oakland, he was on my channel before, he's expats in the dr and he's back here in the bay he's like for a month or so he leaves in a few weeks so before he goes back to live in the dr while he's out here in the bay a bunch of us in the area we're all gonna um team up and we're gonna go hit up some clubs and bars and sat but what i plan to do right. is hit uh mobile live a couple times I'm, I'm, I'm gonna work that out because it is it, 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 it's gonna be a saturday night and it won't be the regular live me here in the studio. It, that'd be a big blank. But while I'm out and about with my phone, I'll try to go live a couple times, you know, kind of spotty, whatever. It's going to be music, obviously. So maybe I might have to turn the volume all the way down and just show the phone where I'm at with the guy, hanging out with the guys and the girls in the club or whatever. And we plan a house about three or four. It's going to be a whole little night. Um, so i'm doing that on a saturday night so that night it won't really be our classic live uh it's going to be kind of sporadic me doing a whatever when i can while i can or what not gotcha. i don't know yeah but that's the week after next so we still got next week we got next week 
but the week after that is, i'm gonna be doing that so yeah but other than that man um you say your last words was you missed me for a, a few weeks you're back on yes, track sir. Sir. but what it is right now what is it right now <laughs> what is it right now Hey, boss, I'm a boss, big boss, hey, boss, big boss, big boss, and you know it's real talk, you know it's real talk, what the fuck you thought, you get caught up in the cross, fucking around with a boss, it's a boss, I'm a boss. Hey, I'm a boss, and you know it's real talk. Chilling with OG, OG here with me, and you all see. Yes, I'm B I G. Hey, biggity, 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 iggity, Bossolini, cooking with gasolini. Hey, you know what it is? Big boss, co pilot OG, rocking from California, north and south. You know what it is. That's what it's about. Thank you, OG, for rocking out with Barcelona. We about to land this plane. Thank you for flying with airline, big boss. Recline your seat back up, upright position. Put the tray up. Make sure you buckled in. Make sure your stuff is secure above your head. Be advised, stuff could have changed throughout the flight. We bought the land. Yeah, unplug the ears and all that. And uh, thank you for flying the Big Boss Airways. Big Boss and OG bid you all a good night. That's what it is. Boss Change your clocks me. back. Change your clocks back. Change Set them up. Your Set your clocks back. up. Set them up. Set them up. Move them up. That's what it is. So, it says 12.45. Is it really? Is it? Did it go back? The phone goes up. Did it automatically, though, right? Yeah, it probably will. It'll probably do it. My computer is still saying 12, 12 something, too, but it'll, it'll catch up. Right. Well, that's what it is. We vibing out. We're vibing out. We're rocking out. Big Boss and OG. That's what it is. Thank you guys for coming out. Set your clocks back. Um, shit. Set them up. Put Set them up. Stuff this week. But definitely next Saturday for sure. Saturday night live slash tap in. <laughs> I'm working Friday nights. It won't really be a Friday tap in, but I will be here next week, Saturday night. Peace, guys. All right, OG. See ya. Hey. Then it was Barcelona. 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 Yeah, you see me. And just like that. Just like that. A Thanos snap.